Thunder and lightning flashed in the air, and a sea of thunder emerged. In the void under the examination platform, a large amount of lightning also rose up. Lelan's wings spread out, killing intent boiled over. Lin Moyu was so keen on murderous intent, he instantly sensed the opponent's murderous intent. He knew that Lelan himself had slipped up and said something he shouldn't have said. Even if he promised that he would not tell it, Lin did not fully believe it. If you want to keep it secret, the dead are the safest. It was going to break the rules and kill itself. There was killing intent in Leyland's eyes, I thought about it, and now I'll give you two choices. The first choice, I will kill you. Second choice, you stay here forever. Lin Moyu chuckled, these two choices are like farting, they stink. Lin Moyu didn't look scared at all, but said calmly, aren't you afraid of the punishment in Dragon King Palace? Lelan shook his head, it's not important anymore, and I have a reason to kill you. This sentence has already shown its determination, and it doesn't even care about punishment. Lin Moyu said, actually, I haven't heard anything. I'm a soft-spoken person. Even if I tell it, no one will believe it. Lelan still shook his head, you don't understand, there are some things I can't say, and you can't listen. Lin Moyu really doesn't understand, he doesn't understand why these things can't be said. It's not that outside the world, there may be other human race worlds. Isn't that the same thing, there is nothing to say. It can be seen from Lelan's appearance that Yipping contains a lot of secrets. Lelan said in a deep voice, don't waste time, there are only two choices, you choose. That being the case, Lin Moyu's attitude also became tough, I will choose neither and you may not be able to kill me. Can't kill you? These words were simply a joke to Lelan. It's not as simple as crushing an ant to kill a level 70 human race professional with a god-level thunder dragon. It naturally wouldn't believe Lin Moyu's words, and when it was about to make a move, it suddenly trembled and froze on the spot. Lin Moyu is holding a scale in his hand, and the scale has complicated lines. This is the dragon scale that Antares gave to Lin Moyu. When in danger, Lin Moyu can activate it to return to Antares. The moment Lelan saw the dragon scale, his whole body began to tremble. Why do you have this thing? Now it looks like a chicken that has been strangled, unable to move. Lin Moyu laughed, Do you still think you can kill me now? Lelan fell into silence, and his murderous aura gradually dissipated. The answer has already been revealed. Lin Moyu holds the dragon scale in his hand, like holding a gold medal for life-saving. There are many secrets in this world. I have seen the spirits left by professionals in the previous era. I have seen half-step super-gods who are about to break through the level and escape from death. No the super-god is handsome, the half-step super-god is the legion. I have seen the existence of that forever sitting in the world, I have chatted with it, and heard many stories. Every time Lin Moyu said, Lelan would tremble uncontrollably, and the electric snake on his body would make a hissing sound. What Lin Moyu tells is a secret. But it's not clear. Lin Moyu said there are some truths and some falsehoods. Some are information analyzed by Antares himself. The true and the false are blended together to form an illusion that I actually know a lot. By Yuan's old profession is cheating, and Lin Moyu's profession is cheating. Usually talk very little, flickering. Lin Moyu said, Look, I know so many secrets, but what you said is nothing. Isn't it just some things in the multiverse, it's really nothing. I won't tell the outside world, it won't do any good, and no one will believe it. Lin Moyu spoke very sincerely, and the real and the fake were mixed together, making it difficult for Lin Moyu to distinguish. Lelan seemed to be persuaded, hesitantly said, Really? You promise not to say anything? Although the giant dragon is powerful, it seems that its head is really not working well. Lin Moyu struck while the iron was hot, well, I won't lie to you. And in exchange, I can tell you a secret about me. Lelan asked, what? Lin Moyu said, actually, I am immune to electric elements, so you want to kill me. Lelan's eyes showed disbelief, elemental immunity. There are very few people in the human race who have this ability, and you actually have it. If you don't believe me, you can try it. Seeing this, Lelan shot a bolt of lightning and landed on Lin Moyu. 
Lin Moyu let the lightning pass through his body without realizing it. Really immune? Lelin sent out several more lightning attacks, each time becoming more powerful. But Lin Moyu still didn't feel it. He just stood there, motionless, allowing you to attack. After some attempts, Lelin finally believed. With electric elemental immunity, it is really not easy to kill Lin Moyu. Lilin was fooled by Lin Moyu again unknowingly. It only saw that Lin Moyu was immune to electric elements, but forgot Lin Moyu's level. If Lelin's power is fully activated, it is possible to kill the opponent with a simple physical attack. Of course, this is only for ordinary professionals. It's much worse to shoot Lin Moyu to death. So Lin Moyu is still true and false, talking with Lelin in a semi-guided manner. Lelin has completely fallen into it, and its killing intent has completely disappeared. From the bottom of my heart, it felt that it couldn't kill Lin Moyu. But after thinking about it, I felt something was wrong, as if something was missing. Lin Moyu, put away the dragon scales, okay, let's just pretend it never happened. You didn't say anything, and I didn't hear anything. Let's conduct the assessment according to the rules. Reminded by Lin Moyu, Lelin's thoughts were interrupted. Lin Moyu redirected the topic to the assessment, preventing Yi Lin from thinking about other things. As expected, Lelin took the tick, let's start the assessment, let me tell you about the rules of the assessment. There are only two requirements for the second test. One is to come here, and the other is to persist for ten minutes under my attack. My attack will remain between level 80 and 83, which is a leapfrog challenge for you. You should also know that after level 80, the attributes will increase faster. But you are immune to electric elements, even if I hit a god-level attack, it will be ineffective against you. So for this assessment, we'll just pretend. What Lin Moyu wanted was this result, okay, let's put on a show. As for acting, he is an old actor. Both sides tacitly agreed, and the assessment began in a strange atmosphere. Raise the shield as usual, enclosing the entire examination site. Then Lai Lin spewed out the breath of the dragon, and the examination field suddenly turned into a sea of thunder. Thunder roared, deafening. A sea of thunder covered the world, swallowing Lin Moyu like a catastrophe. Whether you look at it with your eyes or sense it with your spirit and soul, Lei Hai is extremely powerful, and has reached the limit of level 83. For a level 70 professional, in the face of this level of attack, Tian will be instantly killed to scum. In the Sea of Thunder, the actors Lelin and Lin Moyu stared wide-eyed. Lin Moyu is even a little playful. The lightning passed through the body without causing any damage. At this moment, Lelin also completely believed that Lin Moyu was immune to electric elements. It is completely immune to elements, and there are very few people who can reach this level. It seems that only the thunder of the law. Lelin looked at Lin Moyu, his thoughts churning like waves but its mouth was firmly closed, and it dared not say any more. There are many wrong words, many wrong things have been said before, if it is spread, the impact will be not small. Now it can only choose to believe Lin Moyu, hoping that Lin Moyu will not spread his wrong words to the doctor. Lin Moyu seemed to guess what it was thinking now, and gave it a reassuring look. The ten-minute assessment time passed quickly, and Lei Hai disappeared. In the assessment field, Lin Moyu was calm and calm. Lelin coughed lightly, passed the second test, now you can choose to continue the assessment or leave with your reward. If you choose to continue the assessment, the reward will be doubled if you succeed, and all rewards will be lost if you fail, and your life may even be in danger. Now you have a choice. It didn't specifically say what the reward was, nor did it say how difficult the next test was. Like guessing a mystery, Lelin just started out, without any specific details. This is the rule of the dungeon. To choose in the unknown is more of a torture for yourself. Lin Moyu didn't hesitate, I chose to continue. And Terry's hasn't got the dragon ball yet, so how could he quit, there is only one way to go. Lelin said, are you sure? In fact, the rewards are pretty good now. The reason why Lin Moyu can pass this level smoothly is that Lin Moyu has the characteristic of immunity to electric elements. It was not passed by virtue of strength. 
The next level is even more difficult. Lin Moyu, who is only level 70, may not be able to pass it. Lin Moyu was very sure, I'm sure, let's go on. Lelin didn't persuade the second sentence. According to the rules, it shouldn't even say the previous sentence. Oh well. It issued a dragon chant, resounding through the copies. There are stairs again behind the examination platform. The stairs lead to the clouds, giving people a sense of the sky. The ladder is still 100 steps, and the last part has been hidden behind the clouds, and it is impossible to see what is going on above the ladder. Having already experienced it twice, Lin Moya knows the test of the third level, first of all, this hundred-step ladder. Lin Moyu walked past Lelin and said softly, I will keep my mouth shut. Lelin breathed heavily, thank you dash dot. Lin Moyu chuckled and said nothing. Come to the stairs and see the void on both sides. There are also layers of clouds and mist in the void, and it looks calm and nothing can be seen. Then he stepped up the stairs. The stairs lighted up slightly, and a beam of light shot out from the stairs and penetrated into Lin Moyu's body. The bone armor did not produce any reaction, indicating that the light was not aggressive. Beginning with mastering the bone armor, the bone armor responds naturally to danger 99.9% .9 of the time. The number of failures is only one or two in Lin Moyu's memory. Bone armor is still trustworthy. The light entering the body did not cause the bone armor to respond, so it should be harmless at present. But Lin Moyu still had an eye and became vigilant. Since it is an assessment, it is impossible for this light to be useless, and it must have its meaning of existence. But what is it? The power of the soul traveled through the whole body in an instant like running water, Lin Moyu tried to find the light that entered the body. Soon, the light that entered the body was found by him. After Lin Moyu obtained the property of being immune to poisonous elements, his physical body became pure and flawless and anything that did not belong to his body would be considered toxins. Coupled with the huge power of the soul controlling the entire body, any foreign objects can't escape my induction. In a remote corner of the body, Lin Moyu found the light entering the body. A small spot of light exudes a faint divine aura. It didn't look harmful, it just stopped there quietly, motionless. It is precisely because of this that the risk armor did not respond. Lin Moyu thought about it, but did not expel it. This may also be a part of the assessment. If they are expelled now, I don't know what impact it will have on the next assessment. But Lin Moyu did not relax his vigilance, but monitored it, and if he found something wrong, he could destroy it at any time. After staying for a few seconds, Lin Moyu stepped up again. Every time you take a step, a beam of light will shoot into your body, and the light spot in your body will gradually grow longer. Lin Moyu didn't seem to react on the surface, but in fact he had already become vigilant. On the assessment platform of the second level, Lelin also stared at Lin Moyu with thought in his eyes. Now it can only be pinned on Lin Moyu, don't go to the outside world to talk nonsense. Among the clouds, Ellie and other four giant dragons landed. The green dragon Jeevas asked first, Brother Lelin, did he pass the test? Lelin nodded, passed. They were in the clouds before, and probably saw the assessment process. The distance was too far, and the conversation between Lin Moyu and Lai Lin was not heard. Ali said, looking at him, he seemed very relaxed. Lelin hummed, this human race is unusual, and it's unusual. Jeeva said in a muffled voice, why do you say that, isn't it a human race, what's so unusual about it? Brother Lelin, you're not letting the water go. Lelin snorted, water, you bastard, he is immune to electric elements. Several giant dragons showed shocked expressions. A.I. Li was thoughtful, no wonder, it's really surprising that there are such human races in this small world. Lelin said, yes, the human race was originally a big family with countless geniuses. But there are not many like him. Ellie said in a deep voice, perhaps, he has a chance. The eyes of several giant dragons fell on Ellie one after another, and Ellie said, This is just my feeling. Lelin exhaled thunder and lightning, I have the same feeling, maybe he has a chance. Jeevas snorted, If that's the case, that's the best. Then I will teach him a lesson. 
Leland glared at him, don't talk big, maybe you were taught by him. Impossible. Klaus yelled, not believing it at all. We'll know when the time comes. Lin Moyu walked to a high place step by step, passed through the clouds, and came to the end of the stairs. At the end of the stairs is also a huge examination platform. It's just that after the examination platform, there is no longer a void, but a palace appears. The palace is magnificent and huge, more than a thousand meters high, and its width and depth are even more unknown. Thick clouds and fog obscured its real appearance. Is this the Dragon King Palace? Lin Moyu thought in his heart, the name of the dungeon is, Dragon King Palace, so could this palace be the Dragon King Palace itself? One more step to step onto the examination platform of the third level, but Lin Moyu stopped at this moment. At this time, the light spot on the body has changed from the size of a grain of rice to the size of a fist, and has grown dozens of times. It still looks harmless, but Lin Moyu doesn't believe it's useless. If there is any problem, it should explode the moment he steps on the examination platform. Lin Moyu looked dignified and muttered to himself, There are two choices, what should I do? One is to drive it away. The second is to let it explode in the body, not knowing what will happen, and Lin Moyu is not sure. This ball of light stays in the body, like a time bomb. When it explodes, I don't know what will happen. Whether it was good or bad, he couldn't tell. If he is driven away, Lin Moyu doesn't know what impact it will have on the entire assessment. If he is judged to have failed the assessment, how can he complete what Antares told him to do? After thinking for a few seconds, Lin Moyu decided to keep the light ball in his body. The huge soul power has locked it firmly, even if there is any problem, it can be dealt with immediately, and Lin Moyu has confidence in his skills and talent, it is not easy to kill himself. With a decision, Lin Moyu finally stepped onto the examination platform. The moment it stepped onto the examination platform, the entire examination platform lit up instantly, releasing a dazzling light. A dragon chant sounded in his ears, and what made him feel weird was that he heard the breath of light elements from the dragon chant. Then a large number of light elements rushed towards the body, and the light cluster in the body now became a guiding light, leading the light elements in. The skeleton armor still didn't respond, and the incoming light didn't do any harm to him. The upper limit of light element resistance is increased by 1%. Get the power of light, experience gained. Get the power of light, experience gained. Suddenly, inching prompts to jump out. The upper limit of light elemental resistance has been increased. At the same time, a large number of light elements were transformed into soul power, poured into his soul, and brought him a lot of experience. The conversion speed of light elements is very fast, and there are light clusters in the body, they have clear goals. The incoming light elements are like raging waves, one wave after another. As the power of the soul rises, the experience increases rapidly. The stairs lead to the clouds, giving people a sense of the sky. The ladder is still 100 steps, and the last part has been hidden behind the clouds and it is impossible to see what is going on above the ladder. Having already experienced it twice, Lin Moyu knows the test of the third level, first of all, this hundred-step ladder. Lin Moyu walked past Lelin, and said softly, I will keep my mouth shut. Lelin breathed heavily, thank you dash dot. Lin Moyu chuckled, and said nothing. Come to the stairs, and see the void on both sides. There are also layers of clouds and mist in the void, and it looks calm and nothing can be seen. Then he stepped up the stairs. The stairs lighted up slightly, and a beam of light shot out from the stairs and penetrated into Lin Moyu's body. The bone armor did not produce any reaction, indicating that the light was not aggressive. Beginning with mastering the bone armor, the bone armor responds naturally to danger 99.9% .9 of the time. The number of failures is only one or two in Lin Moyu's memory. Bone armor is still trustworthy. The light entering the body did not cause the bone armor to respond, so it should be harmless at present. But Lin Moyu still had an eye and became vigilant. Since it is an assessment, it is impossible for this light to be useless, and it must have its meaning of existence. But what is it? The power of the soul traveled through the whole body in an instant like running water. 
Lin Moyu tried to find the light that entered the body. Soon, the light that entered the body was found by him. After Lin Moyu obtained the property of being immune to poisonous elements, his physical body became pure and flawless, and anything that did not belong to his body would be considered toxins. Coupled with the huge power of the soul controlling the entire body, any foreign objects can't escape my induction. In a remote corner of the body, Lin Moyu found the light entering the body. A small spot of light exudes a faint divine aura. It didn't look harmful, it just stopped there quietly, motionless. It is precisely because of this that the risk armor did not respond. Lin Moyu thought about it, but did not expel it. This may also be a part of the assessment. If they are expelled now, I don't know what impact it will have on the next assessment. But Lin Moyu did not relax his vigilance, but monitored it, and if he found something wrong, he could destroy it at any time. After staying for a few seconds, Lin Moyu stepped up again. Every time you take a step, a beam of light will shoot into your body, and the light spot in your body will gradually grow longer. Lin Moyu didn't seem to react on the surface, but in fact he had already become vigilant. On the assessment platform of the second level, Lelan also stared at Lin Moyu with thought in his eyes. Now it can only be pinned on Lin Moyu, don't go to the outside world to talk nonsense. Among the clouds, Ellie and other four giant dragons landed. The green dragon Jeevas asked first, Brother Lelan, did he pass the test? Lelan nodded, passed. They were in the clouds before, and probably saw the assessment process. The distance was too far and the conversation between Lin Moyu and Lai Lin was not heard. Ali said, looking at him, he seemed very relaxed. Lelan hummed, this human race is unusual, and it's unusual. Jeeva said in a muffled voice, why do you say that, isn't it a human race, what's so unusual about it? Brother Lelan, you're not letting the water go. Lelan snorted, water, you bastard, he is immune to electric elements. Several giant dragons showed shocked expressions. A.I. Li was thoughtful, no wonder, it's really surprising that there are such human races in this small world. Lelan said, yes, the human race was originally a big family with countless geniuses. But there are not many like him. Ellie said in a deep voice, perhaps, he has a chance. The eyes of several giant dragons fell on Ellie one after another, and Ellie said, this is just my feeling. Lelan exhaled thunder and lightning, I have the same feeling, maybe he has a chance. Jeevas snorted, if that's the case, that's the best. Then I will teach him a lesson. Lelan glared at him, don't talk big, maybe you were taught by him. Impossible. Klaus yelled, not believing it at all. We'll know when the time comes. Lin Moyu walked to a high place step by step, passed through the clouds, and came to the end of the stairs. At the end of the stairs is also a huge examination platform. It's just that after the examination platform, there is no longer a void, but a palace appears. The palace is magnificent and huge, more than a thousand meters high, and its width and depth are even more unknown. Thick clouds and fog obscured its real appearance. Is this the Dragon King Palace? Lin Moyu thought in his heart, the name of the dungeon is, Dragon King Palace, so could this palace be the Dragon King Palace itself? One more step to step onto the examination platform of the third level, but Lin Moyu stopped at this moment. At this time, the light spot on the body has changed from the size of a grain of rice to the size of a fist, and has grown dozens of times. It still looks harmless, but Lin Moyu doesn't believe it's useless. If there is any problem, it should explode the moment he steps on the examination platform. Lin Moyu looked dignified and muttered to himself, there are two choices, what should I do? One is to drive it away. The second is to let it explode in the body, not knowing what will happen, and Lin Moyu is not sure. This ball of light stays in the body, like a time bomb. When it explodes, I don't know what will happen. Whether it was good or bad, he couldn't tell. If he is driven away, Lin Moyu doesn't know what impact it will have on the entire assessment. If he is judged to have failed the assessment, how can he complete what Antares told him to do? After thinking for a few seconds, Lin Moyu decided to keep the light ball in his body. The huge soul power has locked it firmly, even if there is any problem, 
it can be dealt with immediately, and Lin Moyu has confidence in his skills and talent, it is not easy to kill himself. With a decision, Lin Moyu finally stepped onto the examination platform. The moment it stepped onto the examination platform, the entire examination platform lit up instantly, releasing a dazzling light. A dragon chant sounded in his ears, and what made him feel weird was that he heard the breath of light elements from the dragon chant. Then a large number of light elements rushed towards the body, and the light cluster in the body now became a guiding light, leading the light elements in. The skeleton armor still didn't respond, and the incoming light didn't do any harm to him. The upper limit of light element resistance is increased by 1%. Get the power of light, experience gained. Get the power of light, experience gained. Suddenly, Inching prompts to jump out. The upper limit of light elemental resistance has been increased. At the same time, a large number of light elements were transformed into soul power, poured into his soul, and brought him a lot of experience. The conversion speed of light elements is very fast, and there are light clusters in the body, they have clear goals. The incoming light elements are like raging waves, one wave after another. As the power of the soul rises, the experience increases rapidly. Experience plus asterisk asterisk. The upper limit of light element resistance is increased by 3%. As the light cluster exploded, the light elements from the outside world seemed to lose their target and stop pouring in. Lin Moyu also received the last message. At this time, it was glowing with an upgraded light. In less than two minutes, Lin Moyu completed the leap from level 70 to level 71. All the influx of soul power, Lin Moyu received it as it was ordered, without leaving a trace. In fact, Lin Moyu doesn't pay much attention to the level. If he upgrades from level 70 to level 71, if he goes to the dungeon by himself, it will probably only take a few days. This wave of assessment is just saving a few days for myself, it's nothing. The key is the improvement of light element resistance. His resistance to light elements has reached 100% impressively, and he has achieved immunity to light elements. After being immune to poisonous elements and electric elements, I am also completely immune to light elements. I can't help but feel a little excited. Made money. Lin Moyu thought to himself, this wave is really profitable. The assessment platform is still shimmering with light. Lin Moyu can clearly feel the light elements dancing here happily. Nationalization. This is a sea of light elements, and there are no other elements except light elements. All other elements were expelled by inexplicable forces. The power that can expel elements is at least high level god level. Only the law can do that. Feel eyes on yourself. In the center of the assessment platform, a huge dragon with a whole body glowing was looking at him. It was observing Lin Moyu with curiosity in its eyes. Lin Moyu is also observing it, and it is somewhat different from the dragons he has seen before. Its body shape is larger than the giant dragons seen before, especially its body length is amazing, even a little exaggerated. Compare it with the Lelin you just met. Its body was at least twice as long as Lelin's, and there was a thick and long tail behind it. Its appearance is obviously different from that of a giant dragon but it is still a giant dragon, without a doubt. It's special. Lin Moyu thought in his heart, the giant dragon in front of him gave Lin Moyu a very special feeling, different from other giant dragons. Little guy of the human race, you are very good. The dragon said. He didn't show any hostility towards Lin Moyu, there seemed to be a little bit of friendliness. Lin Moyu will not let down his vigilance because of this, and maintain proper politeness in his words neither humble nor overbearing, thank you for the compliment, what's your address? The giant dragon spit out a ball of light, which spread out in the air and turned into smoke. Then it sucked again, sucking in a large amount of light clusters. Too many light elements were sucked in, and they gathered into mist, which was then spit out by it. Watching the whole process, a word popped up in Lin Moyu's mind, swallowing clouds. This scene is inexplicably familiar. The dragon said slowly, My name is Xinguang, the sacred dragon. What about you? It is very polite, Lin Moyu also introduced himself, Lin Moyu of the human race, the occupation is the undead holy king. 
Xinguang swallowed again, you can absorb all the power of the soul, just now, and even raised it to a level. It seems that your soul is at a very high level. Level 71, then it will be a little easier for you to pass my assessment. Lin Moyu analyzed that upgrading in the dungeon does not affect the difficulty of the assessment. In other words, the difficulty of the assessment was determined before he entered the instance. Lin Moyu said, Excuse me, Your Excellency Xinguang, what is the third test? Xinguang swallowed again, and it seemed to say, The third level, it's actually very simple. See this palace behind? The palace is very huge, how could it not be seen, and it is not blind? Xinguang continued, As long as you can enter the palace, you will pass the examination. Enter the palace? Lin Moyu looked over, the palace was huge, at least a thousand meters high, and I don't know how deep it was. The front door of the palace is open, and the inside of the palace can be seen vaguely. He is now about five kilometers away from the palace, and if he flies there at his fastest speed, it will take about six seconds. But Lin Moyu has a faster method, two seconds is enough. It's just that the holy light will definitely stop him. The key issue is not the past, but how to break through the holy light. Lin Moyu asked, no matter what method is used? Xinguang nodded, yes, no matter what method you use. Lin Moyu said, how much force will you use? Xinguang glanced at Lin Moyu, according to the rules, it will not exceed level 85. But I am a holy dragon, and my strongest ability is defense. Lin Moyu said, is there a time limit? Of course, because you are a human race, I make an exception and give you 24 hours, is that enough? Xinguang obviously has great confidence in itself, and it feels that it is impossible for Lin Moyu to break through its defense. Lin Moyu also knows that if you really can't break through, let alone 24 hours, even if you give 240 hours, 2400 is the same. In that case, let me try. Xinguang swallowed again, you can start any time. It looked casual, as if full of confidence in itself, and it also put pressure on Lin Moyu invisibly. Lin Moyu took a deep breath, knowing that Xinguang, the holy dragon, must be at least level 96 or higher. If it stops it with all its strength, it is impossible for itself to have a chance. The only chance is that it can only exert power no higher than level 85. At the same time, Xinguang also made it clear that his most powerful defense is defense. It means that it may use its own body to block it. And its body. Even if you stand still and let Lin Moyu hit it, Lin Moyu probably won't be able to break through its defense. Lin Moyu thought for a few seconds, and then he had an idea in his mind. Currently, the opportunity is the greatest. There is no air ban effect here, and Lin Moyu can fly. All the restrictions have been lifted. What he has to do now is to try his best to enter the palace and pass the assessment. With a thought, a large number of headless horsemen appeared in the air. As soon as the headless horsemen appeared, he launched a dashing skill towards the holy light. At the same time, a headless horseman appeared in front of Lin Moyu, and Lin Moyu sat on the horse of the headless horseman instantly. The headless horseman took Lin Moyu and launched a dashing skill in the direction of the palace. Rushing towards the palace at a speed of 3,000 meters per second, it only takes two seconds to rush into the palace. Lin Moyu was like a ray of light, crossing the holy light, but the holy light didn't seem to respond at all. The palace instantly magnifies in front of the eyes, and after 1.5 seconds, the palace is close at hand. Suddenly, the light in front of his eyes brightened, and a protective shield similar to an enchantment appeared in front of him. Bump. It's so close, it's impossible to give up halfway. With a heartbeat, the rush skills kept hitting him. Targeting the barrier, the headless horseman unleashes the strongest attack. There was a loud bang, and the result was that it remained motionless. The headless horseman seemed to have been severely injured and a huge rebounding force swept it back, along with Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu flew upside down for nearly a thousand meters before he stabilized in the air. The force bounced back by the barrier is about twice that of the headless horseman's impact. This reminded Lin Moyu of the green grassland with rebounding properties. 
This enchantment also has the same attribute. Looking around, at this moment, the entire examination platform was shrouded in an enchantment. The enchantment is a big bowl turned upside down on the examination table. The holy dragon, Xinguang, didn't move at all, just stood there with a playful smile in his eyes. Lin Moyu originally planned to let the headless horseman restrain it, and then took the opportunity to rush into the palace, by himself. But the holy dragon only used a defensive skill to trap itself, and didn't get entangled with the headless horseman at all. It itself did not move. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and he didn't waste time on it. As long as it doesn't move, Lin Moyu doesn't intend to move it. The headless horsemen turned their targets one after another and flew towards it in all directions. Lin Moyu came to the edge of the barrier, pressed his hand on the barrier, and felt the energy flow in the barrier. This is an enchantment generated by skills, which is different from the enchantment of the abyss. What flows inside is light elements, and there is a strange breath. After careful induction, Lin Moyu realized that this is the breath of law. Xingguang used the law and combined light elements to create this enchantment. But it is controlled very cleverly, and the power level is very high, but the upper limit of power does not exceed level 85. Lin Moyu can't say anything about it. Xingguang only said that it would not exceed level 85, but did not say that it would not use the law. With the addition of laws, the enchantment in front of me looks like level 85, even if a god-level powerhouse comes, it may not be able to break it. It's no wonder that Xingguang looked confident, not afraid of Lin Moyu rushing over suddenly. The breath of law. Lin Moyu muttered to himself. Xingguang looked at Lin Moyu, that's right, it was discovered. There is confidence in the words, as if to say, although you can see it, so what, it can't be broken. Xingguang's tone was very flat, but it was a bit harsh in Lin Moyu's ears. It already lay down lazily and closed its eyes. Lin Moyu looked at him without saying a word, but he had an idea in his heart. The headless horseman tried a lot, no matter how powerful the attack was, it would eventually be bounced back with twice the force. Xingguang said that its strongest is defense. It is estimated that this silk law has the characteristic of rebound. There are many kinds of rules and various magical abilities. It is not surprising to have the characteristics of rebound. Putting away the headless horseman, Lin Moyu came to the place closest to the gate of the palace. At this time, he was only two steps away from the entrance of the palace, and there was a layer of pure white barrier between him, making it difficult to pass. Lin Moyu put his hand on the barrier and said softly, It is said that only the law is against the law. Then let the laws break the laws. The target has locked onto the enchantment in front of him, and a drop of green blood essence appeared in his hand. The blood essence of the poisonous god also contained a breath of law. Although the poison god is not a high-level god, he has already touched the realm of a high-level god, so there is a trace of law in his blood. If there were no accidents, if the god of poison was given a period of time, it would definitely become a high-level god. The law contained in a drop of blood essence is very weak, but the law in the barrier is also not strong. In order to control the power, the holy dragon, Xingguang, injected extremely limited laws into the enchantment. But the corpse burst skill can amplify the power of blood essence by 16 times, and the laws inside will also be amplified. The detonation of a drop of blood essence is equivalent to a blow from the poisonous god. When Lin Moyu took out the blood of the poisonous god, the sacred dragon opened its eyes at the same time, and it sensed the breath of law. A look of shock appeared in the huge dragon's eyes. Then it saw a flash of green light, and a gap appeared in the barrier it had set up. The gap is filled with green air, full of poison. Lin Moyu walked through the gap, ignoring the poison as nothing, and stepped into the gate of the palace in two steps. Lin Moyu stood inside the gate of the palace, nodded towards the holy light, I passed. In a blink of an eye, the holy light had already appeared in front of him. The speed was so fast that Lin Moyu didn't even see how he moved. This made Lin Moyu feel vigilant again. After all, the opponent is a sacred dragon, an extremely powerful existence. He secretly held the dragon scale of Antares in his hand, and immediately dodged if there was something wrong. 
Xinguan lowered his head and stared at Lin Moyu. The dragon's eyes showed shock and confusion. How did you do it? Before Lin Moyu could answer, Xinguan continued, Forget it, you don't need to answer. It's impolite to inquire about other people's skills. Although you used foreign objects just now, I also said that you can use any means. So this level counts as you have passed. Now I give you two choices, one is to continue, and the other is to leave with the reward. I can tell you what this reward is. I can give you ten soul crystals, each of which contains pure soul power. It can help you improve your soul level, and at the same time give you a lot of the calendar of the soul. According to your level, each soul spar can make you upgrade by about one level. Through the soul spar to increase the soul level, it will be many times easier for you to become a god level in the future. Xinguang's words are full of temptation. According to it, the soul spar is indeed a good thing. Not only can the level be improved, but the soul level can also be enhanced. Once the soul level has reached a certain level, it will be much easier to become a god level. For normal professionals, it is already a very big temptation. But for Lin Moyu, soul spar is not very useful. His soul has already reached the god level level, plus the two skill star cores have been moved into the soul, and the road to becoming a god has long been smoothed out. As long as he reaches the level, becoming a god is a matter of course. As for improving soul energy, it is also not difficult for Lin Moyu. As long as he has time, he will brush up more dungeons, and it will take less than a year and a half to reach the god level. Lin Moyu is not in a hurry about this. What he wants more is to lay a solid foundation. The stronger the foundation, the brighter the prospect of future development. It is not advisable to backfire. Lin Moyu's requirements for himself are not only to become a god. Lin Moyu said, I choose to continue. Xinguang asked in a deep voice, You don't think about it anymore? Lin Moyu shook his head, I've made up my mind. Xinguang didn't say any more, it raised its head and let out a dragon chant, just like before, the dragon chant was transmitted layer by layer like waves, resounding through the dungeon. With the sound of the dragon chant, the mist in the palace gradually dissipated, and a passage, paved with jade appeared. Xinguang said, go forward along the dragon jade, don't touch the fog on both sides, otherwise you will die. Lin Moyu nodded and walked towards the palace. After entering the palace, the gate of the palace is closed. At this moment, clouds and mist billowed in the sky, and Eli, Lai Lin and other giant dragons descended. Brother Xinguang, did he pass? Eli looked at the closed palace gate and already knew the answer, so she just asked, casually. Several other giant dragons were surprised, they heard the sound of dragon chant. The gate of the palace is open all year round, once it is closed, it means that someone has entered. They usually don't go in, so who else would go in, only Lin Moyu. Xinguang took two steps back, exposing the entire gate of the palace, and at the same time, revealing the poisonous aura in front of the gate. A group of green aura that is only two people tall is rolling freely, and a large number of light elements surround it, preventing it from spreading. Xinguang said, Vas, take a look. Jivas could tell at a glance that the green air contained strong poison, and at the same time, there was a trace of law. It took a deep breath towards the poison, and the poison was immediately sucked into its body. A few seconds later, Jivas said, It's the poison of the poison god, and there is a trace of law in it, probably close to level 96. It's no wonder that it can break through Brother Xinguang's sacred barrier. After all, to control power, brother can only inject a little law. It's just strange, how did he display the power of the poisonous gods? Xinguang said, he used the blood essence of the gods, and he seems to have a skill that can increase the power of the blood essence, which is equivalent to a full blow from the gods just now. This human race is not easy. Thunder Dragon Lilin echoed, it's really not simple, he is 100% immune to electric elements. Gyuwa said, from this point of view, he may also be immune to poisonous elements. Xinguang said, he is also 100% immune to light elements. Ellie was slightly surprised, how could such a terrifying Tianwan be born in such a small world? Could it be that he is the son of the world? Xinguang was noncommittal, who knows? Well, let's just complete the task. 
Jiva's breath suddenly changed, someone has entered the Dragon King Palace again, and one of my clones has been activated. Aili nodded, I also sensed it, it's not from this world, and it's not from the human race that came in. Xinguang waved his wings, go, go, do things. Don't be lazy, otherwise the dragon god and heavenly man will punish you. Don't worry, when have we ever been lazy? The dragons flew into the clouds again and disappeared. Xinguang looked at the palace that had already closed the gate, it's been a long time since no one has passed the last test. I don't know what will happen to you. Then it laughed at itself again, it's none of my business whether it passes or not. It began to swallow clouds and mist again, and the mist kept changing its appearance, first it looked like an ordinary dragon, then its body began to grow bigger and longer, and finally it completely changed its appearance. If Lin Moyu was here, he would definitely be able to recognize it at a glance, and the appearance that finally appeared was that of a Chinese dragon. And the current appearance of Xinguang is the appearance of one of the stages in the process of change. Perhaps after continuous evolution, Xinguang will eventually become a Chinese dragon. Xinguang's eyes were filled with hope and longing. The aisle under the feet is completely paved with white jade. This kind of jade exudes a strange aura, which seems to contain the power of law, and Lin Moyu can feel huge energy from it. According to what Xinguang said, this kind of jade is called Longyu, so it must be very precious. Being able to use dragon jade to pave the way, this palace is obviously also very important. Originally, Lin Moyu thought that there would be another test, so he took the first step very carefully. After he took the first step carefully, Longyu didn't respond at all. Even after walking a few steps, Lin Moyu felt a little relieved but he was still cautious and released a skeleton berserker to open the way ahead. The palace was extremely deep, and after walking tens of thousands of meters, I finally saw the second building in the palace. The road paved by Longyu has come to an end. The mist dissipated, and it suddenly became clear. In the palace, the second building came into view. This is a huge round platform with a diameter of about 100 meters and a height of about 5 meters. The whole body is also paved with dragon jade. Moreover, the dragon jade on the round platform is obviously of higher quality, each piece is about one meter long and wide, and the law power contained in it is even more astonishing. Lin Moyu had been shocked by Longyu before, he tried to use the detection technique, but he didn't get any answer. The detection technique also failed to recognize the origin of the dragon jade. But the energy in it is real, Lin Moyu will not admit it wrong. According to Lin Moyu's understanding of Dragon Jade, items that can contain the power of laws are all mythical items. Any piece of Dragon Jade is priceless. But here it is only used to pave the way. Compared with the huge palace, although the round platform is noble, it is not too big. Lin Moyu was about to go up, when a powerful breath fell. His eyes blurred slightly and a dragon had already appeared on the round platform. Not a dragon. It was the dragon in Lin Moyu's memory, Xia Shenlong. It is more than 200 meters long, perched on the round platform, with its head raised slightly, staring at Lin Moyu. Being stared at by it, Lin Moyu had a creepy feeling, as if he was being stared at by some kind of horrible existence. He clearly realized that if the other party wanted to kill him, all he needed was a thought and he didn't need to do anything at all. The difference in strength between the two sides is too great. It was difficult for Lin Moyu to tell which dragon was stronger than Antares. Is he a super god? Lin Moyu can be sure that it is stronger than half-step super gods like Dragon Emperor and Demon Emperor. The two sides are not comparable at all. Shenlong stared at Lin Moyu without saying a word, and Lin Moyu didn't speak either, keeping silent. Lin Moyu was not timid, and also looked at Shenlong. Ten seconds later, Shenlong's voice sounded slowly, Your soul has the taste of my family. Lin Moyu was terrified, and instinctively thought that Shenlong was talking about the breath left after he killed the dragon clan. But after thinking about it, I realized that it was wrong, it was not like this. Hua Sha Shenlong, the descendant of the dragon. There was lightning and thunder in Lin Moyu's head and a possibility suddenly occurred to him. Before he could speak, Shenlong's voice came again, 
your ancestors should have some connection with our dragon clan, and the soul blood of your ancestors has been contaminated with our clan's aura. But it's been too long, and the aura in your soul is already very strong. Weak, very weak, almost unfeeling. Lin Moyu is now 100% sure that what Shen Long said must be related to his identity before time travel. What passed through was his own soul, and the breath it spoke of was also in the soul. Lin Moyu thought about a lot of things in an instant. The opponent was very strong, but he had no killing intent towards him. The fear I felt was entirely caused by the great difference in strength. Lin Moyu finally spoke, What's your name? Dot. Shen Long didn't answer Lin Moyu's words, but continued, In addition to your soul, you also have the aura of my tribe on your body. It seems that you have met my tribe. It didn't see any movement, and the scales of Antares in the pocket flew out automatically. Lin Moyu didn't know how it did it, it was his life saving talisman. But now watch it fly away. It's not that Lin Moyu didn't dare to move, but he couldn't move. An invisible force restrained him, making him unable to move. This is the gap caused by strength, Lin Moyu realized, for the first time that the gap in strength can be so large. Thinking back to two years ago, when I had just completed my job change and met by a Yuan, I had never felt this way. The dragon in front of him is too terrifying. Lin Moyu felt that this dragon should be the dragon god that the dragon said. And Terry's scales flew in front of it, and then began to shine. Shenlong activated the scales, and Antari's voice came from the scales, Boy, are you done? Lin Moyu smiled wryly, No. So it's you. Shenlong said, as if remembering Antari's. I'm going. There was a strange cry from the scales, Why are you awake? Shenlong chuckled, just woke up. Its eyes suddenly shot two golden lights and fell on the scales and the scales became extremely bright in an instant. The dragon scale was shining brightly, and a phantom appeared on it. Lin Moyu recognized at a glance that this was Antares. Get Antares big head. But the next scene shocked him again. Antares appeared in the phantom, it was the whole picture, not just a head. Before Lin Moyu saw Antares's head, its body was always hidden. Now I finally see it. Antares also looks like a Chinese dragon. No, it cannot be said to be exactly the same. Compared with the dragon in front of him, Antares has a pair of dragon wings, which are similar to those of a giant dragon. It is this pair of dragon wings that makes the essential difference between the two. Shenlong looks majestic, powerful, and full of beauty. Antares also has a similar aura, but a pair of dragon wings destroy part of the beauty and are not harmonious. Shenlong said, Long time no see, little Antares. Little Antares. Lin Moyu instantly felt an inexplicable sense of joy. Antares, who has lived for an unknown number of years, is actually called little Antares. Obviously, the Shenlong in front of him is even older. Antares did not refute, but said respectfully, Long time no see, Lord Dragon God. The opponent is indeed the Dragon God. Lin Moyu felt awe-inspiring. And from Antares' words, it can be heard that Antares doesn't want to meet the other party. But by coincidence, the dragon god woke up, and he could only say that he came at an untimely time. Lin Moyu seemed to be able to feel that Antares' mood at the moment must be extremely aggrieved. Dragon god said, Little Antares, after so many years, are you still blaming me? Antares shook his head, don't dare. He <laughs> he. Dragon God laughed, it's not that I don't blame, but I dare not. And Terry shook his head again, then don't blame me. That means it is simply saying, you are the Dragon God, you are more powerful, so you can do whatever you say. Dragon God didn't continue to dwell on this issue, and instead said, you let this little human guy enter, Dragon King Hall, to get back your two Dragon Balls, right? And Terry's admitted generously, that's right. Dragon God asked, 16 Dragon Balls, how many did you find? 10, counting the two in your hand, there are 12. And Terry's didn't hide it, telling the truth. Dragon God asked, do you know where the remaining four are? And Terry shook his head, there are guesses, but not sure yet. The Dragon God sighed, at the beginning I didn't have to. 
At this time, the big ears of Antares and the Phantom suddenly closed, obviously it didn't want to hear the explanation of Dragon God. Dragon God didn't continue talking, but just let out a long sigh. Your Dragon Ball, I will let this little human guy bring it back. Maybe we won't meet again in the future, you take care of yourself. Antares' ears moved, apparently hearing it, but he didn't say anything. Lin Moyu heard the unusualness in the words, obviously there is an unusual relationship between the two. The light of the scales gradually dissipated and flew back into Lin Moyu's pocket again. Then Lin Moyu lightened all over, and the restraint disappeared. At this moment, Lin Moyu heard a long sigh. It's like the sigh of an old man, with a little reluctance. Lin Moyu was lightened all over, the bondage disappeared, and he regained his freedom. Two beads appeared in front of the dragon god, which belonged to Antares, and the dragon beads still had the breath of Antares. The two dragon balls flew into Lin Moyu's hands, and Lin Moyu quickly took out the box to pack them, and then put them into his storage space. You can't hesitate at this time, in case the dragon god repents, and you can't beat him, what else can you do, except, stare? Whatever the reason, getting the dragon balls is one of the best outcomes. Thank you, dragon god. Lin Moyu, sincerely thanked. Dragon God said in a deep voice, This is originally Antares' stuff, you take it back and return it to Antares. Lin Moyu promised very seriously, I will hand it over to Antares. Dragon God said, I can see that you have a good relationship with Antares, you should be its friend. Lin Moyu generously admitted, Yes, I am its friend. Dragon God let out a chuckle, Little Antares actually has friends, it seems that you are very special. Lin Moyu didn't say anything, he knew that the relationship between Dragon God and Antares must be unusual. It's just that Dragon God didn't say anything, Antares didn't say anything, and Lin Moyu was very sensible and didn't ask. Some things can be asked, and some things cannot be asked. If you ask, you may lose your life. Many secrets are that the less you know, the longer you live. Although Lin Moyu has a strong curiosity, he is not a fool and he will not do something like curiosity that killed the cat. Lin Moyu changed the subject, Master Dragon God, what is my next assessment? Dragon God shook his head and said, No need, your assessment has passed. Lin Moyu was taken aback for a moment, he was already ready for a big battle, and he passed the test, no matter what. There must be something tricky in it, and it is estimated to be related to Antares. Dragon King Palace Dungeon, the real master, is the Dragon God. Lin Moyu guessed that 9 out of 10 rules are set by it. It says that the assessment has passed, and that means it has passed. Lin Moyu would not be stupid to say, I must be assessed. Dragon God sighed again, like an old man, with a touch of kindness, little guy, I hope you and Antares can get along well, it may only have you as a friend. Lin Moyu said, it also raised a bird. Dragon God chuckled, is it called Luenio? Lin Moyu nodded, that's right. The dragon god smiled helplessly, it's still blaming me. Lin Moyu didn't speak, but tightly controlled his mouth. No matter how curious you are about these things, you can't ask them, because you will gossip. The body of the dragon god shone slightly, and even the jade platform under his seat also shone. Then a fist-sized crystal appeared in front of dragon god. The crystal is carved into the shape of a dragon and there seems to be liquid flowing inside, emitting colorful rays of light, like a rainbow, very beautiful. This is your final reward for passing, Dragon King Hall, dot. In history, there are very few people who can pass all the assessments of, Dragon King Palace, and you are very good. Perhaps in the future you will have the opportunity to break the eggshell and see a wider world. The dragon-shaped crystal flew to Lin Moyu and Lin Moyu took it with both hands, thank you, Dragon God. Dragon God shook his head, you deserve it, I hope you can do one thing for me. Lin Moyu responded immediately, please order, Lord Dragon God. Give this to Antares for me. Another Dragon Ball emerged. Lin Moyu narrowed his eyes, it wasn't Antares' Dragon Ball, the Dragon Ball has the breath of the Dragon God, and this is the Dragon Ball belonging to the Dragon God. Lin Moyu doesn't know what the Dragon Balls are for, but he knows that the Dragon Balls are very important to the Dragon Clan. 
otherwise, Antares wouldn't let people keep looking for dragon balls. And the dragon ball in front of him belongs to the dragon god, which is a circle larger than the dragon ball of Antares, and it seems to be of a higher level. Lin Moyu found a box to put the dragon balls in, Master Dragon God, do you have anything to say to Antares? Dragon God pondered for a few seconds, say sorry for me. Lin Moyu nodded slightly. At this moment, the old feeling of Dragon God is more obvious. And Lin Moyu felt that the Dragon God seemed to be saying goodbye, and it seemed to be leaving. Dragon God lowered his head while sighing, and slowly closed his eyes. The moment it closed its eyes, Lin Moyu saw a tear. Tears fell on the Longyu platform, making a crisp sound. A feeling called sadness is creeping up. The dragon god is too strong, and its mood changes also affected the entire space. Even the elements and laws of space create emotions. Lin Moyu was also affected, he felt that dragon god seemed to have a lot of bitterness and helplessness in his heart. There was so much in that drop of tear. This feeling made him very uncomfortable, and the sadness touched Lin Moyu's many memories. He came through time travel, and lost everything in his previous life. In his previous life, he was an orphan and had no relatives, Ache, but he still had a few friends. We used to talk about drinking together, and all kinds of bragging scenes emerged. The memory that was thought to be forgotten is now so clear. Memories are always there, even if you don't think about them deliberately, one day they will break the embankment. The picture in my mind has changed from the past life to the present life. Today I have a grandma, a sister, and a close relative. In the past few years, I have really enjoyed a life with relatives. Then there was my own helplessness and sadness when my grandma died of illness. And parents who have never met. He sometimes hates his parents. I thought about looking for it, but in the end I gave up and didn't want to look for it again. That kind of emotion is very complicated, and Lin Moyu usually presses it firmly in the deepest part of his heart, never thinking about it or touching it. But now, the emotions that I don't want to touch are all drawn out by the emotions of Dragon God. Lin Moyu's mood suddenly fell to the bottom and became very bad, even a little irritable. This is something that has never happened before. The fog began to thicken, covering Long Yutai and Lin Moyu. There was thick fog in front of my eyes, a vast expanse of whiteness, and I couldn't see anything. The sound disappeared, and the surroundings became extremely quiet. Just like the vicissitudes of life, the space is constantly changing, and the dense and abrupt disappearance. There was a roar in my ears, it was the explosion of meteorites falling to the ground. When Lin Moyu came back to his senses, he had left the dungeon and stood on the meteorite continent again. Standing still, letting the shock wave of the explosion sweep over his body, he didn't respond. He didn't want to go, he hadn't been able to get out of his sad mood, and he was in a terrible mood now. Lin Moyu tried hard to adjust his emotions, this kind of uncontrollable feeling was very bad. But no matter how hard he tried, it was difficult to control. It can only be said that the power of the dragon god is too strong, so powerful that Lin Moyu can't control his emotions. Sad, irritable, and eventually turned into cranky. The breath of space fluctuations came from afar. Lin Moyu looked up and saw the open space-time channel. More than one, more than ten time space channels appeared at the same time, and the sky seemed to be punched with black holes. Dragon kings of the dragon clan with powerful auras are coming out of the passage of time and space. As soon as they appeared, they stared at Lin Moyu, with excitement and killing intent in their eyes. The huge aura of the dragon king swept across the world, and the air became thick. The dragon king knew that he could not last long here, and could only survive for a few minutes under full-strength fighting. Kill. They didn't waste an iota of time, heading straight towards Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu also had his sleeves flying at this time, his murderous aura rising. Since you can't control your emotions, then stop controlling them and simply vent your emotions. It happened that these dragon kings of the dragon clan came to the door. I'm in a bad mood. Lin Moyu muttered in his heart, and the army of undead appeared. The original runes on the backs of both hands gleamed at the same time, and the two skills of strengthening soldiers 
and combination were activated at the same time. Skill, Summon Skeleton King. Skill, Undead Gaze. Skill, Curse of Aging. Skill, Toxic Starburst. Skills are used one by one like a cannonball, regardless of whether it is useful or not, use them all once. At this moment Lin Moyu didn't control himself, didn't calculate which skill is useful and which skill is effective. The sky suddenly darkened, covering the sky and blocking out the sun. The dark clouds are thick, the wind is howling, and the phantom of the undead world descends. Dragon King Palace Dungeon, the real master, is the dragon god. Lin Moyu guessed that nine out of ten rules are set by it. It says that the assessment has passed, and that means it has passed. Lin Moyu would not be stupid to say, I must be assessed. Dragon God sighed again, like an old man, with a touch of kindness, little guy, I hope you and Antares can get along well, it may only have you as a friend. Lin Moyu said, it also raised a bird. Dragon God chuckled, is it called Luenio? Lin Moyu nodded, that's right. The dragon god smiled helplessly, it's still blaming me. Lin Moyu didn't speak, but tightly controlled his mouth. No matter how curious you are about these things, you can't ask them, because you will gossip. The body of the dragon god shone slightly, and even the jade platform under his seat also shone. Then a fist-sized crystal appeared in front of dragon god. The crystal is carved into the shape of a dragon, and there seems to be liquid flowing inside, emitting colorful rays of light, like a rainbow, very beautiful. This is your final reward for passing, Dragon King Hall. Dot. In history, there are very few people who can pass all the assessments of Dragon King Palace, and you are very good. Perhaps in the future you will have the opportunity to break the eggshell and see a wider world. The dragon shaped crystal flew to Lin Moyu and Lin Moyu took it with both hands, thank you, Dragon God. Dragon God shook his head, you deserve it, I hope you can do one thing for me. Lin Moyu responded immediately, please order, Lord Dragon God. Give this to Antares for me. Another Dragon Ball emerged. Lin Moyu narrowed his eyes, it wasn't Antares' Dragon Ball, the Dragon Ball has the breath of the Dragon God, and this is the Dragon Ball belonging to the Dragon God. Lin Moyu doesn't know what the Dragon Balls are for, but he knows that the Dragon Balls are very important to the Dragon Clan. Otherwise, Antares wouldn't let people keep looking for Dragon Balls. And the Dragon Ball in front of him belongs to the Dragon God, which is a circle larger than the Dragon Ball of Antares, and it seems to be of a higher level. Lin Moyu found a box to put the Dragon Balls in, Master Dragon God, do you have anything to say to Antares? Dragon God pondered for a few seconds, say sorry for me. Lin Moyu nodded slightly. At this moment, the old feeling of Dragon God is more obvious. And Lin Moyu felt that the Dragon God seemed to be saying goodbye, and it seemed to be leaving. Dragon God lowered his head while sighing, and slowly closed his eyes. The moment it closed its eyes, Lin Moyu saw a tear. Tears fell on the Longyu platform, making a crisp sound. A feeling called sadness is creeping up. The dragon god is too strong, and its mood changes also affected the entire space. Even the elements and laws of space create emotions. Lin Moyu was also affected, he felt that dragon god seemed to have a lot of bitterness and helplessness in his heart. There was so much in that drop of tear. This feeling made him very uncomfortable, and the sadness touched Lin Moyu's many memories. He came through time travel and lost everything in his previous life. In his previous life, he was an orphan and had no relatives, Ache, but he still had a few friends. We used to talk about drinking together, and all kinds of bragging scenes emerged. The memory that was thought to be forgotten is now so clear. Memories are always there, even if you don't think about them deliberately, one day they will break the embankment. The picture in my mind has changed from the past life to the present life. Today I have a grandma, a sister, and a close relative. In the past few years, I have really enjoyed a life with relatives. Then there was my own helplessness and sadness when my grandma died of illness. And parents who have never met. He sometimes hates his parents. I thought about looking for it, but in the end I gave up and didn't want to look for it again. That kind of emotion is very complicated, 
and Lin Moyu usually presses it firmly in the deepest part of his heart, never thinking about it or touching it. But now, the emotions that I don't want to touch are all drawn out by the emotions of Dragon God. Lin Moyu's mood suddenly fell to the bottom and became very bad, even a little irritable. This is something that has never happened before. The fog began to thicken, covering Long Yutai and Lin Moyu. There was thick fog in front of my eyes, a vast expanse of whiteness, and I couldn't see anything. The sound disappeared, and the surroundings became extremely quiet. Just like the vicissitudes of life, the space is constantly changing, and the dense and abrupt disappearance. There was a roar in my ears, it was the explosion of meteorites falling to the ground. When Lin Moyu came back to his senses, he had left the dungeon and stood on the meteorite continent again. Standing still, letting the shock wave of the explosion sweep over his body, he didn't respond. He didn't want to go, he hadn't been able to get out of his sad mood, and he was in a terrible mood now. Lin Moyu tried hard to adjust his emotions, this kind of uncontrollable feeling was very bad. But no matter how hard he tried, it was difficult to control. It can only be said that the power of the dragon god is too strong, so powerful that Lin Moyu can't control his emotions. Sad, irritable, and eventually turned into cranky. The breath of space fluctuations came from afar. Lin Moyu looked up and saw the open space-time channel. More than one, more than ten time space channels appeared at the same time, and the sky seemed to be punched with black holes. Dragon kings of the dragon clan with powerful auras are coming out of the passage of time and space. As soon as they appeared, they stared at Lin Moyu, with excitement and killing intent in their eyes. The huge aura of the dragon king swept across the world, and the air became thick. The dragon king knew that he could not last long here, and could only survive for a few minutes under full-strength fighting. Kill They didn't waste an iota of time, heading straight towards Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu also had his sleeves flying at this time, his murderous aura rising. Since you can't control your emotions, then stop controlling them and simply vent your emotions. It happened that these dragon kings of the dragon clan came to the door. I'm in a bad mood. Lin Moyu muttered in his heart, and the army of undead appeared. The original runes on the backs of both hands gleamed at the same time, and the two skills of strengthening soldiers and combination were activated at the same time. Skill, summon skeleton king. Skill, Undead Gaze. Skill, Curse of Aging. Skill, Toxic Starburst. Skills are used one by one like a cannonball, regardless of whether it is useful or not, use them all once. At this moment Lin Moyu didn't control himself, didn't calculate which skill is useful and which skill is effective. The sky suddenly darkened, covering the sky and blocking out the sun. The dark clouds are thick, the wind is howling and the phantom of the undead world descends. Groups of green air are like beautiful flowers blooming in the air. Lin Moyu's soul locked them, and the corpse explosion skill traveled through space and exploded directly on them, making it unavoidable. Shouts of terror resounded through the sky. The dragon kings were corroded by the poisonous green gas, their bodies festered, and turned into thick water in a blink of an eye. They can't stop the poisonous attack of the poisonous god at all. Under the attack of the poisonous god, there is a trace of the power of law, which is the power of law that can only be possessed by contacting a high-level god. The dragon kings were poisoned in panic. There was only one dragon king, with an angry dragon chant, and came towards Lin Moyu, through the poisonous gas. Medium Dragon King Lin Moyu judged at a glance that this is a middle-level dragon king, at least level 93. Only the middle dragon king can survive the severe poison, dash. It is also the strongest existence among the dragon kings, this time. It bumped away the headless horseman who was blocking the way, and charged towards Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the skeleton king appeared in front of it instantly, and swung his sword. Holding the long spear in his hand, the dragon king roared and thrust out, colliding with the giant sword of the skeleton king. Amidst the loud noise, the space was distorted, causing waves of ripples. The skeleton king flew upside down, and its strength was not as strong as that of the medium dragon king. 
The middle dragon king came to Lin Moyu in an instant after shaking off the skeleton king. Before it could make a move, there was another severe pain in the soul. The eyes of the undead in the air are staring at it, and all attacks are concentrated on it. At the same time, the soul flame danced on Lin Moyu's palm, strengthening the soul attack. The soul attack interrupted its movement, and then the sword light flashed in front of it. It retreated in horror, blood flew, and a huge gash was drawn on its body. Lin Moyu was holding a sharp long sword in his hand, seeing it dodging, he couldn't help saying, what a pity. The soul attack was interrupted, Lin Moyu made a move, and it was very likely that one sword would be cut in two, I didn't expect it to react so quickly, and it was dodged. It was just beheading, not beheading to death. The skill, cohesion, pushed Lin Moyu's attribute to the limit. Although Lin Moyu's attribute is not yet at the god level, the extra damage brought by the skill, strength, is enough to cause fatal damage to the Dragon King. When it flew back, Lin Moyu put away his long sword and aimed his finger at it. Skill, Bone Spear Spears flew out with powerful tearing force. Also because of the, strong soldier, skill, the power of the Bone Spear is huge. Shangri's speed is too fast. It can reach 20,000 meters per second. The Dragon King is close at hand, at this distance, the Dragon King has no chance to dodge. Bang 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 non-stop, the Bone Spear kept hitting the Dragon King. The spear is so powerful that every blow can make it tremble all over, as if it is about to be torn apart. In any case, it can't imagine how a human professional who is only level 71 can have such a powerful combat power. They came here with dozens of top dragon professionals, and more than ten dragon kings, and now they are the only ones who are still alive. At the same time, it also realizes that with Lin Moyu's strength, if Lin Moyu becomes a god, only the dragon king can fight against him. A sense of fear arises spontaneously, Lin Moyu's strength has completely exceeded its cognition. I want to escape, escape back, I can't let my tribe come to die. At least a high-ranking dragon king can possibly kill him. It knew that unless the high-ranking dragon king or the dragon king personally took action, otherwise they would die if they came too many. Lin Moyu's skills are group attack skills. There is no difference between killing one and killing a hundred. It used all its strength to stimulate the blood in the whole body, and the giant dragon phantom merged with it. Then, turn around and jump. Just after flying less than 100 meters, the soul suddenly felt a sharp pain. Countless sharp arrows appeared densely on the soul body. The skeleton king turned back into an army of undead, and 30,000 skeleton marksmen cast their skills at the same time. Skill, Soul Shot Level 70 skeleton marksman shotgun has been replaced with a shotgun, and the soul-locking passive skill has been upgraded to Soul Shot. Inherited the characteristics of the soul lock, but also has the ability to attack the soul. The soul attack ability is definitely a terrifying ability, and it is impossible to guard against. Humans, dragons, and demons don't have a good way to deal with it. The severe pain came from the soul body continuously, which made the dragon kings will unable to concentrate. The undead gaze is activated again, and the soul is ignited and burned blazingly. The soul flame also launched at the same time, the screams resounded through the world again, and the dragon king could no longer think, and his thinking became extremely chaotic. The soul really hurts. Under the continuous soul attack, its consciousness became weaker and weaker, and finally completely lost. It fell in the air, fell heavily on the ground, and stayed on the meteorite continent forever. The skeleton berserker came over with an axe, split his head, and took out the dragon crystal. By the way, the rest of the dragon king dragon crystals were collected, those low-level dragon kings who died under the severe poison left nothing but the dragon crystal. There are thirteen dragon crystals in total, twelve of which are low-level dragon crystals and one medium-level dragon crystal. The medium dragon crystal is obviously a circle larger than the low-level dragon crystal, changing from a prismatic shape to a hexagonal shape. The energy contained in it is also a lot more. After Lin Moyu vented, he felt much better. Understand that some emotions are useless to suppress, they will explode one day. It's good to let it out this time, 
however, he still doesn't like the feeling of being uncontrolled. You guys are unlucky. Lin Moyu said lightly. He took out the scepter of creation and absorbed all the dragon crystals, erasing the last traces of the dragon kings in the world. The life core light on the scepter of creation is getting brighter and brighter. There seemed to be a whirlwind blowing on the meteor continent. The whirlwind brings a lot of elements. Lin Moyu clearly felt this element and could even see it with enough soul power. It has the same sacred breath as the light element, and it has more breath of life. It feels like Zhu Qing Lu is performing a god level healing technique. Lin Moyu called this element the inanimate element. With the continuous recovery of the life core, it absorbs the life elements at the same time, and the life elements are the foundation of its power. Lin Moyu could feel that the core of life was recovering. The scepter of creation shone brightly, corresponding to the sergeant's badge. After killing more than a dozen dragon kings, the purple brilliance on the sergeant's badge was unprecedentedly strong. The fourth general star appeared directly, and after waiting for a few seconds, the fifth general star also appeared. Even the phantom of the sixth general appeared for a few seconds before disappearing. Lin Moyu only needs to kill two god-level enemies to become a four-star general. If you want to become a five-star general, you have to kill eight god-level enemies on the basis of a four-star general. To become a six-star general, you need to kill sixteen, now kill thirteen in one breath, not only became a five-star general in one fell swoop, but also had three more. Now as long as you kill thirteen more dragon kings or demons, you can become a six-star general. At present, apart from the missing Di Huang and the soon-to-be-resurrected god of righteousness in the human world, no one has become a six-star general. It can be said that Lin Moyu has already stood at the top of the Terran world. Zero. The light of the scepter of creation became more and more intense, and the light of the sergeant's badge also shone on one side, and the light of upgrading rose from Lin Moyu at the same time. After slaughtering thirteen dragon kings, he not only has generals, but also has a lot of experience. Lin Moyu directly stepped from level 71 to level 72. Lin Moyu had to sigh, what a dragon. After all the 13 dragon crystals have been absorbed, the life core has recovered to about 60%. The shell has already taken shape. Lin Moyu felt the breath of law. There is a breath of law entwined on the core of life, which is the law of life. One of the symbols of mythical weapons possesses the power of law. This is the case with the creation scepter, which contains the power of law. Obtaining it, it is possible to comprehend the law of life and become the god of life. In order to become the god of life, how crazy it would be to destroy a small world. Compared with relying on external forces, Lin Moyu believes in his own strength. Taking out the dragon scale of Antares, a slight movement of mental power activated the dragon scale. The space warps and fluctuates, and Long Lin takes Lin Moyu away from the meteorite continent. Changes are worse than plans. When I first came to the meteorite continent, I planned to advance to the Dragon King Palace, copy, help Antares get the Dragon Ball back, and then go to the original secret realm work. Lin Moyu went to original secret realm in the hope that he could own the two skills of strengthening soldiers and gathering strength. But it's not 100% sure. So I went to the Dragon King Palace dungeon first, in case I need to use these two skills in the Dragon King Palace dungeon, I won't be so passive. It's just that the changes are too fast, and what happened in Dragon King Palace exceeded Lin Moyu's expectations. Not only got back the two Dragon Balls of Antares, but also got a Dragon Ball belonging to the Dragon God. Lin Moyu promised Dragon God to bring the Dragon Ball back to Antares. To avoid accidents, Lin Moyu decided to go back first. As for original secret realm, there is no rush for this. After the teleportation ended, Lin Moyu saw the giant longan of Antares. Antares' eyes were a bit complicated, and he couldn't tell what kind of emotion it was. Lin Moyu asked, What are you thinking? Antares asked back, Why are you back? I got what you asked for, so as not to cause trouble, come back first. Lin Moyu said and took out two boxes containing dragon balls. The dragon ball lay quietly in the box, and Terry's did not take it away in a hurry, 
but said, you killed a lot of dragons again. It can be heard that Antares is feeling a little depressed at this time. Lin Moyu can probably guess the reason, when I left the dungeon, many dragons came to kill me, and I killed them back. Is there a dragon king? Fataris asked. Lin Moyu nodded, thirteen low-level dragon kings, one middle-level dragon king, and a group of more than eighty-level dragon warriors. Antares glanced at Lin Moyu, but didn't say anything. He opened his mouth and sucked in two dragon balls. In the dense fog that enveloped Antares' body all year round, there was a roaring sound, lightning and thunder, and some kind of change occurred inside. Lin Moyu took out another box of 880, Dragon God asked me to give this to you, and let me give you a sentence by the way. Antares put on a look of indifference, what? What words can come out of its mouth? Lin Moyu handed over the box, you can see for yourself. Antares seemed a little hesitant, and didn't take the box. Lin Moyu teased a little, you're not scared, are you? Antares snorted, I have nothing to be afraid of, it can't kill me. At this time, it changed its name to Lousy, and it used to be a deity. Just such a change, Lin Moyu can feel that, in fact, Antares' heart is very restless. It's just that Lin Moyu didn't point it out, but gave him a step up with the aggressive method, since you're not afraid, let's take a look. Antares also walked down the steps, as if he had been hit by Lin Moyu's aggressive method, look and see, whoever is afraid of whom. The box was opened, and Antares shuddered suddenly when he saw the contents of the box. Then its huge head began to shake uncontrollably, its eyes full of disbelief. This is, this is. I was very emotional, but I couldn't say a complete sentence. Antares' emotions were a little out of control. Lin Moyu looked at it quietly, without saying a word. After waiting for a while, Antares calmed down a little, it has something to tell you. Lin Moyu said, Dragon God said, I'm sorry. Sorry. The three words fell on Antares' head like a bolt from the blue, and Antares was completely fried. Antares suddenly raised his head and let out a terrifying dragon cry. Terrifying energy is spreading, causing cracks in the ground. The entire ancient battlefield was shaking, and all the monsters inside, including the world boss, were trembling. The terror of Antares is clearly revealed at this moment. Lin Moyu still didn't speak, and didn't interrupt Antares, let him scream enough. It knew that Antares was venting, just like it had done before. It's better to let it out than to hold it in your heart. A few minutes later, Antares finally calmed down, and Lin Moyu clearly saw a tear appearing in the corner of Antares' eyes. The tears didn't drop, they were instantly wiped away with powerful force. Lin Moyu didn't point it out, just watched it quietly. After waiting for a while, Antares seemed to have regained his former calm, and opened his mouth to swallow the dragon god's dragon ball into his belly. It looked at Lin Moyu, don't ask about me and it, I won't tell you if you ask. Lin Moyu naturally understands that this is Antares' private matter, and he is not so gossip. Lin Moyu said, then can I ask something else? Okay. For the sake of you bringing the dragon ball back to me, I will say it to anyone who can. Antares' mood has obviously not fully recovered, and he is still the same as Lao Tzu. Lin Moyu said, I saw a few giant dragons in the copy of Dragon King Palace, they claim to be elemental dragons, and they control some elements. At the same time, they call our dragons here low, can you tell me the reason? Antares looked at Lin Moyu, pondered for a moment, if it were someone else, I would definitely not say it. Lin Moyu laughed, if it were someone else, I would definitely not ask who made you my friend. Lin Moyu's words seemed to hit Antares' heart. The word friend is particularly important in Antares' mind at this moment. Antares trembled slightly, the dragon clan you call is actually nothing in front of our real dragon clan. The ranks of the dragon clan are strict, and the highest person is called the dragon god, who is the master of all the dragon clan. The so-called dragon king palace copy refers to the dragon god. It's just that the dragon god generally doesn't sit in the dungeon. It has too many things to do. Most of the time, the one in the dungeon is just a puppet of it. I don't know what happened this time, it's such a coincidence. 
Lin Moyu said in a low voice, Dragon God said, It is a whim this time, and it has a feeling in its heart. And Terry snorted, The old guy's realm is very high, there is indeed such a possibility. I continued, Listen carefully, I will only say it once. Dragon God is the king of the dragon clan. It has the blood of the ancestor dragon, and has revived the blood of the ancestor dragon to a very high level. Its strength is invincible. Below it, there are pure blood dragons and mixed blood dragons. The goal of all mixed blood dragons throughout their lives is to evolve towards pure blood dragons, and the goal of the pure blooded dragon is to evolve in the direction of the ancestor dragon. Those elemental dragons you saw in the dungeons are hybrid dragons. Lin Moyu understands a little bit, the elemental dragons are mixed blood dragons, and their evolution direction is pure blood dragons, purifying their own bloodlines and activating the power of bloodlines. The sacred dragon that I saw later already possessed some of the characteristics of a pure-blooded dragon, and its body was evolving from a thick and short dragon to a slender one. Needless to say, Antares must not only be a pure-blooded dragon, but should also have the blood of an ancestral dragon. From its words, Lin Moyu faintly heard its disdain for pure-blooded dragons. Even when it comes to the blood of the dragon god's ancestor dragon, it has an equal attitude. Lin Moyu kept Antares' words in his heart, and at the same time, paid close attention to Antares' expression. A lot of information can be analyzed from its expression. Lin Moyu saw that the disdain in Antares' eyes was getting stronger and stronger. The tone changed accordingly. As for the dragons in this world, they are hybrids, the lowest kind, not even subdragons. Why, the tone was full of deep contempt. Lin Moyu asked, but there are also members of the dragon clan with atavistic bloodlines, and it is said that their dragon emperor also has atavistic bloodlines. And Terry sneered again and again, F asterisk asterisk K, back to the bloodline of the ancestors, let me tell you a story. There was once a pure-blooded idiot who died while awakening the bloodline of the ancestral dragon, then it exploded, and part of the flesh and blood exploded into a certain world, and was accidentally eaten by a primitive monster in a certain world. Then those monsters mutated, and they inherited a trace of the blood of a pure-blooded dragon, calling themselves the Dragon Clan. The so-called Dragon Emperor is just a little purer bloodline. It is impossible to reach the super-god level in a lifetime, half a step of super-god is the limit, and the bloodline limit is there. Now you know the origin of the Dragon Clan. How can Lin Moyu still not understand? It turns out that this is how the dragons in this world come from. No wonder it looks weird, it's different from the dragons Lin Moyu has seen. When he first awakened his profession, he had seen the giant dragon, which was indeed very different from the dragon clan. The question that has been bothering me for a long time has finally got the correct answer, and I feel like I have opened up the world. But a new problem was born again, the elemental dragons I saw in the dungeon don't seem to be of high level. Why, and Terry said, those are all puppet clones made by them. Do you think their bodies are copied? Let me tell you one more thing, in our dragon clan, even the worst mixed blood dragon is a god level 1 when he is born, and a high level god level 1 when he grows up. This refers to those 1.4 idiots who don't practice at all, and can achieve achievements just by sleeping. If you can practice a little bit, it is not difficult to reach the super god level. Lin Moyu was shocked. If you don't practice and just rely on sleep, you can sleep to a high god level. That is the level that can drive the law. It is not difficult to become a super god level with a little practice. And this is the worst hybrid dragon, what if the stronger hybrid is me? Or a pure blood dragon? Even the bloodline of the awakened ancestral dragon. The strength of the dragon clan has far exceeded my imagination. In this way, the so-called dragon emperor here is really nothing, no wonder Antares is so disdainful. In this way, his own human race seems to be nothing. Suddenly Lin Moyu shuddered slightly, realizing that he was wrong. It's not like this. Lelin once said that the human race is a big race, and there are many talents, born. The human race in our world is not good, but it does not mean that all races are not good. And the human race in our world is not completely incapable. At least there were super-gods in the last era. Although they can't compare with the real dragons, they at least have a chance. 
And in this era, there is me, Lin Moyo, is full of confidence in herself. Just because others can't do it doesn't mean you can't do it yourself. After Antares spoke, his mood calmed down a lot, and he returned to his previous lazy appearance again. Lin Moyu asked, What about the demons of the abyss? What are their origins? Antares shook his head, Don't say it. Lin Moyu chuckled, Don't you know? Antares smiled contemptuously, Don't use aggressive methods on me, it's useless. Just now I was saving face, don't take yourself too seriously. Lin Moyu didn't care about Antares' words. I still think you don't know. Antari snorted and stopped talking. Lin Moyu said, If you don't know, just say you don't know. Anyway, I won't force you to say it. I can't beat you, and I can't scold you, right? Antari turned his head and closed his eyes, ignoring this guy. But after Lin Moyu said this, the last trace of depression was also cleared away. Antares is completely messed up, as if you can say what you want, anyway, it just doesn't answer. Lin Moyu teased a few words and stopped asking. Antares' mood has recovered and his goal has been achieved, so there is no need to continue asking. Lin Moyu said, help me see what my reward is, I can't figure it out. Lin Moyu's words aroused Antares' interest. Antares was also a little curious about the rewards for the dungeon of Dragon King Palace. After all, it has never presided over Dragon King Hall, and the rewards are not fixed, it depends on each person's level and occupation. Zero two, there are too many good things in Dragon Clan, too numerous to count. And for some beings, there are many things that can be made by themselves. When they established the Dragon King Hall dungeon for some reason, they prepared the Great Emperor's treasure. This time Lin Moyu met the Dragon God, who is the king of the Dragon Clan and possesses the highest power. Antares couldn't guess what reward Lin Moyu would give Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu took out the dragon-shaped crystal. Antares' eyes widened and he growled, Dragon Soul Crystal, the old guy actually gave it to you. What's the use of the Dragon Soul Crystal? Lin Moyu looked at the dragon-shaped crystal and the colorful liquid flowing slowly in the crystal. The colorful liquid does not look like much, but in Lin Moyu's eyes, it is like a vast ocean, endless. Dragon God didn't mention its name, Lin Moyu knew it was called Dragon Soul Crystal, through Antares' mouth. As for what to use, and how to use it, I still don't know at all. But through Antares' reaction, Lin Moyu knew that this thing was definitely not an ordinary item. Think about it too. For the existence of the level of Dragon God, if it is an ordinary item, how can it be possible to get it? Antares said, Dragon Soul Crystal is very difficult to create, and there are not many among our Dragon Clan. Did you see the liquid in the Dragon Soul Crystal? This is called Dragon Soul Liquid, which is made up of the soul power of our Dragon Clan. With the Dragon Soul Crystal, you can strengthen your soul level. And it will increase without any sequelae. The crystal containing the dragon soul liquid is called the dragon crystal, and it contains a lot of laws. Long-term contact with dragon crystal can make it easier for you to comprehend the law. The dragon soul liquid strengthens the soul, and the dragon crystal accelerates the comprehension of laws, both of which are rare treasures. No matter how strong the external objects are, no matter how good the equipment is, they are not as powerful as themselves. Dragon Soul Crystal is indeed a very good thing, which is very suitable for Lin Moyu's appetite. When Antares was speaking, the Dragon Soul Crystal had already flown from Lin Moyu's hand and came to Antares. Antares stared at the Dragon Soul Liquid and the Dragon Soul Crystal. Well, it's the colorful Dragon Soul Liquid, the old guy really thinks highly of you. Lin Moyu asked, What's the point? Antares snorted softly, Dragon Soul Crystals are also good or bad and the quality varies greatly. The worst dragon soul crystal, the liquid inside is three color, which means that the soul power inside comes from mixed blood dragons, mixed and impure, and the effect is the worst. The best thing is Wutsai, the power of the soul is gathered by pure blood dragons. What the old guy gave you is a colorful dragon soul crystal, which already possesses a hint of the ancestral dragon's aura, and it can be regarded as a top-level dragon soul crystal. The seven-color dragon soul crystal is also the best dragon soul crystal that our dragon clan will give away. 
As for the top 9 color dragon soul crystal, it will not be given away. Lin Moyu asked, why? And Terry's chuckled, I think, with your ingenuity, you can definitely imagine it. Lin Moyu just asked instinctively, and the reason has already been guessed. Just ask who will give away their most precious treasures, and they must keep them for their own use. Since Dragon Soul Crystal can strengthen the soul and comprehend the law, and it is extremely difficult to manufacture, the quantity is not much. Then the best one must be reserved for your descendants, how could it be given away? And Terry suddenly laughed, I know what you're thinking, but you must be wrong. Lin Mayu gave Antares a helpless look. This guy seemed to have learned badly and started to tease himself. Antares still stared at Dragon Soul Crystal, I can't say the specific reason, but it's definitely not what you think, it's not that simple. The old man is unwilling to take out the best nine-colored Dragon Soul Crystal, so I want to give it to you. Antares spit out a mouthful of Dragon Breath, and the Dragon Breath was controlled into a thin thread surrounding the Dragon Soul Crystal Cluster. The Dragon Soul Crystal began to sparkle, bursting out with brilliant light. A brilliant rainbow rose in the sky, and there seemed to be countless dragons flying and swimming in the rainbow, sending out bursts of dragon chant. Lin Moyu could feel the huge soul energy boiling. The energy of the soul is too huge, from invisible to tangible, and finally into liquid, this is the Dragon Soul Liquid. Every drop of dragon soul liquid is as heavy as a thousand june, and the power of the soul contained in it is extremely astonishing. This is transformed by the pure dragon soul, and the production of dragon soul liquid requires a huge amount of soul energy. Therefore, what Antari said is not easy to manufacture is absolutely false. Antares continuously sprays out dragon breath, which contains its soul power, and it injects its own soul power into the dragon soul crystal. A moment later, a magical scene happened. On top of the rainbow of seven fats, suddenly there was another black streak. The rainbow of seven colors becomes eight colors. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, blue, purple, black. Eight-color dragon soul crystal. Lin Moyu was secretly shocked that Antares actually enhanced the quality of dragon soul crystal. It uses its own soul power to forcibly improve the quality of dragon soul crystal. Lin Moyu realized that his previous guess should be correct, and Terry's is by no means as simple as a pure blood dragon. It must have the blood of the ancestral dragon, otherwise it would be impossible to improve the quality of the dragon soul crystal. Since the seven colors are already top-notch, the nine colors will not be delivered, which shows that it is extremely difficult to manufacture the nine colors of dragon soul crystals. Lin Moyu is full of confidence in herself. Just because others can't do it doesn't mean you can't do it yourself. After Antari spoke, his mood calmed down a lot, and he returned to his previous lazy appearance again. Lin Moyu asked, What about the demons of the abyss? What are their origins? Antari shook his head, Don't say it. Lin Moyu chuckled, Don't you know? Antari smiled contemptuously, Don't use aggressive methods on me, it's useless. Just now I was saving face don't take yourself too seriously. Lin Moyu didn't care about Antares' words, I still think you don't know. Antares snorted and stopped talking. Lin Moyu said, if you don't know, just say you don't know. Anyway, I won't force you to say it. I can't beat you, and I can't scold you, right? Antares turned his head and closed his eyes, ignoring this guy. But after Lin Moyu said this, the last trace of depression was also cleared away. Antares is completely messed up, as if you can say what you want, anyway, it just doesn't answer. Lin Moyu teased a few words and stopped asking. Antares' mood has recovered and his goal has been achieved, so there is no need to continue asking. Lin Moyu said, help me see what my reward is, I can't figure it out. Lin Moyu's words aroused Antares' interest. Antares was also a little curious about the rewards for the dungeon of Dragon King Palace. After all, it has never presided over Dragon King Hall, and the rewards are not fixed, it depends on each person's level and occupation. Zero two, there are too many good things in Dragon Clan, too numerous to count. And for some beings, there are many things that can be made by themselves. When they established the Dragon King Hall, 
dungeon for some reason, they prepared the great emperor's treasure. This time Lin Moyu met the dragon god, who is the king of the dragon clan and possesses the highest power. Antares couldn't guess what reward Lin Moyu would give Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu took out the dragon-shaped crystal. Antares' eyes widened and he growled, Dragon Soul Crystal, the old guy actually gave it to you. What's the use of the Dragon Soul Crystal? Lin Moyu looked at the dragon-shaped crystal and the colorful liquid flowing slowly in the crystal. The colorful liquid does not look like much, but in Lin Moyu's eyes, it is like a vast ocean, endless. Dragon God didn't mention its name, Lin Moyu knew it was called Dragon Soul Crystal, through Antares' mouth. As for what to use, and how to use it, I still don't know at all. But through Antares' reaction, Lin Moyu knew that this thing was definitely not an ordinary item. Think about it too, for the existence of the level of Dragon God, if it is an ordinary item, how can it be possible to get it? Antares said, Dragon Soul Crystal is very difficult to create, and there are not many among our Dragon Clan. Did you see the liquid in the Dragon Soul Crystal? This is called Dragon Soul Liquid, which is made up of the soul power of our Dragon Clan. With the Dragon Soul Crystal, you can strengthen your soul level. And it will increase without any sequelae. The crystal containing the Dragon Soul Liquid is called the Dragon Crystal, and it contains a lot of laws. Long-term contact with Dragon Crystal can make it easier for you to comprehend the law. The Dragon Soul Liquid strengthens the soul and the dragon crystal accelerates the comprehension of laws, both of which are rare treasures. No matter how strong the external objects are, no matter how good the equipment is, they are not as powerful as themselves. Dragon soul crystal is indeed a very good thing, which is very suitable for Lin Moyu's appetite. When Antares was speaking, the dragon soul crystal had already flown from Lin Moyu's hand and came to Antares. Antares stared at the dragon soul liquid in the dragon soul crystal. Well, it's the colorful dragon soul liquid, the old guy really thinks highly of you. Lin Moyu asked, what's the point? Antares snorted softly, dragon soul crystals are also good or bad, and the quality varies greatly. The worst dragon soul crystal, the liquid inside is three color, which means that the soul power inside comes from mixed blood dragons, mixed and impure, and the effect is the worst. The best thing is Wutsai, the power of the soul, is gathered by pure blood dragons. What the old guy gave you is a colorful dragon soul crystal, which already possesses a hint of the ancestral dragon's aura, and it can be regarded as a top-level dragon soul crystal. The seven-color dragon soul crystal is also the best dragon soul crystal that our dragon clan will give away. As for the top nine-color dragon soul crystal, it will not be given away. Lin Moyu asked, why? Antares chuckled, I think, with your ingenuity, you can definitely imagine it. Lin Moyu just asked instinctively, and the reason has already been guessed. Just ask who will give away their most precious treasures, and they must keep them for their own use, since Dragon Soul Crystal can strengthen the soul and comprehend the law, and it is extremely difficult to manufacture, the quantity is not much. Then the best one must be reserved for your descendants, how could it be given away? Antares suddenly laughed, I know what you're thinking, but you must be wrong. Lin Moyu gave Antares a helpless look. This guy seemed to have learned badly and started to tease himself. Antares still stared at Dragon Soul Crystal, I can't say the specific reason, but it's definitely not what you think, it's not that simple. The old man is unwilling to take out the best nine-colored Dragon Soul Crystal, so I want to give it to you. Antares spit out a mouthful of dragon breath and the dragon breath was controlled into a thin thread, surrounding the dragon soul crystal cluster. The dragon soul crystal began to sparkle, bursting out with brilliant light. A brilliant rainbow rose in the sky, and there seemed to be countless dragons flying and swimming in the rainbow, sending out bursts of dragon chant. Lin Moyu could feel the huge soul energy boiling. The energy of the soul is too huge. From invisible to tangible, and finally into liquid, this is the dragon soul liquid. Every drop of dragon soul liquid is as heavy as a thousand june, and the power of the soul contained in it is extremely astonishing. This is transformed by the pure dragon soul, and the production of dragon soul liquid requires a huge amount of soul energy. Therefore, what Antares said is not easy to manufacture is absolutely false. 
Antares continuously sprays out dragon breath, which contains its soul power, and it injects its own soul power into the dragon soul crystal. A moment later, a magical scene happened. On top of the rainbow of seven fats, suddenly there was another black streak. The rainbow of seven colors becomes eight colors. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, blue, purple, black. Eight color dragon soul crystal. Lin Moyu was secretly shocked that Antares actually enhanced the quality of Dragon Soul Crystal. It uses its own soul power to forcibly improve the quality of Dragon Soul Crystal. Lin Moyu realized that his previous guess should be correct, Antares is by no means as simple as a pure blood dragon. It must have the blood of the ancestral dragon, otherwise it would be impossible to improve the quality of the Dragon Soul Crystal. Since the seven colors are already top-notch, the nine colors will not be delivered, which shows that it is extremely difficult to manufacture the nine colors of Dragon Soul Crystals. And Terry's just did it, and the only way to improve the quality of the colorful Dragon Soul Crystal is by himself. After the eighth color appeared, and Terry's also became cautious, and the output of soul energy became extremely soft. It used to be like a galloping river, but now it has turned into a trickle pouring into the dragon soul crystal bit by bit. After maintaining it for a full day, the dragon soul crystal still remained unchanged. Antares continues to inject soul power, and at the same time, transforms the dragon soul crystal with the laws controlled by its 740. Lin Moyu is not in a hurry, and waits with peace of mind. He works slowly and meticulously, so there is no rush. He was not idle either and began to summon skeletons and headless horsemen. It has been upgraded to level 72, so it is natural to replenish the undead army. At level 72, one more lich general can be summoned, bringing the number of lich generals to 52. The summoning space also increased by 200, reaching 2800. The total number of undead army reached 145600. Headless Horseman, Skeleton Berserker, Skeleton Archmage, Skeleton Marksman. The number of each unit is gray 36,400, evenly distributed. Compared with level 71, the undead army has increased by 13,000. Lin Moyu's non-stop summoning also takes four hours to replenish. Antares improves the quality of the Dragon Soul Crystal, and Lin Moyu supplements the undead army. Both are busy, although they are silent, they seem to form a unique tacit understanding, very harmonious. After three full days like this, the appearance of Dragon Soul Crystal has changed compared to before. It seems to have become more agile. The Dragon Soul liquid in it is shining brightly, and the ninth color has already appeared. Lin Moyu stared at Dragon Soul liquid without blinking. After careful identification, the ninth color was white. Antares is going to succeed. Lin Moyu clenched his fists, realizing that Antares was about to succeed. Now we are only one step away from success. A few hours later, a rainbow ring rose above the rainbow of red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, and black. A white rainbow ring. Nine colored dragon soul crystal, the top dragon soul crystal in the dragon clan. The energy that had been boiling for several days was completely extinguished, and Antares seemed to have done a trivial thing, Jyotsai, it's barely enough. This guy is pretending, Lin Moyu saw through it, took the nine-colored dragon soul crystal, and said with a smile, Antares is really powerful. Antares snorted arrogantly, it's average, I haven't been a dragon soul crystal for too many years, it's a bit rusty. Pretend, you continue to pretend. Lin Moyu doesn't want to break it, anyway, he can get the nine-colored dragon soul crystal. The nine colors of dragon soul liquid are intertwined with each other, seemingly entangled but distinct, dazzling and charming. People will be intoxicated unconsciously. Lin Moyu murmured, nine-colored dragon soul crystal is not given away, it seems that I am the only one who got it. No, you are the second. Antares denied Lin Moyu's words. Lin Moyu was slightly taken aback, didn't you say that the nine-colored dragon soul crystal is not for delivery? And Terry said, a long time ago, I sent one. It's too long ago, and it doesn't make sense to say this. Lin Moyu asked, how does this thing work? The usage is very simple, 
you use your soul to leave your own brand on it, and then take it into your soul, talk to it whenever you have time, and communicate more. Lin Moyu is skeptical, and Terry's has learned badly now, and his words are also true and false, often half of the jokes are mixed with ten truths. According to Antares' method, Lin Moyu used his soul power to make contact with the nine-colored dragon soul crystal. There was a sudden stabbing pain in the soul, as if being stabbed in the soul, with a small knife, it hurts. Lin Moyu couldn't help trembling and grinning. Ha 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 ha. Antares' laughter came from next to his ears, Lin Moyu knew that he had been fooled, and this guy was really teasing himself. I really often walk by the river, how can I not get my shoes wet? I often use my soul to attack others, and now it is my turn to be stabbed in my soul. This is no ordinary pain. Seeing Lin Moyu being fooled, and Terry smiled happily, it's so fun, you kid sometimes gets fooled. Lin Moyu tried to heal the pain in his soul, dragon, you've learned badly. And Terry smiled and said, those who are close to vermilion are red, and those who are close to ink are black. Lin Moyu was speechless for a while and stopped the topic, to be honest, how to do it. And Terry's took it for granted, just do it like this, I didn't lie to you. As for the pain of the soul, this is also a small test. A test again? Why do you dragons like tests so much? The east is the test, and the west is also the test. It's not my problem. This problem can be traced back to Zulong, which is a tradition passed down from it. If you have a chance to meet it in the future, you can ask about it. Zulong? Is it still alive? Nonsense, of course the Zulong is still alive. It's just that I don't know where it will live. Anyway, it has disappeared for countless years. When mentioning Zulong, and Terry still had a trace of respect. After all, Zulong is the ancestor of all dragon races, and this kind of respect also comes from the depths of the blood, the instinct of the soul. Lin Moyu once again tried to touch the dragon soul crystal with his soul. At the moment of contact, severe pain came from the soul again. Lin Moyu held back this time, just let out a muffled snort, and continued to let the soul touch it. Fortunately, with the experience of the charm blue fire, Lin Moyu's tolerance to the soul has improved a lot. Enduring the severe pain, the soul began to formally contact the dragon soul crystal. Dragon Soul Crystal didn't respond, Lin Moyu's first reaction was that Antares was fooling himself again. But thinking about it, it shouldn't be so. Antares still has a sense of proportion and won't mess around. Could it be that my method is wrong? Lin Moyu grinned in pain, gasping for air, and looked at Antares. Although Antares pretended not to respond, his eyes betrayed him. This guy is just watching his own show. Lin Moyu felt ruthless, I'll show you enough. Since contact with a small area is not enough, then wrap you all up. Originally, Lin Moyu only sent out a trace of soul for contact, but now it has doubled hundreds of times. The huge soul force is like a giant hand, completely enveloping the dragon soul crystal. Intense pain came, and Lin Moyu felt dozens of hundreds of knives pierced his body. The pain doubled, but it still endured it. Under the full cover of soul power, Lin Moyu clearly sensed why his soul was stabbed by the knife. That's because there are densely packed dragon scales on the dragon soul crystal. Dragon scales are as sharp as knives, it is so thin and dense that it cannot be touched by hand. But the sensitivity of the soul far surpasses that of the body, and it was immediately pierced. The key is that these fine dragon scales have no distinction between positive and negative, no matter from which angle they pass, they will be pierced. And Terry's voice sounded in his ear, you can feel it, in fact, dragon scales are one of the weapons of our dragon clan. I won't mention mixed blood dragons, as long as they are pure blood dragons, every piece of their dragon scales is better than the so-called dragon scales, mythical weapons. Lin Moyu kept what Antares said firmly, and it might be useful in the future, but he snorted coldly, speaking of these, what should I do? Taris laughed out loud, please, I will tell you mercifully. Please? Lin Moyu snorted, asking himself to beg for it. The power of the soul is like countless pairs of eyes, which can see the dragon soul crystal carefully. I saw countless sharp and fine dragon scales, 
but I just couldn't find the right way. Lin Moyu was able to analyze that what Antares said was correct. He wanted to use his own soul to contact the Dragon Soul Crystal, but he didn't find a formal way. The Dragon Soul Crystal was magnified infinitely under the induction of the soul, and Lin Moyu searched it inch by inch extremely carefully. Suddenly, it saw an unusual place. This is. Longo. It saw that the dragon's mouth was slightly open, but not completely closed, there seems to be a gap between the dragon's mouth. The gaps are so small that you can't see them with the naked eye. Only by looking at it with the soul, can we see it after magnifying it countless times. The moment he saw Lonko, Lin Moyu guessed, it should be here. The power of the soul immediately drilled through the gap and spread towards the inside of the dragon soul crystal. Suddenly there was a click, followed by unprecedented pain. Even Lin Moyu couldn't help but let out a miserable snort this time. And Terry's laughter sounded again, as if it had expected this. Lin Moyu felt that his soul was bitten hard by someone, and a piece was bitten off abruptly. In fact, this is also the case, the dragon's mouth on the dragon soul crystal has been completely closed, and the soul that entered it has indeed been bitten off. After eating a piece of Lin Moyu's soul, the dragon soul crystal began to sparkle. Lin Moyu felt that there seemed to be some kind of connection between himself and dragon soul crystal. The dragon soul crystal disappeared into Lin Moyu's body as a stream of light and appeared in the spiritual world in the next second. The dragon soul crystal turned into a dragon, swimming and circling around Lin Moyu's soul. Spit dragon breath towards Lin Moyu from time to time. There is a huge impure soul power in the dragon's breath, which quickly replenishes Lin Moyu's lost soul just now. Lin Moyu's whole body was glowing, shrouded in a nine-color halo. He closed his eyes, feeling the power of dragon soul crystal. The soul has recovered in a blink of an eye, even stronger than before. The dragon transformed from the dragon soul crystal will breathe out dragon breath every once in a while, enhancing Lin Moyu's soul level. And when Lin Moyu actively touches the dragon soul spar with his soul, he no longer feels pain, but can feel the mysterious power from it, which is the king of power belonging to the law. Currently, with Lin Moyu's ability, he still can't understand this power. Need to accumulate, need comprehension, need level. Lin Moyu is not greedy, just take your time. And Terry's laughter stopped long ago, Zhao De Zhao, it feels good. Lin Moyu felt the feeling of the soul slowly becoming stronger, very good. And Terry said proudly, that's the nine-color dragon soul crystal, the top treasure of our dragon clan. Even among the dragon clan, not many are eligible to get it. You boy, you are really lucky. The level of the nine-colored dragon soul crystal itself is too high, far surpassing any mythical weapons. Being able to obtain such a treasure can no longer be described as good luck. Lin Moyu thanked Antares, thank you. Antares shook his head, no need. Once your soul is strong enough, you can start to comprehend the law. Don't be in a hurry to feel the power of the law now, it will be counterproductive to comprehend it forcefully. Lin Moyu wrote down the warning, Antares, why have you stayed in this world? Antares snorted, why are you asking that all of a sudden? Lin Moyu said, suddenly I feel a little curious, with your ability, the world is too small. Antares chuckled, I am here to hatch eggs, do you believe it? Lin Moyu asked in surprise, are you a mother? And Terry's blew his beard and stared, get out. I'm here for a reason. Why are you asking so many questions? Do I still have to report to you when I go to the bathroom? Lin Moyu laughed dryly, if you don't say it, don't say it, why are you angry? And Terry snorted, don't meddle in your own business, just do your own thing well. When you become a super god, you will know something naturally. Lin Moyu shrugged, okay. Please, Lord Antares, send me to the meteorite continent again. No, you go there by yourself. I'm tired and going to bed. Antares said that his head sank suddenly, he lay on the ground, and then snored. That look is up to you, I'm on strike, whatever I want. Okay, I'll go myself. I'll see you later. Lin Moyu said and flew out. After flying 10,000 meters, the breath soared. 
A few minutes later, a space-time tunnel appeared in front of him, sucking Lin Moyu in. Lin Moyu has reached level 72 now, and the upper space cannot accommodate him. After he left the range controlled by Antares, he exploded with his own strength, and was soon sent to the lower space by the rules of the ancient battlefield. The strong wind blows over, bringing a familiar smell into the nostrils. Wind Flower Smelling this smell, Lin Moya knew that he had come to Fong Lake Continent. The fragrance of flowers hit the body with the wind and the wind, and the skeleton armor was activated and sparkled. Open your eyes and look around, there are dense wind flowers all around. There are so many, and so many that you can't see the end at a glance. This is true up and down and left and right. Unexpectedly, he not only returned to Fong Lake Continent, but also fell into the group of Fenghua. Seriously, it's not that enemies don't get together. Before encountering a large group of wind flowers, and the world boss in the group of wind flowers, he had to use a random teleportation scroll to escape. 380, there was a small enmity between the two. And this time, Lin Moyu wants revenge and revenge. Out to mix, sooner or later have to repay. Saying softly in the mouth, the soul fluctuated slightly. Lin Moyu's will is the mission of the undead army. A large number of undead army appeared, and Feng Hua quickly started to hunt and kill them. This time, the results have been completely reversed. The last time Lin Moyu came, he hadn't been able to complete the third round. Only when the combat power is fully activated can it be on par with world bosses above level 85. If you want to kill the world boss, you need to use all the tricks, and the command needs to be accurate to 0.1 second. But now, the strength is not what it used to be, and the group of wind and flowers in front of it is no longer in its eyes. Lin Moyu doesn't even need to summon the skeleton king, just relying on the undead army is enough to crush the wind and flowers. A whole army of 140,000 undead was slaughtered, like locusts. After Lin Moyu summoned the undead army, he only did one thing. With a little finger, the sky is filled with red light. The sky and the earth turned red, and there were cursed swords everywhere. Lin Moyu found that he had been deeply involved in the group of Fenghua. The group of Fenghua was extremely large, with a number of more than 100,000. You can't see the end at a glance, and they are densely packed in all directions. Such a large group of wind flowers should be rare on the Fong Lake continent. World bosses must exist, but I don't know how many there are. Fenghua has a characteristic, the larger the scale, the higher the level of the world boss and the greater the number. Generally, if there are more than 1,000 wind flower groups, a boss will inevitably be born. The boss born by Fenghua group is different from other monsters. This boss is the aggregation of the power of Fenghua group. When the number of wind flowers exceeds 10,000, the power of the boss will increase significantly, thus becoming a world-class boss. As the number of wind flower groups increases, the level of the boss will increase accordingly. And when the number of wind flowers exceeds 100,000, there will be more than one world boss in the group. Specifically, how many world bosses there are, and how high the level is depends on the number and size of the wind flower group. According to the records in the ancient city of Xinxia, the largest group of wind flowers is currently known, with a number of more than 600,000. There should be more than eight world bosses inside, and each level is over 85. Such a force is almost invincible on Fong Lake Continent. Unless a god-level powerhouse does it himself, even an 88-level powerhouse, or even a half-step god-level powerhouse, can only flee. In the history of the human race, there was once an 89-level half-step god who was brutally surrounded and killed by Fenghua. Even Lin Moyu had to flee when facing Fenghua. We must know that even though Lin Moyu was not of a high level at that time, he had killed the poisonous python after all, and his combat power was not weak. Lin Moyu didn't know if his group of wind flowers was the group with the largest number in the records. But it doesn't matter, the undead army has already started. Under the double blow of the curse and the undead army, Fenghua died in a large number in an instant. Lin Moyu could sense a trace of soul power flying towards him from the dead wind flower. Soul power turned into experience, and various prompts jumped out. 
in the core area, after Lin Moyu left, and Terry's opened his eyes again. It opened its mouth and spit out a dragon ball. This is a dragon ball belonging to the dragon god, and it is a circle larger than the dragon ball of Antares. There are complex patterns on the dragon ball, which in Lin Moyu's eyes are chaotic and irregular. But in the eyes of Antares, it is the most beautiful pattern in the bottomless. These patterns have a name, dragon patterns. The dragon pattern is only useful to the dragon clan, and it contains the inheritance of the dragon clan. Especially the dragon ball of the dragon god, which has the inheritance of the dragon god. For any dragon, this dragon ball is the supreme treasure, even for Antares. But after getting the dragon ball of the dragon god, Antares didn't feel the slightest excitement, but bursts of sadness. At that time, Antares' dragon chanted continuously, shaking the world. Now it has calmed down, but its eyes are still full of complex emotions, it mutters to itself, Old man, why did you leave the inheritance to me? Don't you have a better candidate? Why not give it? What made you change your mind? Old man, won't you give me an explanation? Throw me here for tens of thousands of years, you are so ruthless. It is your son, am I not your son? You give me the inheritance dragon ball now, do you think I will forgive you? And Terry's voice gradually became harsher. The mist covering the whole body began to roll and rise, and the real body emerged from the mist. It didn't look like it appeared in front of the dragon god. The pair of wings on its body had disappeared, and its appearance was not much different from that of the dragon god. And Terry's aura kept rising, not much worse than dragon god. And Terry said coldly, I won't forgive you, even if you pass the inheritance to me, I won't forgive you either. You are not a good father, and I am not a good son. When I go out, I will kill the ancestral land. If you refuse to give it to me, I will take it back with my own hands. I'm going to kill him, turn the world upside down, bloodstain the galaxy. Even if the ancestral land is flooded with dragon blood, I will not hesitate, and Terry's murderous aura shot up to the sky, shaking the world. The entire ancient battlefield is buzzing non-stop. Lin Moyu in Fong Lake Continent frowned slightly and looked up at the sky. There are constant thunder explosions in the sky, and the sound of thunder is very common in Fong Lake Continent. Lin Moyu felt something unusual from the thunder. It's Antares. Lin Moyu felt Antares' murderous intent. Antares, what's wrong with you? Lin Moyu took out the dragon scale, activated it with soul power, and shouted at Antares. Antares didn't respond, Lin Moyu asked again, even with a hint of anxiety in his tone. He is a friend of Antares, and Antares is also his friend. Lin Moyu also doesn't have many friends, and Antares is a very important one. When he felt the strangeness of Antares, Lin Moyu was also anxious. Even after asking three times, Antares didn't respond. Lin Moyu is about to activate the teleportation function in the dragon scale and return to Antares. Just when Lin Moyu was about to move, Antares' voice came from the dragon scales, I'm fine. Antares' voice was still a little strange, especially the deep killing intent. Lin Moyu asked, Antares, do you want to kill someone? Antares didn't answer, and remained silent. Lin Moyu said, who do you want to kill? I'll help you. You are too weak. Antares said lightly. Lin Moyu said, I am weak now, but it doesn't mean I will be weak in the future. Ha! Huh. Do you know who I'm going to kill? Antares laughed dryly, if you knew, I'm afraid you wouldn't agree. Lin Moyu said, you are my friend, even if you want to kill Dragon God, I will help you. There was silence on the other side of the dragon scale, and Lin Moyu seemed to guess it. When I am strong enough, I will accompany you to kill the dragon god. There was another silence, and after a while, Antares' voice came, let's talk about the future. I'm going to sleep, don't disturb me. The dragon scales have dimmed, and Antares has disconnected. Lin Moyu sighed softly, it seems that Antares also has many stories in his heart. At this moment, Lin Moyu felt that he was indeed too weak. So weak that even friends can't help. Become stronger. Whether it's for yourself, or for your friends, relatives, lovers, you must become stronger. 
Looking at Feng Hua, who was being massacred by the undead army, Lin Moyu murmured, Weakness is the original sin. Although Lin Moyu didn't know why Antares came to this world and didn't leave for so long. Lin Moyu knew that Antares didn't come willingly, it had unavoidable difficulties. No matter what the reason is, it is helplessness, so it breeds such big resentment. And the reason is that it is not strong enough. If it is strong enough to overwhelm the world, how can anyone dare to make themselves do what they don't want to do? If you are dissatisfied, just hit back with your fist to teach you the truth. A big fist is the last word. Lin Moyu wants to be strong like this, and I am the reason. What you think in your heart keeps in your hands. The number of undead legions is increasing rapidly. At this time, a large area around him has been cleared, a large number of Fenghua have been killed, and Lin Moyu has also gained a lot of experience. Although it is not as good as obtaining soul energy directly, it does not overthrow the seedlings, and it is more conducive to stabilizing the foundation. In the soul, the nine-colored dragon hovers around, spouting dragon breath from time to time, to nourish the soul, and slowly improve the level of the soul. Dragon Soul Crystal has a great nourishing effect on the soul. Not only does the soul level increase, Lin Moyu also feels that the soul has become more solid. A sense of strength fills the whole body, and the foundation becomes more and more sold. In the future, he will be on a high ground, no matter how high he goes, he doesn't have to worry about the lack of foundation. A huge breath came from the depths of the wind flowers. Not just one but several breaths intertwined together. It's finally here. Lin Moyu looked at the past, and several huge wind flowers were raining in the wind thousands of meters away. Balls of pollen spilled out, carrying a strange fragrance. The pollen fell on the skeleton and exploded one after another, and a fireworks show was staged in the sky, which was extremely dazzling. It's not very powerful, but it's pretty good-looking. Lin Moyu's heart moved and the headless horseman had already rushed towards Fenghua boss. When the charge skill is activated, the headless horseman instantly kills and immediately surrounds Fenghua boss. One, two, three. There are six Fenghua bosses in total, and they are huge in size, hundreds of meters high. Bitter wind surrounds them, spinning and whistling constantly. Each petal is more than ten meters long, and there are many layers of layers. The petal slapped the headless horseman like a giant palm, and the huge force sent the headless horseman flying. There were so many petals, it was as if countless hands were beating for a moment, sending the headless horseman flying out of the hospital. Some headless horsemen were swept up by the whirlwind around Fenghua's body and blown into the distance. The whirlwind not only blows away the headless horseman, but also contains a large number of knife-like wind blades inside, hitting the headless horseman's armor making a fierce impact sound. The power is very strong, and the power attribute should exceed 1.5 million. This whirlwind should be the characteristic of Fenghua, and all world bosses have some characteristics. Lin Moyu could feel the extent of the headless horseman's injury, and he made a judgment in his heart. With the physique attribute of the headless horseman, it is impossible to fly them so easily with a strength attribute of more than 1.5 million. With a flick of the finger, the detection technique flew out. Giant Wind Flower, World Class Boss. Level, 86. Power, 2100000. Agility, 1000000. Spirit, 1 million. Physique, 2500000. Skills, Pollen Explosion, Petal Burst, Wind Flower, and Blood Moon. Characteristics, Whirlwind Armor, Wind Attribute Damage Reduced by 90%, Physical Damage Reduced by 50%, Vitality Enhancement and Attack Power Enhancement. The Power Attribute far exceeds 1.5 million, reaching 2.1 million. The Total Attribute is 6.6 .6 million, which is in line with its status as a Level 86 World Boss. The Level and Attributes are so strong that the Dullahan can't even touch it. Six giant wind flowers came together, and the whirlwind combined with each other, creating a strong wind for a while. When they entered the battlefield, the petals shook continuously, and it was difficult for the undead army to resist their attacks. 
pollen spread continuously on the battlefield and then exploded. The violent explosion also shook the undead army to scattered in all directions. Although they can't kill skeletons, skeletons can't get close to them either. Even the elemental riots of the skeleton archmage were blocked by their whirlwind armor. Only the sole attack of the skeleton sharpshooter can cause a little damage to them, and that's all. On the battlefield, there are not only undead legions and giant wind flowers, but also a large number of ordinary wind flowers constantly surrounding them, making it impossible for the skeletons to effectively siege the wind flower boss. Six Fingwa bosses that reached level 86 were rampaging on the battlefield, greatly reducing the efficiency of the undead army. Lin Moyu saw it and knew that the undead army was still a little bit close. After all, the level gap is here, and the gap is hard to ignore. If the undead army was also level 86 today, the situation of this battle would definitely be completely different. Lin Moyu looked at it for a while and saw the result. The undead army can't help Fenghua boss. Although Fenghua boss can repel the undead army, it can't kill them. Even if the two sides fight for a few days and nights, it is estimated that it will be a tie. You are the boss, and I have them too. With a slight movement in Lin Moyu's heart, 50,000 skeletons disappeared immediately. The sky was black and cloudy, and the temperature plummeted. Amidst the black clouds, the skeleton throne appeared, and the skeleton king slowly got up from the throne and swung his long sword. Lin Moyu didn't use all the skeletons to summon Skeletron. Only half of it was used, only 50,000. Because of his own level limitation, even if all 100,000 skeletons are used to summon the Skeleton King, the Skeleton King can only be infinitely close to the god-level attributes and cannot break through the tens of millions. This is a threshold, a threshold set by the law. As long as Lin Moyu, the master, does not step through this threshold for a day, his summons will be restricted. Lin Moyu tried summoning Skeletron with 80,000 skeletons and 100,000 skeletons. The difference between the total attributes of the two is only a few hundred thousand. For the Skeleton King who is approaching tens of millions of attributes, hundreds of thousands of attributes are nothing at all. Later, after testing, Lin Moyu found that 50,000 attributes are actually the most cost effective. The combat power is slightly weaker but not much worse. Even Lin Moyu can use the remaining skeletons to summon a second Skeletron. But Lin Moyu didn't do that, and the remaining 50,000 skeletons could not be better used to deal with ordinary Fenghua. The Skeleton King appeared and quickly locked on the boss of Mizong Fenghua. Skill, Slay God The long sword cut through the void, and the terrifying sword light flickered in the air. A skill capable of injuring a god-level powerhouse can be used against level 86 world bosses without any disadvantage. This sword locked on six Fenghua bosses at the same time, and the sword light streaked across them. There seemed to be a piercing sound in the air. Boss Fenghua let out a faint scream. A large number of petals were cut off, and the appearance of Fenghua boss suddenly became weird and incomplete. These chopped petals fluttered in the air, one after another, and each petal was several meters in size. With a gust of wind blowing, Zai suddenly changed sure. They are like the strongest weapons, piercing the space at an astonishing speed and coming to the skeleton king. Then the petals burst open. The skeleton king was blown back, and the bones on his body showed cracks visible to the naked eye. Even the front and rear bone cloaks were damaged. Even with its defensive power, it was also injured, and the injury was not light. It can be seen how powerful the petal explosion is. As expected of a world boss, there are always some powerful skills. Lin Moyu felt awe-inspiring, if it was in the past, he would face the Fenghua boss by himself. Just this skill is enough for his undead army to drink a pot. With a skill that even the skeleton king can seriously injure. Killing the undead army in seconds is not a problem. After the skeleton king was blown back, he rushed back quickly, his body shining with the light of healing. General Lich continued to cast healing spells, and in less than two seconds, the injuries on skeleton king were healed. Halfway through, the skeleton king released his skills again. The elements instantly became confused and roared loudly. 
Boss Fenghua also exploded continuously, and Wusu exploded with a bang. This time, their whirlwind armor couldn't stop them, the whirlwind was blown out, and a large number of petals were blown away again. Not to be outdone, Flower Wind Boss rushed towards the Skeleton King in an instant and exploded again. The Skeleton King's body was shining, with absolute defense blessings, and he abruptly carried the petal explosion to the front of Fenghua Boss. The bone sword in his hand flew across quickly, and the sword energy was flying horizontally and petals flew wildly. Fenghua Boss surrounded the Skeleton King and besieged it. The Skeleton King is one against six, wearing absolute defense, without any disadvantage. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and he pointed in the air. The Phantom of the Undead World descends, and the Gate of the Undead opens. Skill, Undead Stair Zero, the door opened, and the eyes of the undead emerged, sweeping across the world in an instant. A large number of wind flowers died silently. The six bosses trembled at the same time and a large number of petals fell off. Soul damage made them feel painful, and even their offensive was weakened. Skeleton King took the opportunity to swing his long sword repeatedly and launched a fierce attack. The headless horseman came from the outside. At this time, the whirlwind armor on Fenghua Boss's body was blown out, and most of the petals were also blown out. The headless horseman could no longer be completely blocked out. The headless horseman rushed to Fenghua's body, the knight sword in his hand slashed out like lightning, and landed on Fenghua's boss. If one sword is not enough, then two swords. Although the headless horseman's attack can only cause a small amount of damage to Fenghua boss, it can't hold back the large number of them. Thousands of sharp swords fell on the petals almost every second. The white bone horseshoe under his body also stepped on Fenghua, and the silver white flames burned blazingly which also caused damage to Fenghua's boss. The Fenghua bosses struggled frantically, but after their protective whirlwind was blown out, they were unable to stop the headless horsemen coming from all directions. For a moment, the huge body was covered with headless horsemen. The scene of many ants killing the elephant appeared again. Lin Moyu seems to have returned to how he got the world bosses half a year ago. The weak beat the strong? No, the more the stronger, the stronger. Even if each sword is scraping, but thousands of swords, tens of thousands of swords, basically tens of millions of swords, can kill the boss. Fenghua boss kept struggling, the petals were cut off continuously, the number became less and less, revealing the thick and long flower stems. Lin Moyu watched them become bald, but unfortunately they did not become stronger. At this time, the undead army also cleaned up the ordinary Fenghua almost, and the undead gaze cooperated with the undead army, and every time they glanced, a big emperor Fenghua would die silently. Another piercing sword light lit up. The cooldown of the skeleton king's skills is over, and he swung the sword again. In the light of the sword, two Fenghua bosses that had lost their petals were chopped off in half. Lin Moyu heard the screams in the air again. Bosses of the plant type rarely make sounds. Fenghua's voice is like the sound of the soul, coming from the wind, and it sounds extremely sad. The vitality of the plant type boss is extremely strong, even if it is cut off in the middle, the Fenghua boss is not dead, and still has a huge fighting power. A large number of roots grow out from under the body, dancing wildly, like braids whipping the skeleton king and the headless horseman. The last skill, it's time to activate it. Lin Moyu was a little curious in his eyes, wondering what Fenghua's third skill would do. Fenghua boss has three skills, pollen explosion, petal burst, and wind flower blood moon. Among them, pollen explosion and petal bursting have already been seen. The power of pollen explosion is average, and the power of petal bursting is not small, but the number of petals is limited. Now there is only one last skill left, Fenghua Shiweyue. Literally, Lin Moyu can't analyze what kind of skill it is. Blood Moon. What means? Fenghua boss kept screaming with the voice of the soul. The voice of the soul scattered with the wind and spread throughout the entire group of wind flowers. At this time, only half of the super large scale Fenghua group had been killed. The remaining number of Fenghua is less than 200,000. 
The six Fanghua bosses have also been beaten half to death at this moment. The sound of their souls pierced the heavens and the earth, and even ordinary wind flowers made similar sounds. The frequency of the sound quickly reached the same level, and the sound of the soul immediately became several times stronger. There was a thunder in the sky, and then the clouds cleared and the fog cleared, and a bright moon appeared in the sky. There was no moon in Fong Lake Continent originally, let alone Fong Lake Continent, even the ancient battlefield at least could have a moon. But now, a big, round moon is shining brightly in the sky. Then Lin Moyu's face changed slightly, and he heard the sound of souls coming from afar. The bright moon in the sky seemed to be an amplifier, expanding Feng Hua's soul and spreading it to the entire Fong Lake continent. At the same time, it is also a receiver, bringing together the power of the various wind flowers in the Feng Lake continent. A large number of wind flowers flew towards the bright moon. The same is true for the six Fenghua bosses. Layers of moonlight fell, like an invisible giant hand pushing away all the headless horsemen on Fenghua boss, and even the skeleton king was pushed nearly a thousand kai away. Lin Moyu watched the big and small wind flowers flying towards the bright moon in the sky, and did not stop them. The eyes are full of curiosity, lamenting that the world is full of wonders. A strange skill, it looks very beautiful, but I don't know how powerful it is. This skill is the most gorgeous and beautiful skill among all the skills it has seen. Beauty often means danger, and he has already become vigilant. The moonlight became more and more intense, and in just a few seconds, all the wind and flowers had been fully integrated into the moonlight. Even those Fenghua who were killed just now, and the corpses that fell on the ground, disappeared under the moonlight at this time. Not only that, but there are more wind and flowers in the distance. Although they didn't come over, their power resonated with Mingyue through the soul. This continued for about thirty seconds, and the bright moon began to change, it was stained with a layer of blood. Romance Lin Moyu suddenly understood the meaning of this skill. Although Feng Lei Continent is the domain of demons and dragons, there are still many human professionals working here. They all saw the blood moon. The blood moon illuminates the entire Feng Lei continent, causing wind and flowers to resonate. At this moment, countless wind flowers on the Feng Lei continent are facing the blood moon, blooming one after another, as if they are on a pilgrimage. Fenghua Shueyue, this is the ultimate skill of Fenghua in the legend. At least it requires the joint efforts of the world boss and the supergroup of wind and flowers to display skills but who has the ability to challenge the supergroup of wind and flowers? It's not just a challenge, at least you have to beat them to death, this is the ultimate skill. I don't know where the team came from, it's too strong. Could it be a god-level existence that came back from deep space? Not only human professionals are talking about it, demons and dragons have also seen the blood moon. Everyone showed shock. In the Feng Lake continent, the most terrifying thing is the Dwichuan and Fenghuacan. The group of thunder trees won't move, it's just there for a glance, as long as you don't provoke them, everything will be fine. But the wind and flowers go with the wind, and God knows when they will collide. Relatively speaking, Fenghuacan is even more terrifying. Especially its ultimate skill, wind flower and blood moon. The number of times it has appeared in history is also very few. No one ever knew its true power, for those who saw it died. Lin Moyu found that the space was locked, and all teleportation items were invalid. The imprint left by the ancient city of Xinxia is dim, and all teleportation items are invalid, even the teleportation stone to the abyss is useless. The light of the blood moon carried the power of law, suppressing the power of teleportation. Only the dragon scales of Antares are still as usual. Antares' power is too strong and ordinary laws can't suppress its power. Lin Moyu had a word in his mind at this moment, never die. Switching to any professional, there will be no retreat at this moment, either life or death, there can only be one result between himself and Fenghua. Otherwise, with as long as two minutes of preparation time, anyone could escape. The space was cut to form an independent space, unless Fenghua was killed, it would be difficult to leave. In the blood moon, a huge wind flower appeared. The wind flower is hundreds of meters high, with dense flowers and leaves all over the body, 
and there are countless petals layered on top of each other. The petals trembled for a while, shaking off countless pollen. The strong wind blows the pollen away, and the pollen covers the entire space almost in the blink of an eye. Immediately afterwards, the pollen exploded, covering every corner of the space, giving no room to dodge at all. The entire undead army was submerged by the explosion. The power has increased a lot. Lin Moyu's complexion changed slightly, the undead army was collectively injured, and Feng Hua boss became stronger. The explosion officially opened the prelude to the decisive battle, and the undead army began to counterattack during the explosion. The skeleton king raised his hand to kill God with a sword. The sword light cut through the space and exploded on Feng Hua boss, dropping 1.1 petals. But in the next second, the fallen petals turned back and grew back again, as if they hadn't been injured. The headless horseman activated the charge skill, and the blood moon suddenly shook, emitting thick moonlight. In the moonlight, the space became like a paste, and the headless horseman's charging skills were greatly hindered, and he couldn't even use one-tenth of his usual speed. At this time, Fenghua sprinkled a large amount of pollen again and exploded in the air, forcefully blasting the headless horseman back. Fenghua boss has become much stronger, exceeding Lin Moyu's expectations. A detection technique flew out and landed on Fenghua boss. Windflower Blood Moon Level, 90 Power, 2500000 Agility, 2000000 Spirit, 2000000. Physique, 3500000. Skills, Unlimited Pollen Bombing, Petal Devouring. Characteristics, Gust Armor, Immunity to Wind Elements, Rapid Recovery, Greatly Enhanced Vitality, and Greatly Enhanced Attack Power. It turns out that Feng Shuiyue is not a skill, Wind Flower Blood Moon is neither a skill nor a skill. If you want to subdivide it, Blood Moon is a skill, but Wind Flower is not. The Blood Moon stood in the sky, gathering almost all the power of Fenghua on the Feng Lei continent. The wind and flowers merged into one, and eventually a level 90 wind and flower boss appeared. A god-level world boss with attributes that have just reached tens of millions. The god-level aura spread across the Feng Lei continent, making people shiver. Perhaps because Fenghua was originally a native creature on Feng Lei continent, or because of other reasons, it was not expelled by the rules of the ancient battlefield. In the lower space, you can unscrupulously display the power of the god-level level. No wonder, even if there are god-level powerhouses coming from the deep space, they can't fight for a long time. So Fenghua boss can be said to be invincible in Feng Lei continent, only Lei Shu group can compare with it. Such a pity. Lin Moyu sighed softly, this pity contained multiple meanings. One of them is that it is a pity that Feng Hua met her. Lin Moyu has killed many gods, so naturally he didn't pay attention to the Feng Hua boss in front of him. Even if it becomes a god level, so what, it should be killed. God level bosses should drop legendary level materials, but I don't know if there will be other good things. Lin Moyu muttered to himself, he didn't need the legendary material, but Meng Anwen and Bai Yuan both needed it. The human race is short of legendary equipment, and many god-level powerhouses still use quasi-legendary equipment. Lin Zero Two silently stared at the blood moon, with a little puzzlement in his eyes. The blood moon seems to contain the power of law. It's really strange, how can a boss who is only level 90 have the power of law? The skeleton king turned on absolute defense, ignored all kinds of damage, and led the undead army to kill him. After several fruitless charges, the headless horseman resolutely activated the group defense, protected the entire undead army, and charged forward as well. The pollen kept exploding, but blocked the attack of the undead army, and was killed in front of him in a blink of an eye. Suddenly, the petals fell off one by one, and quickly formed a large net of petals in the air covering the skeleton king and the undead army. Fenghua boss launched its second skill, Petal Devour. Blood Moon gathers the power of all Fenghua in Feng Lei continent. The Fenghua boss has reached the god level. The power of the pollen explosion has been greatly increased, 
and the light of the blood moon has made the air sticky like paste. If the defense skills are not activated, the undead army cannot approach. Now its second skill is activated, the petals are flying down, obviously this skill is stronger. The blood moon sprinkled layers of light, and the air viscosity increased significantly again. Even Lin Moyu was having a hard time breathing. Under the moonlight, the petals changed into ten, ten into hundreds, and in an instant, they were densely packed and occupied a large amount of space, completely surrounding the undead army. Lin Moyu's heart skipped a beat, and he had a bad premonition. This skill seems to be very strong. He clearly felt that a trace of the power of law spilled from the blood moon into the petals. Huge and terrifying devouring power grows from the petals. Lin Moyu can clearly feel that the power of the undead army, all life is swallowed. The undead army collapsed at an astonishing speed. In less than two seconds, the undead army collapsed. In the face of the law, the group defense of the headless horseman and the absolute defense of the skeleton king are all invalid. Because of Lin Moyu's talent, all damage is shared by all members of the undead army, even the skeletons outside the encirclement are not spared. The power of the law is really strong. However, Feng Hua, who is only level 90, can possibly drive the power of law. Lin Moyu is a little puzzled, the power of law can only be touched at the peak of level 95 at least. Feng Hua boss is obviously only level 90, so it is impossible to touch the law. So there is only one possibility, that is, there is something wrong with the blood moon behind it. Lin Yu cast his eyes on Shiwei Yue, but couldn't see anything. With the power of law, after destroying the undead army, the petals flew towards Lin Moyu with the strong wind. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the undead army appeared again in unison. After the undead army died for the first time, they were collectively reborn in the summoning space. If you want to kill the undead army, you need to kill five times in a row within one minute. Otherwise, the undead army is immortal. The wind was billowing, and the skeleton throne appeared in midair. The skeleton king appeared again, this time Lin Moyu used 100,000 skeletons to push the skeleton king's attributes to the limit. The current situation is different from before, and the use of the undead army is of little significance. It's better to concentrate all the strength. In addition to the skeleton king, the headless horsemen also appeared one after another. However, they didn't go forward, but dispersed, and together with General Lich, they existed as wound-bearing units. The elemental Lich, which has never been used, also appeared this time, bringing blessings to Skeleton King. The main thing is the aura of immortality, which can make the undead army die one more time. The light on the back of the left hand is shining, and the strong soldier skill is activated. The Skeleton King broke through to the god level in an instant. With the blessing of the strength soldier skill, Skeleton King has a combat power of around level 92 and the explosive power when using the skill has reached level 93, stepping into the level of a medium god. The Scarlet Cloak was hunting behind him, the soul fire in the skull of the Skeleton King was blazing, and the giant white bone sword slashed out fiercely. Skill, Slay God This blow can be said to be Lin Moyu's strongest blow, without relying on external objects. The thousand-meter-long sword light rubbed against the space, making an ear-piercing buzzing sound. Countless roots suddenly grew from the bottom of Feng Hua Boss, each root was covered by strong wind, forming armor to block the sword. Wherever Jian Wang passed, the petals burst one after another. The roots were cut off neatly, and the sword light passed through Feng Hua Boss's body, and chopped on the blood moon. With a bang, the blood moon trembled violently, making a deafening crash. Feng Hua Boss kept screaming, and the voice of the soul resounded through the world again. Amidst the screams, its body was broken in two, and its upper body was falling. But in the next second, the upper body began to turn backwards again, as if time was going backwards. Extremely fast recovery feature. Just like the petals that were cut off just now, they will automatically return to their original place and recover again. Lin Moyu stared at the blood moon, and when this feature was activated, the light of the blood moon became more intense. This characteristic is related to and. The law of devouring is also related to the blood moon. 
This blood moon is unusual. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the skeleton king activated his skills again. Skill, Elemental Riot. At the same time, the gate of the dead looked towards Fenghua. The elements exploded in chaos, and mushroom clouds soared into the air. Under the blessing of, strong soldier, skill, undead gaze's damage will increase by an additional 500%. During the explosion, the skeleton king charged up like lightning, slashing with his sword. Wind flower blood moon is neither a skill nor a skill. If you want to subdivide it, blood moon is a skill, but wind flower is not. The blood moon stood in the sky, gathering almost all the power of Fenghua on the Fong Lei continent. The wind and flowers merged into one, and eventually a level 90 wind and flower boss appeared. A god-level world boss with attributes that have just reached tens of millions. The god-level aura spread across the Fong Lei continent, making people shiver. Perhaps because Fenghua was originally a native creature on Fong Lei continent, or because of other reasons, it was not expelled by the rules of the ancient battlefield. In the lower space, you can unscrupulously display the power of the god-level level. No wonder, even if there are god-level powerhouses coming from the deep space, they can't fight for a long time. So Fenghua boss can be said to be invincible in Fong Lei continent, only Lei Shu group can compare with it. Such a pity. Lin Moyu sighed softly, this pity contained multiple meanings. One of them is that it is a pity that Fenghua met her. Lin Moyu has killed many gods, so naturally he didn't pay attention to the Fenghua boss in front of him. Even if it becomes a god level, so what, it should be killed. God level bosses should drop legendary level materials, but I don't know if there will be other good things. Lin Moyu muttered to himself, he didn't need the legendary material, but Meng Anwen and Bai Yuan both needed it. The human race is short of legendary equipment, and many god-level powerhouses still use quasi-legendary equipment. Lin Zero Two silently stared at the blood moon, with a little puzzlement in his eyes. The blood moon seems to contain the power of law. It's really strange, how can a boss who is only level 90 have the power of law? The skeleton king turned on absolute defense, ignored all kinds of damage, and led the undead army to kill him. After several fruitless charges, the headless horseman resolutely activated the group defense, protected the entire undead army, and charged forward as well. The pollen kept exploding, but blocked the attack of the undead army, and was killed in front of him in a blink of an eye. Suddenly, the petals fell off one by one, and quickly formed a large net of petals in the air, covering the skeleton king and the undead army. Fenghua boss launched its second skill, Petal Devour. Blood Moon gathers the power of all Fenghua in Fong Lei Continent. The Fenghua boss has reached the god level. The power of the pollen explosion has been greatly increased, and the light of the Blood Moon has made the air sticky like paste. If the defense skills are not activated, the undead army cannot approach. Now its second skill is activated, the petals are flying down, obviously this skill is stronger. The Blood Moon sprinkled layers of light and the air viscosity increased significantly again. Even Lin Moyu was having a hard time breathing. Under the moonlight, the petals changed into ten, ten into hundreds, and in an instant, they were densely packed and occupied a large amount of space, completely surrounding the undead army. Lin Moyu's heart skipped a beat, and he had a bad premonition. This skill seems to be very strong. He clearly felt that a trace of the power of law spilled from the blood moon into the petals. Huge and terrifying devouring power grows from the petals. Lin Moyu can clearly feel that the power of the undead army, all life is swallowed. The undead army collapsed at an astonishing speed. In less than two seconds, the undead army collapsed. In the face of the law, the group defense of the headless horseman and the absolute defense of the skeleton king are all invalid. Because of Lin Moyu's talent, all damage is shared by all members of the undead army, even the skeletons outside the encirclement are not spared. The power of the law is really strong. However, Fenghua, who is only level 90, can possibly drive the power of law. Lin Moyu is a little puzzled, the power of law can only be touched at the peak of level 95 at least. Fenghua boss is obviously only level 90, 
so it is impossible to touch the law. So there is only one possibility, that is, there is something wrong with the blood moon behind it. Lin Yu cast his eyes on Shiwe Yue, but couldn't see anything. With the power of law, after destroying the undead army, the petals flew towards Lin Moyu with the strong wind. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the undead army appeared again in unison. After the undead army died for the first time, they were collectively reborn in the summoning space. If you want to kill the undead army, you need to kill five times in a row within one minute. Otherwise, the undead army is immortal. The wind was billowing, and the skeleton throne appeared in midair. The skeleton king appeared again, this time Lin Moyu used 100,000 skeletons to push the skeleton king's attributes to the limit. The current situation is different from before, and the use of the undead army is of little significance. It's better to concentrate all the strength. In addition to the skeleton king, the headless horsemen also appeared one after another. However, they didn't go forward, but dispersed, and together with General Lich, they existed as wound-bearing units. The elemental Lich, which has never been used, also appeared this time, bringing blessings to Skeleton King. The main thing is the aura of immortality, which can make the undead army die one more time. The light on the back of the left hand is shining, and the strong soldier skill is activated. The skeleton king broke through to the god level in an instant. With the blessing of the strength soldier skill, skeleton king has a combat power of around level 92, and the explosive power when using the skill has reached level 93, stepping into the level of a medium god. The scarlet cloak was hunting behind him, the soul fire in the skull of the skeleton king was blazing and the giant white bone sword slashed out fiercely. Skill, slay god. This blow can be said to be Lin Moyu's strongest blow, without relying on external objects. The thousand-meter-long sword light rubbed against the space, making an ear-piercing buzzing sound. Countless roots suddenly grew from the bottom of Fenghua Boss, each root was covered by strong wind, forming armor to block the sword. Wherever Jan Wang passed, the petals burst one after another. The roots were cut off neatly, and the sword light passed through Fenghua Boss's body, and chopped on the blood moon. With a bang, the blood moon trembled violently, making a deafening crash. Fenghua Boss kept screaming, and the voice of the soul resounded through the world again. Amidst the screams, its body was broken in two, and its upper body was falling. But in the next second, the upper body began to turn backwards again, as if time was going backwards. Extremely fast recovery feature. Just like the petals that were cut off just now, they will automatically return to their original place and recover again. Lin Moyu stared at the blood moon, and when this feature was activated, the light of the blood moon became more intense. This characteristic is related to and. The law of devouring is also related to the blood moon. This blood moon is unusual. Lin Moyu's heart moved and the Skeleton King activated his skills again, skill, elemental riot. At the same time, the Gate of the Dead looked towards Fenghua. The elements exploded in chaos, and mushroom clouds soared into the air. Under the blessing of, strong soldier, skill, undead gazes damage will increase by an additional 500%. During the explosion, the Skeleton King charged up like lightning, slashing with his sword, Fenghua is dead, but the blood moon is still there. Lin Moyu rides above the blood moon. Seen from the ground, the blood moon is extremely huge, just like a real bright moon. No matter where you are in Fonle continent, you can clearly see the blood moon. But when Lin Moyu got closer, he realized that the blood moon was actually just a disc the size of a palm. A large amount of soul power was absorbed in the disc, and it bloomed with a bloody appearance. When it has no power to infuse, it is a transparent jade plate. Now Fenghua Boss is dead, and the blood moon is gradually dissipating. The light on the disc is rapidly receding, returning to its original appearance. Lin Moyu held it in his hand and felt the power of the law in it. The detection technique flew out and landed on it. Blood God Plate, Mythical Weapon, The Weapon of the Blood Devouring God Lin Moyu was surprised, he didn't expect it to be a mythical weapon, and it was also the weapon of the blood-devouring god. The blood-devouring god is not well known, not as famous as several elemental gods. 
but that doesn't mean it's weak. Its existence is somewhat unfamiliar to ordinary people, but it is not a secret to the royal family. Lin Moyu once saw information about the blood-devouring god in the secret vault. This is a high-level deity, an existence of the same level as the god of life. It is said that it is born from a piece of blood, and finally becomes a god. The data also said that the blood-devouring god has the ability to devour everything and is immortal. Indeed, its weapons also exhibit the power of devouring, whether it is an attack or life, it can be devoured. But can it really be immortal? He even lost his weapon, needless to say, the blood-devouring god must have died. As for why it was hung, Lin Moyu is not clear, it may be traced back to the last era, or even longer. Anyway, so many gods have already died, so it's not bad for one of them. As for the reason, Lin Moyu once wanted to know very much, but now he has given up. What's the use if you know it? As Antares said, when one's strength is reached, one will know what one should know. Lin Moyu is more concerned about how to use this mythical weapon. I definitely can't use it anymore, but I can give it to Meng Anwen and the others. Mr. Bai and Mr. Yan's fighting methods are too fierce, and it seems that they are not suitable for this weapon. Teacher Meng is more suitable, and I will give it when I get back. The three teachers have a deep affection for Lin Moyu, and Lin Moyu will naturally think of them when he has good things. After Lin Moyu put away the blood god disc, the blood moon in the sky disappeared completely. Feng Hua, who will be born again in the future, will no longer have this skill. Lin Moyu has already determined at this time that the group of wind flowers he eliminated is the largest group in the mainland. The reason why this group of wind flowers are so powerful is because of the blood god disc. Feng Hua is so powerful, because of the blood god disc, what about the thunder tree group? Lin Moyu's heart moved, and he turned his gaze to the center of Feng Lei continent. There is the largest group of thunder trees in Feng Lei continent. The mountains that spread for thousands of miles are full of thunder trees, innumerable. The meddlers once counted that there are at least one million thunder trees living in it. The thunder tree group is larger than the wind flower group. Million. Lin Moyu suddenly realized something, and quickly checked his own experience, 98%. The experience has reached 98% of level 72, and there is only 2% left to upgrade to level 73. After killing the wind flower group, it almost rose from level 72 to level 73. If someone said now, the speed of fighting monsters and leveling in the wild is definitely not as good as brushing dungeons. Lin Moyu will definitely slap him to wake him up. If you want to level up quickly, you can come and brush the wind flower group. Level 1 is not a dream for a long time, of course, the premise is that you can beat it. Before killing Feng Guokan, Lin Moyu only dispatched the undead army, and he hadn't done it himself. Otherwise, the efficiency can be greatly improved. As long as there are enough monsters, my upgrade speed will increase infinitely. Lin Moyu knew he had found a shortcut to level up quickly. Suppressing the excitement in my heart, I first checked the income this time. Killing ordinary wind flowers, large and small materials are difficult to count. Fortunately, the storage space increases with the character level. If it is changed to level 40, it will be full already. Fenghua boss dropped two legendary materials, Fenghua Heart and Fenghua Essence which can be used to make or upgrade legendary equipment. For him, these two things did not have much effect. The wind flower seeds need a god-level breeder to come in and cultivate them. As far as he knows, there is no god-level breeder in the human race. Useful or not, Lin Moyu puts things away. Maybe it will come in handy sometime in the future. After checking the properties, Lin Moyu flew towards the center of Feng Lei continent. The full moon disappeared, and the whole Feng Lei seemed to be immersed in sadness at this time. Countless wind flowers on the mainland are screaming, their master has been killed. The breath of sadness is transmitted through the voice of the soul. Many people can't hear the voice of the soul, but they can feel the sadness in it. Lin Moyu heard this voice and knew that it was Feng Hua who was crying. Weakness is the original sin. When the human race was slaughtered wantonly by demons, it was useless to cry any longer. So we must become stronger and keep getting stronger. 
Lin Moyu clenched his fists and said to himself again. This is how everything in the world works, the weak prey on the strong. As strong as Antares, he was also thrown here, and it can even be said that he lost his freedom. Antares has hatred in his heart, hatred, and murderous intent. It can be seen that when it sees the dragon god, what can it do? It just wants to call out to the dragon god to hide its hatred. Lin Moyu didn't want this. It is enough for others to experience this kind of pain, so don't experience it yourself. After Lin Moyu left, many people came to the place where he was originally. There are demons, dragons, and humans. The three forces gathered together and kept vigilance against each other. There were quite a few people who came, and the three pillars stood to check and balance each other, surprisingly maintaining a considerable peace, and no one made a move. Everyone can feel the breath left by the previous war. This is a god-level battle. I saw Feng Huashuiyue just now, it turned out to be god-level, it's too scary. It seems that a god-level powerhouse came here on purpose, to kill Feng Guokan. What is the origin of this god-level powerhouse? Is it from our human race? A group of people speculated that Lin Moyu left after the fight and did not stay. No matter how hard they think about it, they can't figure it out. The three parties confronted each other for a long time and finally retreated. Racial enemies who would fight to death when meeting each other now have maintained due restraint due to the emergence of a third-party race. No one wants the snipe and the clam to fight each other, and the fishermen will benefit in the end. Lin Moyu didn't know what happened, and it rushed towards the Thunder Mountain of Fong Lake Continent at the fastest speed. After flying for about half an hour, Lin Moyu suddenly stopped. A group of dragon warriors blocked his way. There are more than a hundred dragon warriors, the highest level is 85, and the lowest level is no less than 75. There is also a warship accompanying them. Lin Moyu is not surprised that the dragon clan will find him. I carry a strong dragon aura on my body, and I just slaughtered the thirteen dragon kings of the dragon clan not long ago, and this aura is even more astonishing, even if they are separated by hundreds of miles, they can be sensed by the dragon clan. When they saw Lin Moyu, the dragon generals had both ferocity and hesitation on their faces. Lin Moyu's aura is too strong, in their eyes, Lin Moyu's aura is like billowing thick smoke rushing into the sky. They have never seen this before, and they can't imagine how many dragon people have been killed under Lin Moyu's hands. Zhao Sings Zhao They felt that they were too rash to come here, and maybe they would become the dead dragon under Lin Moyu's subordinates. Lin Moyu quickly gave them the answer. Lin Moyu didn't stop at all, the headless horseman rushed out. The charge skill was launched, and the headless horseman rushed over like lightning, crushing the dragon team in an instant. The warship was smashed to pieces by the headless horseman, leaving it empty. The dragon warrior was beheaded on the spot by the headless horseman in panic, and only the level 85 dragon warrior counterattacked twice symbolically. As for the other dragon warriors, they couldn't even do the most basic counterattack. Lin Moyu flew over without stopping, I forgot, this is the territory of the dragon clan. I don't know what happened to the secret realm of the dragon clan. I don't know if the poisonous gas has dissipated. When the group of wind and thunder trees is destroyed, go back and have a look. Lin Moyu still remembers the derived blood pool in the secret realm last time. Although it can only copy dragon warriors of level 70, no matter how many there are, there is no threat to themselves. But for other professionals, it is very dangerous. If a war is launched, it may cause a lot of casualties. Lin Moyu intends to go back and take a look, if possible, then destroy the derived blood pool. Along the way, they encountered several groups of dragons. They searched for their breath, and when they saw Lin Moyu, they were frightened again. Lin Moyu didn't give them a chance to escape, and they all became the souls of the headless horseman's sword. Lin Moyu had an idea in his heart, maybe he could sweep the Fong Lake continent, slaughter all the dragons and abyssal demons in the Fong Lake continent, and drive them out. But this idea was extinguished as soon as it came out. Although in this way, the safety of the human race in the lower space will be greatly improved, but for the human race, it is not a good thing. Natural Selection, Survival of the Fittest 
human race needs to become stronger in battle so as not to lose their fighting spirit. The thunder became louder and louder, the sky was even more thunderous and lightning, and the sky was thunderbolt. The thunder snake was swimming in the air, chopping down from time to time. The thunder and lightning fell on the thunder tree and was absorbed by the thunder tree. Lei Shu keeps growing stronger by absorbing lightning. Lin Moyu has come to the area where Lei Shu is located, and he can see the endless Lei Shu mountains as far as he can see. Thunder Mountain, the mountain with the largest number of thunder trees and the largest scale on the Feng Lei continent. Millions of thunder trees live here. No one knows how many bosses there are and how strong the bosses are. Moreover, there are many other monsters in the Thunder Tree group. They coexist with Thunder Tree and do not interfere with each other. There are few people here, and no one wants to come here. It is true that Thunder Tree will not take the initiative to attack, but these monsters will. It will be very troublesome if you are entangled by monsters. If he accidentally uses a range attack and provokes Lei Shu, it will be a fatal matter. Lei Xu attacked in groups, not many professionals could withstand it. However, Feng Hua is relatively safe. As long as you are lucky enough and don't go too deep, you can escape from Xing Tian. If you have already gone deep into the Thunder Mountain Range, 113, no can only ask for blessings. Lin Moyu flew into the Thunder Mountain Range for about a hundred miles and stopped moving, but stayed at high altitude, looking at the group of thunder trees below. There are tall and short thunder trees, the shorter the tree, the thinner the trunk, and the taller, the thicker the trunk. Thickness and height are different, which also means that the level of Lei Shu is different. Generally speaking, the taller and thicker the person, the higher the grade. This is the record in the data, and it is also information that everyone knows. Lin Moyu observed carefully and found something different. Thousands of thunder trees are used as a unit and every 10,000 thunder trees will form a small area. The division of this area is not obvious, but you can still see it if you look closely. Lin Moyu muttered to himself, he saw that the group of thunder trees had also been divided into their own areas, each area was separated by tens of meters. And some monsters can be seen living in these intervals. If the entire thunder mountain range is regarded as a country, then this area is the city in the country. Every city is distinct. There are exactly 10,000 thunder trees in an area, and one of the 10,000 thunder trees grows extremely thick, which is the leader and a world-class boss. From the aura it exudes, Lin Moyu probably judged that it should be around level 80. His gaze continued to look deep, and Lin Moyu also flew towards the depths of the Thunder Mountain Range. This place has completely disappeared, and it has become a world of lightning and thunder trees. Even Fenghua cannot survive here. Lin Moyu observed along the way, and saw a lot of different information. Lei Xu lives in groups of 10,000. After exceeding 100,000, a thicker thunder tree will appear among them, becoming the leader of the 100,000 thunder trees. The area composed of 100,000 thunder trees is like a province in a country. If you look at it, there should be a real king in the thunder tree, who controls all the thunder trees and this king should be in the center of the Thunder Mountain Range. Lin Moyu looked towards the center of the Thunder Mountain Range, and the power of the soul spread accordingly. It just so happened that a thunderbolt appeared in the distant sky. The entire Thunder Mountain was lit up, and Lin Moyu saw dense electric snakes extending from a distance, like spider webs. The space is distorted, as if it is about to be torn apart. Lin Moyu saw it in his eyes, its amazing Lei Guang, it's very close to the god level. After the thunder light spread hundreds of miles in the air, a bolt of lightning connected the sky and earth, and crashed down. In the lightning, Lin Moyu saw a huge lightning tree. The thunder tree is located at the top of the mountain range, connecting the sky and the earth, allowing it to be bombarded by lightning without fear. This is the king of thunder tree. Lin Moyu confirmed the existence of the opponent at a glance. Although he didn't have detection skills, he had roughly guessed the opponent's level. At least at level 88, maybe even level 89, but not at the god level. It doesn't have a god level aura. And the closer the place is to the king of thunder tree, the stronger the thunder tree will be. 
with the help of Lei Guang Lin Moyu also saw a batch of boss-level thunder trees. Not a few trees, but a batch. These thunder tree bosses are like guards, guarding the king of thunder tree. The thunder light continued to fall on it, and then spread towards the ground. Lin Moyu narrowed his eyes slightly, the thunder light disappeared after entering the ground. Is there anything weird underground? Lin Moyu felt something was wrong, but he couldn't tell what was wrong. Ever since he saw the structure of the Thunder Tree group, Lin Moyu had an inexplicable feeling that the Thunder Tree was not like a plant, but more like an animal. Ordinary plants do not form such a pattern, it is too orderly. Judging from the information obtained so far, Lei Xu has a certain intelligence instinct, and even has some simple ruling rules. Regional division by country, province, and city, this is not like what plants can do. Just as he was thinking, a sharp cry came from his ear. A thunder eagle flew out of the group of thunder trees with sparks and lightning, and charged straight at it. A fire flashed in Lin Moyu's hand. Skill, soul flame. Laying screamed and fell down in the air. This thunderhawk's level is not high, only around level 75, and it's not a boss, so it was almost instantly killed by the soul flame. It fell back to the ground and then the screams continued to ring out. The group of thunder trees seemed to be rioting, and a large number of thunder eagles lifted off and rushed towards Lin Moyu. It really hit one and caused a group of people. Lin Moyu originally came to Thunder Mountain to fight Thunder Tree, so he would naturally fight with the monsters in the mountains. The undead army appeared in the air, and before the headless horseman could launch his charge skills, the skeleton master and skeleton marksman had already taken the lead. Elements explode, souls shoot, elemental attack and soul attack are launched at the same time. The thunder eagle that flew up immediately fell down like raindrops. They fell into the group of thunder trees, their bodies still carried the aura of elemental riots, and the flames after the explosion were not completely extinguished. These flames also spread to the thunder tree group. The branches and leaves of the thunder tree shook, emitting thunder light. Click. The thunder light exploded in the air, making a loud noise. Like a signal, the group of thunder trees moved their whole body with one hair, and the whole mountain range of thunder suddenly moved. Lin Moyu stood high in the sky and saw an amazing scene. He finally understood why this mountain range was called Thunder Mountain. The mountains are thousands of kilometers deep and hundreds of kilometers wide, instantly turning into a sea of thunder and lightning. All the thunder trees moved in unison, emitting thunder light all over the sky. Lin Moyu and the undead army were instantly overwhelmed by the thunder. The characteristic of immunity to electric elements allows Lin Moyu to ignore lightning attacks. But the undead army can't, they are constantly injured in the thunder. The undead army is boosted by Lin Moyu's passive skill, elemental resistance, and all elemental damage received will be reduced by as much as eight times. Even though the damage of each thunder light is not great, but there are too many, the principle of ants killing elephants is also applicable to the undead army. In the Thunder Mountain range, there are over a million thunder trees, and at least one third of the thunder trees are attacking him now. The density of thunder light is extremely astonishing, it has become a sea of thunder. Lin Moyu couldn't see anything except thunder. After Fenghua, Lin Moyu once again enjoyed the pleasure of being crushed by numbers. The undead army passed through the Sea of Thunder and headed downward. The skeleton throne appears. This time Lin Moyu changed his strategy and summoned three skeleton kings in a group of 30,000 skeletons. The skeleton king's skills have a cooling time, summoning three can activate three rounds of skills in a row, and the attack surface is larger. To deal with ordinary Xiaoshu, the skeleton king, composed of 30,000 skeletons, is enough. The three skeleton kings spread out, and they traveled through the Sea of Thunder. With their strong attributes, they were enough to survive the thunder and lightning for a period of time. The two skills of Zhanshan and Elemental Riot can carry out range attacks. They are locked at the maximum range, and each skeleton king's skills can cover a distance of 3 kilometers. When the skill is activated, all enemies within a radius of 3,000 meters will be attacked indiscriminately. The white bone sword cuts out, cutting off the thunder. A stream of sword energy pierced the ground and swept across the thunder trees. 
Countless thunder trees within the strike range were directly chopped off in the middle. Plant monsters have strong vitality, but they are not enough to kill them. Elemental riots followed, and in the bang, a large number of thunder trees were blown up by their roots. White light suddenly rose from Lin Moyu's body, gain a lot of experience with one hit, reaching level 73. Level 73, just less than half a day, from level 72 to level 73. This level of upgrade speed, Lin Moyu thinks, even his own sister, Lin Mohun, can't have it. Although I don't have the kind of talent that my sister upgraded, but as long as I kill fast, I can be comparable to talent. His eyes swept across the group of thunder trees, and he slowly spit out the eight characters, the land of his death, my heaven. Lei Shuchuan is a deadly place for others, but for Lin Moyu, it is a real holy place for leveling. In terms of high efficiency, there is no dungeon that can compare with it. The only downside is that it can only be played once. The gap is too long. In terms of persistence, it is not as good as a copy. However, the Thunder Mountain range is not the only one on the Fonglei continent. There are also some smaller Thunder Tree groups, and there are 100,000 Wind Flower groups in the air, all of which can be your own leveling targets. Lin Moyu predicts that if he can clean up all the wind flower thunder trees, he can at least reach level 76, 77. You can also harvest a lot of materials. These materials are useless by themselves, but they are still useful to the human race. Three skeleton kings, with two skills directly cleared out three areas. In these three areas, all ordinary thunder trees are dead, and only a few boss level thunder trees are still alive. The skeleton king swung his bone sword and rushed forward, beheading him quickly. Then the skeleton king braved the lightning again and rushed to the other thunder tree groups, waiting for the skills to cool down. The headless horseman has also been killed, and started a fierce battle with the thunder tree group. Large tracks of thunder trees were chopped off by their swords and killed by their roots. Lin Moyu looked at the sky and saw it clearly. Although there are only three skeleton kings, the skeleton king's attack power is powerful, and each sword can bring out a sword energy of 100 meters. With a sweep of the sword, hundreds of thunder trees were cut off, and once again, they were killed by the roots. In contrast, although there are many headless horsemen, their efficiency is far inferior to that of the skeleton king. Moreover, the skeleton king can cast a skill every minute causing huge damage, and the efficiency is even higher than that of the Headless Knights. The Leishu group is too large, and there are a lot of bosses in it. In addition, the Thunder Sea continues to accumulate damage, and even Lich General can't keep up with his healing skills. Relying on the undead army alone to clean up the Thunder Tree group is not enough. Lin Moyu took this situation into consideration from the very beginning, so he himself was not idle. Point your finger towards the sky, and the sky dims instantly, and the phantom of the undead world appears in midair. The gate of the undead opened, and the eyes of the undead emerged. In the raging flames, the eyes of the undead swept across and stared at the group of thunder trees. In an instant, a large group of thunder trees died at the same time. Even though the appearance still looks the same, without any scars, the inner soul has been obliterated, and it can't die anymore. Then the finger went down a little, and the curse of aging was activated. When facing a world-class boss or a god-level powerhouse, the effect of the curse of aging is not obvious. But when dealing with mobs, the curse of aging is still a sharp weapon. The group of thunder trees with a radius of 10,000 meters was covered by the curse, and a touch of red was added to the white fire of the thunder. Under the phantom shadow of the pitch-black undead world, this smear of red looks extremely coquettish. Lin Moyu locked onto the corpse of a thunder tree whose soul had been obliterated. Then the soul power radiated out, locking on a larger area, tens of thousands of thunder trees. When the locked number reached tens of thousands, Lin Moyu felt a sense of weakness from the soul, a feeling of powerlessness. It turns out that tens of thousands is the limit. Lin Moyu realized that with his current soul power, he could only lock in 10,000, and no amount of soul power would be enough. But 10,000 is enough. Gently press the palm, skill, corpse burst. There was little movement. 
The Thunder Tree Corpse, chosen by Lin Moyu, exploded. Immediately afterwards, all the electric trees locked by the soul force exploded. There was no flame in the explosion, but it was extremely dazzling. Tens of thousands of thunder trees were blown into pieces, and a powerful shock wave swept out, blowing other thunder trees, tottering. A few seconds after the explosion, the sound of the explosion came. Explosions continued one after another, sounding like firecrackers. None of the lay shoes locked by Lin Moyu survived and died collectively. In the Thunder Tree group with a unit of 10,000, except for the leader boss, the other Thunder Trees were instantly wiped out. But the explosion was not a wave, the Thunder Trees who were killed by the explosion became Lin Moyu's best weapon. Crisp explosions sounded continuously, one after another. After more than a dozen explosions, the leader of the 10,000 trees finally failed to hold on. Another advantage of the Thunder Tree group is that they don't move, they are simply the best targets. Lin Moyu's actions caught the attention of a large group of Thunder Trees. A large amount of lightning fell on it instantly. But Lin Moyu is completely immune to the electric element, allowing the thunder and lightning bombardment to be peaceful. Lin Moyu even wished that all Thunder Trees would attack him, so that the undead army would not have any pressure. The cooldown of Skeletron's skills ends. The two skills were used in turn, clearing away a large area of thunder trees again. The undead army, the undead stare, and the corpse burst. Under the triple attack, in just a few minutes, more than 100,000 thunder trees have been wiped out. The Leishu group probably had never experienced such a huge casualty. At this time, the Leishu in the entire Thunder Mountain range was alarmed. Even the thunder tree behind the hillside started to move. They couldn't move, and shot thunder light into the air one by one, thunder light gathered above the sky and finally formed a thunder cluster. Afterwards, the bosses in each thunder tree group exerted their strength at the same time, joined them, and the thunder group turned into a thunderstorm. When the thunderstorm fell, all thunders moved together, covering Lin Moyu and the undead army. I don't know how much thunder tree's power was gathered in this attack. The strength of the thunder light directly hit the undead army severely. Skeleton King casts absolute defense, immune to 99% damage. The Headless Horseman teamed up to launch a group defense, raising the defense force to the limit and resisting thunderstorms. Even the gate that the undead stared at was shattered by the thunderstorm. Only Lin Moyu survived the thunderstorm. Lin Moyu's men kept going, the corpse exploded, and the matinee continued one after another. After he moved the star core of the corpse burst skill into the soul, he no longer needs to be close to the enemy to cast the skill. As long as the enemy is locked by its soul, the explosive attack will pass through the space barrier and arrive directly. The scope becomes larger, the number increases, and the power is relatively reduced. Skills become more flexible and more controllable. After using Lin Moyu several times, it is already handy. It ignores thunder and lightning attacks and freely shuttles in thunderstorms. Wherever he went, explosions continued, and thunder trees died in pieces. Lin Moyu destroyed the thunder tree alone, more than the sum of the undead legion and the undead gaze. The undead army collapsed in the sea of thunder. Affected by talent, the undead army collapsed together. Life is life together, death is death together. There are only a few special cases where accidents occur, and that is when an individual suffers an extremely powerful attack. Instantly kill it, making the talent invalid. However, as the level of the undead is getting higher and higher, this situation is gradually decreasing. Less than half a second after the undead army collapsed, a brand new undead army reappeared. Three skeleton thrones appeared in the sky again and the three skeleton kings and the headless horsemen charged towards the thunder tree group again. To kill Lin Moyu, you need to destroy the undead army first. And to completely wipe out the undead army, you need to kill them five times in one minute. Otherwise, the talent will be reset every minute, the undead army will be reborn, all skill cooldowns will disappear, and the undead army will have four resurrection opportunities again. Although the thunderstorm is strong, it will take a few minutes to destroy the undead army. Lin Moyu didn't need to worry about the danger of the undead army. Moreover, 
As the battle progresses at any time, the Lei Shu group will be killed less and less, and the undead army will become stronger as they fight. The skeleton king swung the great white bone sword and swung his skills, and a large number of Thunder Tree 360s died. Lin Moyu rushed into the depths of the mountains, his body exploded and swept all the way, with no trees to stop him. In the sky, the eyes of the undead reappeared, a large number of undead flames were burning, and the eyes of the undead stared at the mountains. As far as the eye can see, Leishu died one after another, and their souls were obliterated. Less than half an hour after the battle started, Lei Shu had over 300,000 casualties. Lin Moyu's experience has soared all the way to more than 50%, and if he continues to kill, he will be able to upgrade again soon. As the Lei Shu under the two overlords of the Feng Lei continent, he never imagined that he would still be slaughtered like this. Just like Feng Hua, who has the blood god disc, she never thinks that she will be killed by others. After all, in Feng Lei Continent, who can exert god-level combat power and use a little power of law, who can be an enemy? Unfortunately, they all met Lin Moyu. Worse than Feng Hua is that Lin Moyu is immune to lightning, and Lei Xu's strongest attack method is ineffective against him. Lin Moyu entered the depths alone, as if entering no one's land. No matter how Thunder Tree attacks, it has no effect on Lin Moyu. The flames of war spread all the way, more and more thunder trees died, and the mountains were turned into wasteland. The king of thunder tree let out a roar from the soul, it was finally alarmed and woke up. Thunder shook the sky, and countless electric snakes were drawn in the air. The sound resounded between the souls, and all the thunder trees simultaneously emitted the sound of souls, resonating with their fields. Lin Moyu's eyes shrank suddenly and a thunderbolt shot towards him like a sharp arrow. No ordinary ray. This thunder is invisible to the naked eye, only the soul can sense it. Soul attack. As soon as the idea came up, the thunder had already appeared in the soul world, piercing towards the soul, like a sharp knot. It was the first time that Lin Moyu encountered a soul attack from someone else, and he couldn't think of any way to defend it for a while. He has always used soul attacks to beat others, but now he finally wet his shoes and was retaliated. The current plan is to carry it hard. The dragon soul crystal entrenched on the soul suddenly let out a dragon cry, faced the incoming soul attack, and swallowed the soul attack in one gulp. Then he continued to come back as if nothing happened, still entrenched in Qian Lin Moyu's soul. The soul attack just now was like a dream bubble, as if it had never appeared before. Dragon Soul Crystal actually has the function of protecting the soul. Lin Moyu was extremely surprised, followed by intense joy. With the Dragon Soul Crystal around and his soul intact, he can let go of his hands and feet even more. The King of Thunder Tree seems to realize that his attack has no effect, and the soul is more dense. Lin Moyu could hear its anger from between the souls. Accompanied by its sound, a large number of monsters flew up in the mountains and rushed towards Lin Moyo. As the king of the thunder tree, he can not only command the thunder tree, but also affect the monsters in the mountains. Lin Moyu quickly locked onto these monsters and used corpse explosion continuously. The eyes of the dead also swept over these monsters. Before the monsters that had just taken off could get close to Lin Moyu, they fell again and died unexpectedly. Several black shadows shot from the ground at an astonishingly fast speed, Lin Moyu flew back quickly and barely avoided it. The black shadow swept across in front of Lin Moyu, turned around in the air and drew towards him again. Only then did Lin Moyu see clearly that the few black shadows were the roots of the Thunder Tree. It's just that this time it's the root of the Thunder Tree King. Where Lin Moyu is located, there are at least several hundred kilometers away from the Thunder Tree King. In his eyes, the Thunder Tree King was just an insignificant black spot. But even so, the rhizome of the Thunder Tree King can still lock him. The rhizome of the Thunder Tree King is so long, attacking himself hundreds of kilometers away, Lin Moyu was really shocked. Lin Moyu flew in the air, and the black shadow flashed again. Then more shadows broke through the ground. The King of Thunder Tree has existed for an unknown number of years, it is over a thousand meters tall, and its luxuriant roots are even more unimaginable. 
At this moment, a large number of rhizomes came out from the ground, pulling towards Lin Moyu from all directions like a dragon or a snake. Each root diameter is more than 10 meters, Lin Moyu in front of them, like a little dot. Lin Moyu dodges, quickly. Although there are many roots, Lin Moyu is also very fast, and the range of activities expands and expands. Like a cannon hitting a fly, the rhizome of the Thunder Tree King couldn't do anything to Lin Moyu for a while. But in this way, Lin Moyu couldn't spare to attack Lei Shu. Suddenly, all the rhizomes retracted. Lin Moyu was slightly taken aback, realizing something was wrong. In the next second, the rhizome broke through the ground again, and the target turned to the undead army. Lin Moyu witnessed the rhizome entangled the skeleton king with his own eyes. The skeleton king's body was shining, and the absolute defense skill was activated. The bone giant sword cut off the root, but the root of the thunder tree king was horribly hard. It takes several swords to cut through. One rhizome has not been cut off, but several more are entangled. In the end, Skeleton King was completely entangled and unable to move. The Headless Horseman was not much better, and was also sent flying around by the rhizome. Lin Moyu could feel the message sent by Skeleton King, and was entangled in the roots so that they could not move. When the absolute defense skill time passes, they will surely die. Must, get rid of these rhizomes. Lin Moyu leaped high into the sky and rushed towards the King of Thunder Tree. The eyes of the undead took the first step, staring at the Thunder Tree King from a distance. Boom! Lin Moyu seemed to hear a loud noise, and a scream sounded from the arm of the soul. Undead gaze does a lot of damage to the Thunder Tree King. But Lin Moyu also felt the power of the Thunder Tree King's soul. The soul of the Thunder Tree King has been integrated with all the Thunder Trees in the Thunder Mountain range, definitely not weaker than any low-level god level, and even comparable to a middle-level god level. The undead stare can cause some damage to it, but it is far from enough to kill it. Lin Moyu didn't expect the undead gaze to kill it, it was enough to make it feel pain. It can be regarded as tit for tat. Lin Moyu flew over hundreds of kilometers at the fastest speed, and crossed the Thunder Sea Diameter Thunder Tree King. Only when you get really close can you know how huge and terrifying the King of Thunder Tree is. It is located on the main peak of the Thunder Mountain Range. From a distance, it looks like a mountain peak. Only when you get close can you realize that the main peak is actually the King of Thunder Trees. It is not that it is rooted on the main peak, it is the main strategy. It was completely underestimated before. It is connected with the mountains, more than a thousand meters high. The huge thick and long rhizomes are intertwined and connected into one piece, spreading towards the distance. All thunder trees are its descendants. In front of it, there are 18 world boss level thunder trees, each of which is hundreds of meters high. They didn't move, and they didn't attack Lin Moyu, who came. Their auras and the thunder tree king are one piece, their souls are one piece and they unfold the thunder barrier to firmly protect themselves and the thunder tree king. Lin Moyu felt the rich vitality from the earthen mountains. The vitality of the plant monsters was amazing, especially the vitality of the king of thunder tree. In the mountains, millions of thunder trees provide vitality for the king of thunder trees, and the source is endless. No wonder it grows so huge. If it weren't for the restrictions imposed by the laws of Fong Lake continent, I'm afraid he would have become a god long ago. If you want to kill it, you have to kill its life and soul with extreme power. Either destroy all the thunder trees and kill it at the end. Lin Moyu realized that it would be very difficult to kill the thunder tree king. But having hit here, give it a try anyway. The summoning space suddenly vibrated slightly, and the undead army was reborn in the summoning space. Under the attack of thunder tree king Rhizome, the undead army died for the second time. However, three minutes have passed since the last death, so it doesn't matter. The undead army appeared again, and the skeleton throne appeared in the sky. This time, there is only one skeleton throne. The skeleton king, composed of 100,000 skeletons, stood up from the throne with a huge aura. Glittering on the back of the hand, the strong soldier skill is activated. The skeleton king breaks through to the god level in an instant. Kill. 
With the thought of Lin Moyu, the skeleton king rushed down with a strong killing intent. Strengthening soldier's skill is still one of Lin Moyu's most important killing moves at present. Its existence can break the limits and break the rules. Obviously, the skeleton king is limited by his own level and cannot reach the god level. Whether it is the skeleton king summoned by 80,000 or 100,000 skeletons, the difference in attributes is only a few hundred thousand. And the more skeletons, the smaller the increase. It is infinitely close to the god level, but it is impossible to reach the threshold of the god level. Inexplicable laws firmly restrict Skeletron, but the strength soldiers skill ignored the law, allowing Skeleton King to reach the god level. And not just level 90, at least level 92. The Skeleton King at level 92 rushed forward, accompanied by the headless horseman who was also blessed by the strength soldier skill and was extremely imposing. Lin Moyu's eyes flashed, his thoughts raced, unfortunately, the skeleton king summoned by 100,000 skeletons is still restricted. If you don't have the strength soldier skill to break the limit, you still can't reach the god level. My rank has become a shackle, Lin Moyu once again had the idea of becoming stronger. Killing intent filled his eyes, and he looked at the thunder tree king below him. After the thunder tree king strangled the undead army, countless roots shrank back, and the mountains shook violently. Then the mud and stone rushed to the sky like a fountain, and the rhizomes also rushed up. The number of rhizomes is outrageous and inexhaustible. The skeleton king locks the root zero two stem, skill, slay god. The sword light exploded, and countless roots were chopped off. Then came the second skill, elemental riot. All the large expanses of air exploded, and the roar, continued. In the range, Lei Shu suffered countless casualties, and the skeleton king, who had reached the god level, had extremely astonishing combat power. It reached the thunder barrier, cut out with a sword, pulled out a huge opening in front of the barrier, and rushed in. The headless horsemen charged towards the thunder tree group on the periphery. They don't have the combat power of skeleton king, and they can't deal with boss. But dealing with ordinary thunder trees is no problem. Especially with the strength soldier, skill blessing, the efficiency of killing ordinary thunder trees is also amazing. Lin Moyu's eyes fell on the 18 world bosses outside the thunder tree king. To kill the king of thunder trees, not only the group of thunder trees must be destroyed first, but also the 18 world bosses must be eliminated. Each of them is around level 85. In the past, Lin Moyu would only dare to provoke one at most. If you provoke two at the same time, you should get out of the way. But now, Lin Moyu doesn't pay attention to them. There are many ways to kill them. It really is this moment and that moment. Following Lin Moyu's will, after the skeleton king broke through the barrier, he did not seek trouble with the Thunder Tree King, but instead killed the 18 world class bosses who guarded the Thunder Tree King. With the skeleton king's combat strength at this time, it is not difficult to kill them. Before the skeleton king approached, the thunder tree king made a sharp soul sound. A large amount of mud and rocks were blown away, and the thick roots were drawn straight, colliding with the skeleton king's giant bone sword. The power of the rhizome is surprisingly great, and it even knocked the skeleton king, who has god-level combat power, flying upside down, and smashed heavily on the thunder barrier. Countless roots broke through the ground, blocking the skeleton king's way. The king of the thunder tree continued to make the sound of thunder soul, the sound became more and more serious, and the whole body was shrouded in thunder. The rhizomes were also quickly covered by lightning, and all the rhizomes became lightning whips. The skeleton king called the past again and fought with it. Lin Moyu saw it and found that the closer to the thunder tree king, the stronger the rhizome. Although the king of thunder tree is not yet at the god level, it somehow managed to allow itself to possess god-level power. Lin Moyu kept analyzing, feeling that something was wrong, it was very difficult to break the rules and restrictions, and Xia Chang's methods were simply not enough. If it weren't for original rune, even he couldn't make skeleton king break through to the god level. But the king of thunder tree, even though he didn't break through to the god level, let his attack power and defense power all reach the god level. And it's not just a simple god level, it's already comparable to the 92-level skeleton king. 
Thinking of the blood god disc owned by the leader of Fenghua, Lin Moyu wondered if King Lei Xu also had something similar. In other words, it has accumulated countless years of power, which led to this result. In other words, the power of the thunder tree in the entire mountain range gathered together to make its power break through to the god level. In short, there is definitely something weird about the king of thunder tree. Lin Moyu's heart moved and the eyes of the dead in the air flew towards the distance, massacring the ordinary thunder tree. The more thunder trees are killed, the power of the king of thunder trees will be weakened accordingly. And Lin Moyu can also gain a lot of experience. Lin Moyu didn't forget his original intention, so he came here to fight monsters and upgrade himself. Taking out a drop of solidified Vulcan's blood, the soul locked on the eighteen thunder tree bosses through the thunder barrier the skills will be activated accordingly. The Thunder Tree King seemed to feel the danger and screamed. At the same time, the eighteen Thunder Tree bosses formed a defense, with the thunder light flourishing on their bodies. But it's useless, no matter how strong the world boss is, it can still block the attack equivalent to Vulcan. Even if they can't kill them in one hit, Lin Moyu can still make a second, third hit. When the skill is activated, Vulcan's blood splits, and Lin Moyu flies back at the same time. Several thick rhizomes were drawn in the air, but Lin Moyu avoided them. Lin Moyu's sole power covers this world, and he knows all the movements around him like the back of his hand. The fighting situation seemed fierce, but it was actually under his control. The flame soared into the sky, and within the thunder barrier, eighteen world bosses were simultaneously shrouded in flames. Lin Moyu heard their cries of pain. This sound is like calling for help, begging their king to save them. The Thunder Tree King pulled out a large number of rhizomes and rolled them up, and the huge force rushed over, and the flames were instantly extinguished. Eighteen world bosses have been burned half to death, and their vitality is extremely weak. The King of Thunder Tree rolled them to his side, infused with life force crazily, causing them to recover quickly. At the same time, it continues to control the rhizome to fight with the skeleton king, and at the same time, it also attacks Lin Moyu, so that Lin Moyu has nothing to do. The king of Thunder Tree is powerful in battle, and he has to save trees and kill people at the same time, so he is too busy. But it also has limits. It has no ability to control the headless horseman. Lin Moyu shuttled quickly in the air, and when he saw the king of Thunder Tree rescuing his subordinates, he gathered all his subordinates together. It's good to gather. A drop of green blood essence appeared in his hand, the blood essence of the poisonous god. Detonate. This is already Lin Moyu's third killing move, except that this move is ineffective when dealing with the demon emperor and dragon emperor, it is ineffective at any other time. Even if the king of thunder tree already possesses god-level combat power, it hasn't really broken through to the god-level after all. Lin Moyu thinks it can't stop it. The King of Thunder Tree sensed the danger again, his whole body was trembling, and the voice of his soul was incomparably sharp. The blood essence of the poisonous god was detonated. A cloud of green poisonous gas exploded from the King of Thunder Tree 067. The range of the green poisonous gas is only a few tens of meters, which is nothing compared to the huge size of the Thunder Tree King. But the Thunder Tree King let out an extremely tragic cry, and his whole body was shaking non-stop. The poison will spread into its body, flow all over the body, and make it fester. The trunk of the tree where the poisonous outbreak occurred has rapidly festered. Lightning surged from the Thunder Tree King's body, and a large amount of life breath rushed from all directions and entered its body. It tried to use the vitality of all the Thunder Trees in the entire mountain range to fight against the poison. It's useless. Lin Moyu couldn't be more clear that there is a trace of law in the blood of the poisonous god. Only the law can fight against the law, otherwise, no matter how much vitality comes over, it can only be delayed for a moment. The poison was spreading, and the king of Leyland's screams became more and more miserable. It can only delay, not stop. Strength is weakening, and life is truly threatened. Suddenly, its sole voice changed from screaming to calling for help. Lin Moyu felt its emotion and felt weird, is he asking for help? The king of the thunder tree is already the well-deserved king of the thunder mountain range, who else can he ask for help? 
Could it be that there are stronger existences in the Thunder Mountain Range? Lin Moyu's sole power enveloped the world, and he didn't sense any powerful existence. And in the lower space, the strongest is only level 89. Unless there is such a strength as Antares. But in the next second, his expression suddenly changed. A huge aura rises from below the Thunder Mountain Range. An extremely terrifying existence has awakened. Danger. Danger. The soul keeps sending vigilance. The terrifying breath was rising, and it took less than half a second to reach the god level from just waking up. Half a second later, by she broke through to the god level. But this is not the end. Level 91. 92 levels. Still rising. Lin Moyu was extremely shocked that such a powerful existence was really hidden. The breath is powerful and ancient, as if it has been precipitated for countless years. The mountain range shook, and a blue light shot out from the ground, exploded in the air, and turned into lightning and landed on the Thunder Tree King. The poison was quickly dispelled, and a trace of law inside also melted. The King of Thunder Tree expressed joy through the voice of the soul, and it was rescued. Lin Moyu's complexion changed, and he was able to dissolve the law, indicating that the other party also came into contact with the existence of the law. And judging from the opponent's aura, even if he didn't reach level 96, he was at the peak of level 95, touching the law. How can there be such an existence in the lower space? Too unreasonable, thunder and lightning flashed in the air, and a sea of thunder was instantly formed, sweeping across the entire mountain range. Lightning fell densely, the earth was roaring, and the Thunder Mountain range was constantly shaking. A flash of light happened to hit the headless horseman, and the headless horseman turned into ashes, without a sound, and returned to the summoning space in an instant. The other headless horsemen were not affected. This shows that the lightning's attack power has far exceeded the upper limit recognized by the headless horseman, and has enough power to kill it instantly. Lin Moyu was beating drums in his heart and wanted to leave, but at the same time he was curious, wanting to see what kind of existence it was. Relying on his immunity to lightning, Lin Moyu decided to take another look after thinking about it. He has activated the imprint of the ancient city of Shinxia, and he can return to the ancient city of Shinxia at any time. At the same time, the dragon scales of Antares have also been prepared, and if it fails, they can return to the territory of Antares. The space here is not blocked, and Lin Moyu feels that his own safety should not be a problem. And since this boss has been sleeping here for such a long time, there must be restrictions, and it is impossible to be unscrupulous. The mountain range moved, not a vibration, but the entire mountain range moved. The thousand-mile-long mountain range suddenly rose to a higher level. It was as if there was a giant below, lifting up the entire mountain range. Then Lin Moyu saw a giant claw. The shock in Lin Moyu's eyes is hard to express in words, it was even more shocking than when he saw Antares. This paw has six fingers, and the size of the palm alone is tens of kilometers, and counting the six fingers is more than a hundred kilometers. Lin Moyu watched it bring down a mountain. There was a flash of lightning on the paw, and then a thunderbolt fell in the air, hitting Lin Moyu with incomparable accuracy. Lin Moyu's body went numb, and huge power rushed into his body. The undead army collectively collapsed. Lin Moyu was shocked that he was injured by the electric element. If he hadn't been hurt, the undead army couldn't have collapsed. But I am obviously immune to electric elements, why is this so? Could it be the law? Lin Moyu was startled and thought of the only possibility. The electric element is still the electric element, but there is a trace of law in it. Another bolt of lightning fell, too fast for Lin Moyu to avoid it. His whole body went numb again, and the undead army in the summoning space collapsed again. At this moment Lin Moyu saw that huge paw moved and padded towards himself. Before the claws arrived, the violent wind had already blown him back. A pitch-black crack appeared in the space where the claws passed. Without even thinking about it, Lin Moyu directly activated the imprint of the ancient city of Shinxia and disappeared in place in an instant. The paw slapped the air, and thunder bursts in the air. A pair of eyes appeared under the mountains. It's just this pair of eyes, 
and there is a thunder in the ice. After a while, the ice closed again, the mountain sank again, and the claws retracted into the ground. The sea of thunder in the sky sinks into the ground, because of the bursts of thunder on the ground. Large areas of thunder trees withered and flourished alternately, and the thunder trees that had been killed all withered and disappeared without a single piece left. Then there are new seedlings grow up, full of vitality. There is both destructive power and vitality in the thunder light. The thunder tree king continued to sway, and the wounds on his body had already healed. Thick and long rhizomes spread across the entire mountain range, constantly loosening the mud and moving the king. In this way, it won't take long for the thunder mountain range to return to its former state. In Xinxia ancient city, Lin Moyu suddenly appeared in the square. His appearance was silent and did not disturb anyone. There were voices of conversation and footsteps. Sensing the familiar human breath. Lin Moyu heaved a long sigh of relief. Unexpectedly, there is such an existence in the lower space. Even the space has been broken, and its strength is very close to level 96. Such a strong control over thunder and lightning I'm afraid it is not weaker than the god of thunder and lightning back then. What is its identity? It seems that Lei Shu is just its servant, or its subordinate. I'm really curious. Lin Moyu was talking to himself, and at the same time, he was even more curious about why the opponent's lightning ignored his own immunity. Is it really because of the law? Lin Moyu found that the higher his level, the more weird things seem to happen to him. Things keep happening beyond my imagination. Lin Moyu didn't bother with this question, just wait for the opportunity to ask Antares. If he wants to think about it, he is probably just guessing and there will be no definite answer. The ancient city of Xinxia is still bustling with people coming and going. It has to be said that only the human race can have an ancient city in the lower space. Legend has it that the super-gods changed the laws of this land in order to build cities on it. Lin Moyu knew that was not the case. The ancient city of Xinxia fell from the sky, and it was because of its existence that the laws of this area were changed. There is no super-god at all. The origin of the ancient city of Xinxia is a mystery, but Lin Moyu knows that the origin of the ancient city of Xinxia must be extraordinary. At least not a product of their era, and the human race has a great relationship. When the ancient city of Xinxia first arrived, demons and dragons all came. As a result, they failed to settle in successfully. Until a person from Xinxia succeeded, so it was also named the ancient city of Xinxia. As for where the ancient city of Xinxia really came from, he didn't know, maybe one day in the future, he would figure it out. Lin Moyu didn't spend much time in the ancient city. It left the ancient city and went to the cliff outside the ancient city, where there are some teleportation arrays that can go to the wild continent. One of the teleportation arrays belongs to the Jialan Guild. Lin Moyu is registered in the teleportation array and is eligible to use it. He wanted to go to the Wild Continent first, and then head northwest all the way to the Meteorite Continent. The upgrade plan failed, and Lin Moyu was also helpless. Now the experience is stuck at level 73, and 80% is still a little short of level 74. If you can find a suitable group of monsters on the way, you may be able to complete the upgrade before arriving on the Meteorite Continent. Lin Moyu activated the teleportation array, and after tens of seconds of teleportation, he crossed the Qinglong Sea and arrived at the Wild Continent. Lin Moyu also wanted to go to the Qinglong Sea to take a look and see what was under the ice of the Qingqing grassland. But think about it or give up. After all, he has no experience in going into the sea, and he is surrounded by him now. Maybe there will be a chance in the future, and you can explore it. After arriving in the Wild Continent, Lin Moyu saw the residents of the Jialan Guild. Lin Moyu didn't sense Jialan Liaoyang's breath, knowing that Jialan Liaoyang was not here, so Lin Moyu didn't go to say hello. At that time, Jialan Liaoyang said that he might return to the human race world, and perhaps he had already returned. Lin Moyu unfolded the lightning undead wings and galloped towards the northwest. The first thing to enter is the Qingqing grassland. The sword grass on the Qingqing grassland is still fresh in his memory. Now that he came back to the old place, he found the difference here. 
He felt a faint law on the green grassland, the law is very weak, but it really exists. Qian Zhao's, this thread of law is like a big net, covering every corner of the green grassland. It is because of this law that the sword grass on the green grassland has the ability to rebound damage. The law, the law again. Many puzzles are related to the law. Lin Moyu finds it strange that there seems to be a law for everything he is puzzled by. There is a rule, which shows that there are at least 95 level peak powerhouses, and even 96 level and above powerhouses. Only they are eligible to touch the driving law. He is currently not qualified to explore. If we say that there is a huge hurdle between ordinary professionals and god-level professionals, then whether the law can be driven is the second threshold. Every threshold has a world of difference, once crossed, it will be another vast world. Lin Mayu thought to himself during the flight, strictly speaking, I haven't even crossed the first threshold. Don't be fooled by your own combat power, the focus lies on yourself. 11. Only when you become stronger, you are truly strong, and everything else is an illusion. It's not fake. It's hard, but you have to work hard. Lin Mayu shook his fist and firmly believed. For anything, only when the fist becomes bigger and harder, can it be qualified. In the Qingqing grassland, those monsters that are integrated with the earth are extremely difficult to see with the naked eye. Can use the power of the soul instead, one by one is very clear. Lin Moyu can clearly sense the breath, position, and shape of these monsters. In many cases, it is much easier to use than the naked eye. This is the relationship between the power of his soul, and the soul is enough to be released. The release of the power of the soul is also a sign that the soul has reached the god level. Lin Moyu didn't get used to it at first, but now he has gradually gotten used to it, often replacing his eyes. No wonder everyone says it's useless to hide in front of god-level powerhouses. The breath of life is too obvious. Unless it's an assassin class, and at least at the half-step god-level level, you can completely restrain your life breath. Lin Moyu's heart is like a mirror, and his analysis is very clear. He has always been good at analysis, but now his soul is strong, his energy is abundant, and his analytical ability is also good. A little thing, a little detail can analyze many situations. Lin Moyu swept across the green grassland at the fastest speed. Entered the territory of the poisonous dragon. After a long time, Lin Moyu didn't know if the new poisonous dragon had reappeared. Under the rules of the ancient battlefield, after a world-class boss is killed, it will be reborn in about three months to a year. The time is uncertain, somewhat random, and difficult to judge. Lin Moyu saw the shadows of many poisonous snakes on the ground. He killed so many poisonous snakes back then, and now they reappeared, it's just that the poisonous snakes here are too scattered. In the past, there was a poisonous spring of the dead body of the poisonous god as an attraction, allowing the poisonous snakes to gather together. If they are scattered now, it will be inefficient to kill them. Lin Moyu didn't stop and didn't encounter the poisonous dragon. According to Lin Moyu's judgment, there should be no encounters. After all, this territory is not small, with hundreds of kilometers in length and breadth, so it is normal to have no encounters. Lin Moyu's current route is exactly the same as when he first came to the Wild Continent. After crossing the territory of the poisonous flood dragon, it is the territory of the giant leaf mother tree. Lin Moyu still remembers that he was chased and killed by giant leaf mother tree, and then he counterattacked and killed him. Although he didn't kill him, he still frightened Giant Leaf Mother Tree. Now that the old place is back, Lin Moyu's eyes are full of murderous intent. The dwarf trees with giant leaves are densely packed everywhere, and there are countless at a glance. Under the induction of the soul, there are clusters of life breaths. Although the level is only in the early 70s, the experience remains the same. Plus the Giant Leaf Mother Tree. Lin Moyu felt that if he could clear this place, at least 10% of the experience would be gained. Revenge from the day before, report today. Lin Moyu was about to make a move when his soul suddenly sensed a surge of energy. There is a battle breath coming from a distance. The familiar breath is, giant leaf mother tree, as well as human professionals. Lin Moyu flew over immediately and saw the scene of the battlefield. 
A group of professionals are besieging Giant Leaf Mother Tree. This group of professionals are all higher than level 80, and the number is about 30. They are well equipped and very powerful in combat. Lin Moyu took a few glances and nodded his head slightly. The fighting power of this group of people is indeed good, but it is still a bit worse than Giant Leaf Mother Tree. If this group of people go to fight other 86 level world bosses, they still have a chance. Fighting, giant leaf mother tree, difficult. A word of difficulty has already doomed their ending. In the final analysis, it is because, giant leaf mother tree, is a plant boss. Lin Moyu knows too well about plant bosses, their vitality is much stronger than other types of bosses at the same level. Especially, the recovery ability is even more amazing. Existences like, giant leaf mother tree, can escape once they cannot be defeated. And in this territory, all the dwarf trees with giant leaves can provide it with vitality. The recovery speed of giant leaf mother tree will be astonishing. Normally, it is either directly crushed with a strong force and don't give it a chance. Either clean up a lot of giant leaf dwarf trees first. Or have special skills that can limit it. But these three conditions, the team in front of me does not have. They cannot win this battle. Lin Moyu just watched and didn't make a move. It is impolite to take someone else's blame. Lin Moyu won't do anything until someone asks for help. This team is all from Xinxia, especially Lin Moyu. It would be hard to say if it was a professional from another country. Lin Moyu will not be pedantic to talk about human race principles. In his eyes, the human race is limited to the Xinxia people. There is a saying in the previous life, even in this life, Lin Moyu still hasn't forgotten, people who are not of my race must have a different heart. The same race refers to the Xinxia race, and does not include those blonde, blue-eyed, and different-looking human races. Lin Moyu never felt narrow-minded, nor did he consider himself a saint. Just do what you think is right, that's what he thinks. After watching for a while, the battle finally came to an end. This group of people became more and more tired after fighting, knowing that there was nothing to do. One of them yelled at Lin Moyu, little brother, hurry up, we are going to withdraw, this boss can't be defeated. Aced, before leaving, recruit Lin Moyu first, which is more moral. Lin Moyu said, you guys go first, I want to kill it. The group of people froze for a moment, and looked at Lin Moyu in shock, with a clear expression in their eyes, are you crazy? Little brother, stop joking, this is a world-class boss, not an ordinary monster, you can't kill it alone. That's right, we can't kill so many people, how can you, a little guy at level 73, be able to kill you? Lin Moyu laughed, stand back, I'll show you. Overcast and windy, the sky suddenly darkened. The skeleton throne appeared in the sky, and the skeleton king was sitting on the throne. Lin Moyu was not stingy and 100,000 skeletons, directly transformed into Skeletron. Infinitely close to the god-level Skeleton King. Along the way, Lin Moyu summoned the army of the undead while he was on his way, and he had already filled up the army of the undead. Now the total number of skeletons has reached 119,250, and the number of headless horsemen has reached 39,750. The number is close to 40,000. The total number of undead legions is as high as 159,000. Once the undead army is dispatched collectively, it will definitely be a very amazing and terrifying army. Don't talk about dealing with troops of the same level, even against an army of level 80, you can win it in battle. What's more, the undead army still has immortal skills, and both combat effectiveness and survivability have reached the top level. One man is against one country, Lin Moyu, can do it. It is not difficult for him to destroy some small forces and small countries. What Bai Yuan could do in the past, Lin Moyu can do now, with ease. The moment they saw the skeleton king, all the professionals present were stunned. Is this a summon? How could there be such a terrifying summoner? The skeleton king slowed down and swung his sword, giant leaf mother tree, with a scream, half of his body was cut off directly. Huge trees scattered one after another, and then the skeleton king clenched his fist. 
Amidst the roar, the Bay Alma Mater was detonated. It was not only it that detonated together, but also a large number of giant leafy dwarf trees nearby. The two skills completely paralyzed, giant leaf mother tree, and the giant leaf mother tree was bombed beyond recognition. It turned around and fled, just like when it saw Lin Moyu, for the first time. As soon as it falls together, it will go away quickly, there is no escape. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the eyes of the dead appeared in the sky. The undead world was burning with raging flames, and the eyes of the undead looked towards the giant leaf mother tree. Giant leaf mother tree trembled all over and fell down with a scream. The soul is battered. Lin Moyu's soul locked it and detonated the Venetian bush at the same time. Amid the crisp explosion sound, giant leaf mother tree was hit hard again. Explosions followed one after another and the skeleton king also rushed forward, slashing down with his sword. In less than five seconds, the seemingly powerful, giant leaf mother tree, was killed on the spot. Kill the giant leaf mother tree, experience, plus. Obtain the giant leaf knight sword. Obtain the giant leaf long-handled hammer. Obtain the heart of the giant leaf. Giant leaf knight sword, quasi-legendary weapon. Giant leaf long-handled hammer, quasi-legendary weapon. Heart of Giant Leaf, quasi-legendary material, which can be used to create legendary equipment. Lin Moyu didn't say much, the Skeleton King dispersed, and the undead army appeared collectively, massacring the giant leafy shrubs all over the ground. A group of people were so shocked that they opened their mouths wide and looked at Lin Moyu, not knowing what to say or what to say. Senior, how did you do it? Senior, are you a god-level powerhouse who came back from deep space? Senior. In a word, Lin Moyu waved his hand, have you not returned to the human world for a long time? Everyone nodded, indicating that they hadn't gone back for many years. Lin Moyu laughed, I'll know when I go back when I have time. The territory of the giant leaf mother tree was wiped out. The experience has increased by about 12%, as Lin Moyu thought. For others, this 12% experience may require two or three months of continuous brushing and killing monsters. But for him, it was only less than half an hour. The dwarf trees with giant leaves have been cleared up, and the ground is full of broken branches and leaves. They will decay, and will soon be swallowed up by the ancient earth, which will become barren. But it won't be long before new dwarf trees with giant leaves will appear. For countless years, the ancient battlefield has long been divided into territories. Even if there are no giant leaf bushes here, monsters such as poisonous snakes nearby will not come to invade. In a few months, there will be dwarf trees with giant leaves growing here again, and the mother giant leaf tree will appear again, and the world boss will be born again. Not only the ancient battlefield, but also many places in the whole world, operating according to the rules day after day. After passing through the territory of the giant leaf mother tree, Lin Moyu almost crossed the entire wild continent, reaching the edge of the wild continent, facing the meteor continent across the shore. The wild continent is very vast. The overall shape is oval, and it took Lin Moyu nearly two days to cross the road all the way, and encountered several battles. In addition to giant leaf mother tree, several world bosses were beheaded by Lin Moyu and their territories were also wiped out. There were two times when Lin Moyu took a fancy to it and found that the monsters were dense and suitable for gaining experience. There were two times when the world bosses took the initiative to provoke Lin Moyu, but they were counter-killed. When you come to the edge of the continent, you can already see the sea. There are a lot of light spots in the sea. These light spots are like the reflection of stars, making the sea surface bright. This sea is also called Starlight Sea. The closer to the meteorite continent, the denser the light spots. The light from the sea of stars hits the sky, and then reflects back, looking dazzlingly beautiful. It complements the white light on Lin Moyu's body, creating a wonderful harmony. Lin Moyu chose a flat place, and sat down slowly facing the sea of stars. A group of skeletons appeared beside him, forming a protective net. The waves beat against the reef, making a loud noise. Lin Moyu's mind has all sunk into his soul. When I reached level 74, my soul throbbed. Lin Moyu is blessed to the soul, 
knowing that the soul has been completed and can accommodate a skill star core. Lin Moyu has already tasted the sweetness of how powerful the skill star core is pulled into the soul. Even if the degree of integration is very low, it can also cause qualitative changes in skills. Without hesitation, Lin Moyu directly started the business of moving bricks. The power of the soul rolled, and he found the skill space familiarly, and saw the gleaming skill star core. Skill star cores are like stars, big and bright, bright and dark. Each skill star core represents a skill. Before the official move, even Lin Moyu didn't know what skill a certain skill star core represented. Only when the power of the soul is completely enveloped and penetrated can one know what one's choice is. But at that time, it was too late to change again, and I felt like I was lucky. But for Lin Moyu, it doesn't matter. Anyway, his goal is to move all the skills there, not letting go of one. His path is different from others, it is very difficult. But once it goes through, it is also very strong. Lin Moyu chose the brightest looking skill star core, and the power of the soul enveloped it like a giant hand. There have been two experiences, and this time Lin Moyu has done it very skillfully. The power of the soul completely wrapped the skill star core, and then began to penetrate. The power of the soul is like a thin needle, penetrating through every hole, completely entering the skill star core, and then began a long journey of moving bricks. A piece of information came into his mind, and Lin Moyu knew what the skill he had chosen was. Summon Skeleton King. It turned out to be this skill. After mastering summoning Skeletron, Lin Moyu has made it his main skill. It seems that the existence of the skeletons in the undead army serves to summon the Skeleton King. Even the former undead army is not suitable. The main reason is that Skeleton King is too strong and easy to use. This time I happen to choose this skill, Lin Moyu is also full of expectations, I don't know what kind of changes will happen to this skill. The soul is like a giant hand that has firmly grasped the skill star core, and began to drag it out of the skill space and transport it to its own soul world. At the same time, the power of the soul is constantly merging with the skill star core. Lin Moyu feels that the handling seems to be a little more laborious than before and the binding force of the skill space on the skill star core is stronger than the previous two times. After thinking about it for a while, I understood. If the total binding force of the skill space is constant, and you have 10 skill star cores, each skill star core will be affected by 10% of the binding force of the skill space. And when two skill star cores are removed by him, the binding force is still 10, leaving only 8 skill star cores. Then the remaining eight skill star cores, on average, each have to be bound by 12.5% of the skill space. When the last skill star core is reached, it will be bound by 100%. The restraining force needs to be resisted with soul power, and the further you go, the harder it is. Lin Moyu finally understood why most god-level powerhouses only carried two or three skill star cores. It's really getting harder as you go to the back. Fortunately, my soul power is strong enough to reach the god level, and with the help of the nine-colored dragon soul crystal and the blue charm fire, it has been slowly increasing. Otherwise, Lin Moyu is not sure that he can move all the skill cores. What's more, there are three flames in the talent world, and Lin Moyu covets them even more. However, it is conceivable that they have higher requirements for the soul. At least for now Lin Moyu can't move them at all, too far away. The waves kept beating, one sound after another. It went on for an unknown number of years, and it never stopped. From time to time, creatures jumped out of the sea, and their bodies were also covered with light spots. I don't know whether it is the sea of stars that makes them like this, or they make the sea of stars dazzling and beautiful. The sea of stars can be said to be the most beautiful place in the lower space, but the beauty beneath the surface represents danger. Souls poured out continuously, although the space binding force increased a lot, but Lin Moyu's soul power increased even more. After two full days, the skill star core was finally moved out of the skill space. Without the influence of binding force, the speed of transportation suddenly accelerated. After another half day, the star core representing the skill, summoning the skeleton king, finally entered the soul. More soul power poured into the skill star core. The skill star core glistened, and the two began to fuse. 
Lin Moyu is looking forward to it, and he doesn't know how much integration will be. Naturally, the higher the fusion degree, the better, but it also depends on the nature of the skill star core and the strength of one's own soul, which is hard to say. In Lin Moyu's anticipation, the Summon Skeleton King, Skill Star Core, finally absorbed the soul. In an incomparably brilliant explosion, it regurgitated its soul power, and officially took root in the soul world. After being filtered and refined by the star core of the skill, the soul power vomited out is more pure. Lin Moyu seems to have raised the level of his soul again. The two complement each other and are mutually beneficial. Lin Moyu checked the skill star core at first glance. About one-third of the star core is rendered golden. Lin Moyu was overjoyed, it exceeded his expectations. What he was thinking of was 20% integration, which has now been surpassed. See skill changes instantly. Summoning Skeleton King, 30% fusion rate, fusion of the power of skeletons to summon Skeleton King requires a minimum fusion of 10,000 skeletons and a maximum of 100,000 skeletons. Summoning the Skeleton King will not make the skeleton disappear, nor will it weaken the skeleton's power. After reading the skill description, Lin Moyu trembled slightly with excitement again. He muttered in his mouth, no wonder, no wonder this happened. During the skill demonstration, he saw that the Skeleton King and the Skeletons coexisted. Hundreds of Skeleton Kings and Endless Skeletons fight together. But when he mastered the skills, he needed to fuse them together to summon the Skeleton King. The two simply cannot coexist. At that time, he had doubts, but at that time he thought that his level was still low, and there were not enough Skeletons to summon. Looking at it now, it turned out that the skill star core did not enter the soul. Now that the skill star core has entered the soul, he also has the same ability. The skeleton king can be summoned when the undead army is summoned. The skeleton king fuses the power of the skeleton, but does not affect the skeleton itself. Skeleton king and skeletons can coexist and even fight side by side. Invisibly, the combat power has been greatly improved again. In this way, I don't have to allocate how many skeletons to use to summon the Skeleton King, and how many skeletons are left to fight. Now everything is easy. Lin Moyu, who had been sitting for three days, slowly got up, with a smile and joy in his eyes, and flew across the Starlight Sea to the Meteor Continent Zero. In the Sea of Stars, danger is cloaked under the beautiful appearance. Whether it is from the Fon Lake Continent in the north or the Wild Continent in the south, if you want to enter the meteor continent in the west, you have to go through the starlight sea. The danger in the starlight sea is hidden in the 10,000 starlight. Lin Moyu was flying high in the sky, nearly a thousand meters above the sea. Just after flying tens of kilometers, the sea below him suddenly lit up. Originally, there were stars twinkling on the surface of the sea, but at this time, countless light spots lit up together. Immediately afterwards, countless rays of light shot out of the sea, like sharp arrows. The speed of light is so fast that even Lin Moyu can't dodge it, so he can only carry it hard. The attack power of a single ray is not great, that is, around level 70. However, there are too many rays of light, the energy converges and merges, and the attack power continues to increase. Lin Moyu's whole body was illuminated, like the brightest star in the night sky. 1,000, asterisk 5,000 pieces. 10,000, Lin Moyu kept counting, not paying attention to the light attack at all. The light is a pure light element attack, and Lin Moyu is already immune to the light element, so it is affected at all. There were more and more beams of light from the 710 office, and Lin Moyu's body became brighter and brighter, much brighter than the stars. The light comes from the starlight sea which is an area with a radius of about 10 kilometers. As Lin Moyu continued to move forward, there was no longer any light emitting from the rear area, while light continued to join the attacking ranks in the front. In an area with a radius of only 10 kilometers, there are more than 100,000 light spots and more than 100,000 attacks. Collected together, the attack power is no less than that of a level 88 or 89 professional, and it will hit you every second. Even professionals who are also level 88 and 89 can't bear it. 
In normal times, if there are professionals who want to cross the sea of starlight, dozens or even hundreds of them will do so together. If there are more people moving forward together, the attacks from the sea of stars will not increase because of this. The pressure that everyone needs to bear will also be reduced by dozens of times, so that they can get through it safely. There is no one like Lin Moyu, who crosses the sea of stars alone. Relying on her own immunity to light elements, Lin Moyu soars freely above the sea of stars. Lin Moyu looked at the sea with great interest, he thought of the dungeon he entered with Mo Yun, and got a wing of the god of light from it. At that time, it was also attacked by countless rays of light, and now it seems to be somewhat similar to Starlight Sea. As a result, Lin Moyu had a guess in his mind whether the Starlight Sea might be related to the God of Light. Lin Moyu even had the idea of entering the Sea of Stars to find out, but after thinking about it, he pressed it temporarily. Go to Original Secret Realm first, and then explore after finishing the work at hand. Lin Moyu even felt that it might be safer to wait until the strength is stronger. Regarding the matters of the gods, we still have to be careful first. There are too many secrets in this world, and with his current strength, he cannot guarantee safety. If you encounter that kind of existence under the Thunder Mountain Range, if you are unlucky, you will be slapped to death. If it is really related to the God of Light, he believes that the God of Light will not only have light elements as an attack method. Moreover, immunity to light elements is not 100% guaranteed, what if there is still a rule? As his strength became stronger and stronger, Lin Moyu saw a wider world and knew that he was far from being strong enough. It's like people who used to live in the village, the biggest world they see is the town, and they feel that being able to come to the town is the best. But when I arrived at the town, I found that there were cities, provinces, and countries outside. The world is constantly expanding, and I am also becoming smaller. Only by strengthening yourself can you truly stand on the top of the world. Lin Moyu's goal has become extremely lofty, and his limitations were completely broken after meeting Antares and Dragon God. The goal has completely changed. Lin Moyu no longer hopes that he can become a super god, but hopes that he can surpass the super god and reach the height of Antares, and even higher than Antares and Dragon God. After flying for several hours, the meteorite continent came into view. What I saw happened to be the place where it was teleported last time. No coincidence is a book, there are so many coincidences in the world. The moment he entered the meteorite continent, the attacking light always disappeared in an instant. It disappeared very abruptly. Lin Moyu keenly found that he seemed to have entered another field. It's like bosses and monsters often have clear divisions of territory among which is a small dividing line that determines two different areas. Lin Moyu guessed, if the Starlight Sea is related to the God of Light and belongs to the God of Light, then the meteor continent should be related to the God of Starry Sky and is the site of the God of Starry Sky. The two gods do not interfere with each other, and do not interfere with each other. Lin Moyu raised his head and looked towards the starry sky. Meteorites come from infinitely high places in the sky. If you want to find traces of the god of starry sky, you have to go to the sky. If you want to pursue the god of light, go down to Jingxing Guanghai. Lin Moyu has always been curious about what happened that year, and one day he will find out. He circled around the meteorite continent again, looking for, original secret realm. Last time, it started from the center and gradually expanded. This time, it starts from the edge and gradually shrinks. The effect is the same, the key is luck. Watching the falling meteors along the way, Lin Moyu also took advantage of the opportunity to harvest a few star crystals. Although I don't know what it is useful for, but after all, it contains the divine power of the god of the starry sky, and it may be useful one day. Flying around the meteorite continent circle after circle, it took two full days and two nights to fly. Finally, the original rune, on the back of the hand reacted, began to emit a faint light. As soon as the origin rune glows, it means that the origin secret realm is within a hundred kilometers. After several adjustment attempts, Lin Moyu finally determined the direction and flew over immediately. One hundred kilometers, for it, is a matter of two minutes. Soon, it saw a spot of light, which was the entrance to the secret realm. Someone? 
Lin Moyu stood high in the sky and looked down. A human professional is standing in front of the light spot, as if hesitating whether to go in or not. On the back of his hand, the light of Original Rune is also shining, and he is also the owner of Origin Rune. Through the power of the soul, Lin Moyu roughly judged that the opponent's level should be between 85 and 87. Coming here now, I guess I also want to try to see if I can keep my original rune skills. He also sensed Lin Moyu, and when he looked up, he couldn't help but breathe a sigh of relief when he saw a fellow human professional. Then it saw the gleaming origin rune on the back of Lin Moyu's hand, and there were two origin rune on the left and right hands. Surprise flashed in his eyes. It is rare for one person to obtain two original runes. Little brother, do you also want to enter original secret realm? Because of the relationship between the two original runes, he took a high look at Lin Moyu, and his attitude was more polite. Lin Moyu nodded, yes, senior too. He hummed, yeah. Then he sighed again, but ah, uh, I'm not sure at all. Lin Moyu asked, is original secret realm so difficult? It's very difficult. Since ancient times, there have been many people who can obtain original runes, but those who can retain their skills in the end are rare. Lin Moyu also knows this information even more clearly. In the recorded history of the human race, there are a total of 126 people who obtained original runes, and only three people were able to retain their skills in the end. Among these three people, two of them became half step super gods and the other fell after becoming a god. It can be seen from this that the assessment in Original Secret Realm must be extremely difficult. All the people who entered the Original Secret Realm couldn't remember what happened inside after they came out. Only the word extremely difficult was left. He didn't seem to have made up his mind yet. He squeezed a smile towards Lin Moyu. My name is Tang Sheng. What's the name of my little brother? Lin Moyu said truthfully, 1.2 Junior Lin Moyu. Tang Sheng wasn't surprised when he heard Lin Moyu's name, obviously he didn't know Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu knows that this is probably another person who practiced alone in the ancient battlefield. In recent years, he has not been back to the city, he has not been to the human world, and he has even lost contact with the outside world, so he doesn't know himself at all. There are many people who practice alone, and they are called ascetics. Lin Moyu looked at the long sword on Tang Xing's back, Senior, you belong to the Northwest Tang family, right? Tang Xing nodded, that's right, little brother, how did you see it? Lin Moyu said, I have seen Tang Jianfei, and his scabbard has the same pattern as the scabbard of his predecessors. Tang Xing laughed and said, Jianfei, I think it's been a few years since I saw that kid, and I should go back and have a look after what's going on here. Lin Moyu is sure that his guess is right, he is indeed a penance. Lin Moyu said, Senior, if you don't enter the secret realm, is it because you are afraid of losing your skills? Tang Xing looked at Lin Moyu and smiled wryly, Indeed, this skill is very important to me, if I can't keep it, it will have a big impact. Tang Xing has practiced hard for many years and has been alone in the wild. Usually no one speaks, but at this time when they finally saw a living person, they started talking more. The two chatted for a while, and Lin Moyu understood his concerns. It should not be said that it is his concern, almost everyone who gets the original rune will have this concern before entering the original secret realm. Any professional, after obtaining the original rune, can feel the help of the original rune skill. Lin Moyu often uses the strong soldier skill to kill strong enemies. Without the strong soldier skill, his upgrade path would not have been so smooth. But in the end, those who have original rune have to face two choices. One is to leave it alone and use the original rune skill to the god level. After reaching the god level, the origin rune will naturally disappear. If it cannot become a god level, then, origin rune, skills can be kept for decades until the next batch of origin rune appears. The second is to enter the original secret realm and try to keep the original rune permanently so that even if it becomes a god level, it can still be used. However, original secret realm is extremely difficult and there are very few people who can retain their skills. 
For many people, they will enter, original secret realm, Boiba, at level 89 to strive for that chance. There are also some people who will enter early, because, original secret realm, also has the benefit of two stars, which can help people become gods. Those who have entered, many people have successfully entered the god level. That's what Tangsheng thought. He's already level 86, and he wants to enter, original secret realm, to try his luck. After hearing what he said, Lin Moyu couldn't help laughing, for some things, just do your best, and don't worry too much about it. Sometimes thinking too much becomes a hindrance. Senior Tang, I have a message for you. Tangsheng asked, what are you talking about? Through the conversation, Tangsheng felt that this young man named Lin Moyu was not simple. Thinking about it, how could it be easy for someone who can obtain two original runes? And only level 74, coming here alone, made Lin Moyu shrouded in a mysterious halo. Tangsheng listened attentively, and Lin Moyu slowly spit out eight words I am lucky if I get it, and my life is lost. If I get it, I am lucky, but if not, it is fate. Tangsheng repeatedly chewed what Lin Moyu said. The tiger's body trembled, and the long sword in its hand let out a long and crisp sound. Tangsheng's aura also changed accordingly, and his whole body was like a sharp sword drawn from its sheath, becoming sharper and sharper. Lin Moyu's short words completely dispelled his doubts. Going forward, my sword will only become sharper. If I hesitate, my sword will rust and dull. Tangsheng clasped his fists at Lin Moyu, sincerely, after listening to Lin Moyu's words, I suddenly became enlightened. It's really looking forward and backward, thinking too much. No matter what the result is, I will end my penance career, go back to comprehend my skills, and prepare to hit the god level. Lin Moyu laughed, Senior Tang, go in first, I'll wait for you to come out. Original secret realm, only one person can enter one by one, if someone enters, the others will have to wait. Lin Moyu has found, original secret realm, now, so he doesn't care about waiting an extra day and a half. Tangsheng laughed, good. He led the swordsman Fungrui into the secret realm. Lin Moyu sat cross-legged outside the secret, waiting for Tangsheng to come out. It just so happened that he could also familiarize himself with the skills. After moving the skill star core of summoning the skeleton king to the soul, Lin Moyu has not officially used this skill yet. With a heart move, all the skeletons appeared beside him. At level 74, the capacity of the summoning space is also increased to 3,200. The total number of undead army has reached 172,800, an increase of 13,800 from level 73. The growth of the undead army is constantly increasing as his level increases. The increase is getting bigger and bigger, and the number of undead legions that can be increased with each level is also increasing. Skeletons alone are now at 129600. Nearly 130,000 skeletons filled an area of several kilometers to the brim. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the skill star core in his soul suddenly lit up. The sky suddenly darkened, the sky was overcast, and the world became pitch black. Only the soul fire in the skull is flickering and jumping, making the whole world even more eerie. The skills have changed. Lin Moyu looked at the scene created by the skills, almost changing the world. A mass of silver-white flames appeared in the air, and the skeleton throne, which was more gorgeous and terrifying than before, rushed out of the flames. The skeleton king appeared on the skeleton throne, and a breath of god level also permeated. Joy rose in Lin Moyu's eyes, and his skills became stronger, and more than a little bit. He used 100,000 skeletons to summon the skeleton king before, and finally got a skeleton king that is infinitely close to the god level. Now, 100,000 skeletons are also used to summon the skeleton king. Not only do the skeletons not disappear, but the skeleton king has also broken through to the god level. After the skill star core was integrated into the soul, it completely broke the restrictions of the rules. Skeleton King has reached the god level level without relying on the strong soldier skill. Big Prophet Lin Moyu looked at the skeleton king who appeared in the air, 
not through the strength soldier skill, but the skeleton king who has truly reached the god level. He is more than twenty meters tall, his whole body is surrounded by silvery white flames, and the huge white bone sword in his hand is also burning with silvery white flames. It complements the endlessly jumping soul fire in the head. Just by looking at the appearance, the previous skeleton king was blown away. I don't know if the skills have changed. Lin Moyu popped out a detection technique with his fingers. Skeleton King. Number of skeletons, 10000000. Agility, 2600000. Spirit, 2600000. Physique. 2600000 Skills, Slay God, Elemental Riot, Absolute Defense Slaying God, Physical Attack on a Single Target or an Enemy Within a Range, with a Cooldown of 30 Seconds Elemental Riot, Elemental Attack on a Single Target or Enemies Within Range, Cooldown Time, B.O. Seconds Absolute Defense, Immune to 99% Damage Within 1 Minute, Immune to All Negative States Cooldown time 5 minutes. The attribute has officially exceeded 10 million, reaching 10.4 million, which is comparable to the 90 level powerhouse who just broke through and is a true god level. The four dimensional attributes are balanced, no matter what level it is, there is no weakness. Although there is no advantage, as long as the attribute is high enough, it will not be a problem. Skills have indeed changed as Lin Moyu thought. The cooling time of the skills of God Slashing and Elemental Riot has been changed to 30 seconds, which is fully reduced by half. This also greatly improved the Skeleton King's combat power. Although it didn't say how strong the damage was, Lin Moyu knew that it would definitely not be bad. The cooldown time of Absolute Defense has also been changed from 10 minutes to 5 minutes, and the survivability has also been greatly improved. Most importantly, with the existence of the god-level skeleton king, Lin Moyu's survivability has been further improved. There is one more wounded unit. Lin Moyu saw silk threads extending from the skeleton to the skeleton king. It means that the skeleton king is summoned by 233 of these skeletons. There are 29,600 skeletons left that have not been summoned. Lin Moyu's heart moved and he used the skill of summoning the Skeleton King again. Flames danced in the sky, and the Skeleton Throne appeared. This time I used 20,000 Skeletons, the summoned Skeleton King is not God-level, and the Skeleton Throne is far less exquisite than the God-level Skeleton King. The new Skeleton King is much smaller in size, and there is no silver flame on his body, so he is obviously much weaker. The experiment is not over yet, Lin Moyu activates the Strong Soldier skill. Check the attributes of the God Level Skeleton King again. The attributes of the God Level Skeleton King have increased again, but not by as much as 200%. Each attribute has reached 3 million, and the total attributes are 12 million. From the perspective of attributes, it is almost the same as level 92, but still has not broken through to level 93. Seeing this result, Lin Moyu was slightly disappointed. Without using the Strength Soldier skill, Skeleton King reached the God level, much stronger than before. After using the Strength Soldier skill, the increase becomes smaller, and the difference from before is not obvious. It seems that the influence of the rules still exists, and I was too happy before. The skill cooling time has been reduced by half, and the actual combat power has indeed improved a lot. Strength soldiers, skills are always foreign objects, I can't rely too much on them. Perhaps after this secret realm, there won't be any strengthening soldier skills. Lin Moyu looked at the two skills on the back of his left and right hands, and said to himself, if I can only keep one of the two skills, how should I choose? Although both skills are very good, but Lin Moyu did not dare to ask too much. If only one can be kept. How to choose? Thoughts are like electricity, analyze, pros, and cons. After a while, there was a flash of light in the eyes, and there was an answer. Half a day later, the entrance to the secret realm lit up. Tang Xing walked out of the secret realm with a blank look in his eyes. It is normal to be dazed, 
and Lin Moya knows that this is true for all people who come out of the secret realm. They will basically forget what happened in the secret realm, and can only remember some fragments. Through these pieces and pieces, no useful information can be deduced. In addition, there are not many people who are qualified to enter the original secret realm. For so many years, there is almost no news about the primordial secret realm. Apart from knowing that the secret realm is extremely difficult, there is nothing else. After being dazed for a few seconds, Tang Xing's eyes flashed, and he murmured, I'm out. Lin Moyu said, How about Senior Tang? Tang Xing glanced at the back of his hand, the runes on the back of his hand were gone. Tang Xing smiled wryly, The doctor is defeated. Failure is expected. For so many years, there are very few people who can succeed. Seeing that the bewildered look in his eyes hadn't completely subsided, Lin Moyu didn't ask him more about what happened in the secret realm. I knew nothing in my heart. If Tang Xing could really remember something, he would definitely take the initiative to tell him. Tang Xing patted his head, and a sharp aura erupted from his body again, turning into a sharp sword with a handle that pierced Xu Xiao again. Lin Moyu knows that it is not a bad thing to forget everything in the secret realm. Not everyone can face up to their own failures. If you only know one result, you will be a little disappointed at most. If the memory of the secret realm still exists, and the failure process is replayed repeatedly in the memory, it will not be of much benefit to future practice. Tang Xing's aura is getting stronger and stronger, and the sword is getting sharper and sharper, which has surpassed his previous state when he entered the secret realm. Although Tang failed and failed to keep the original rune, he should have gained a lot of benefits. Tang can feel that he has become stronger, and he has greater confidence in hitting the god level. Indeed got a lot of benefits, Lin Moyu keenly sensed that Tang Xing's soul became stronger. For those who want to set foot on the god level, the strengthening of the soul is the first priority. You can have fewer skills, and you can upgrade slowly. Only the strengthening of the soul is the most important thing. With Lin Moyu's current god level soul strength, one can clearly sense which level Tang Xing's soul is at. The level before Tang Xing was 86, and the soul level was slightly weaker, less than 85. Most professionals are like him, and their souls can't keep up with the level, which also makes it extremely difficult for most professionals to become god level powerhouses. This is also the reason why there are so many false gods. Although the false gods have reached level 90, their soul strength is just a little bit worse, and they will not be able to become gods for life. But now that Tang Xing has gone through the original secret realm trip, his soul level has improved, and it has reached level 86, which is on par with Tang Xing's own level. In this way, the possibility of him becoming a god level is greatly increased and at least half of them hope to become a god level. From the changes in Tang Xing, Lin Moyu guessed what the benefits of original secret realm are, that is, to improve the soul level. Continuing to make inferences based on this, Lin Moyu guessed that the assessment in original secret realm should also be related to the soul. This kind of speculation is not without reason, but the result of a comprehensive analysis based on my own experience in the past two years and the level I have reached now. Lin Moyu said, the junior wishes the senior success and fame. Tang Xing laughed loudly, okay, okay, welcome to my Tang family as a guest, and Tang is walking backwards to welcome you. Tang Xing is not a procrastination person either, a few words are already farewell. Take out the teleportation talisman and teleport back to the ancient city of Xinxia. He has been away for several years and practiced penance for several years, but this is the first time he has returned to the city. I don't know how I will react when I know Lin Moyu's identity after I go back. There are many people who practice penance, and it is not uncommon for people like Tang Xing. Lin Moyu looked at the entrance of the secret realm, took a deep breath, it's my turn. The scenery changed, and a very pleasant and elegant fragrance floated into the nostrils. Not floral, but better than floral. It is more like the fragrance of plants and trees. After people smell it, their ears are clear and their eyes are clear, and there is a sense of enlightenment. Lin Moyu felt that his thinking seemed to be a little more active, 
and his soul became more flexible and lively. Extraordinary fragrance. Lin Moyu realized that this scent is not simple, it can make people's brains work more flexibly. As soon as his sight was restored, he saw a round of warm sun in the sky. The warm sun shines brightly, and the gentle light reflects on the body, making it warm and comfortable. The pores of the whole body seem to be opened, fatigue is swept away, and the body has reached its peak state. Strange fragrance, warm sun, the combination of the two makes everyone who enters the secret realm reach the peak state. These two points alone made Lin Moyu have a good impression of the secret realm. Then he saw in the secret place, birds singing and flowers fragrant, mountains in the distance, and water nearby. There are green grass and wild flowers everywhere, as well as scattered trees, and the trees in the distance are shady. A trail stretches to the distance, there are quaint gazebos on the road, and huts can be seen at the foot of the mountain. This scene made Lin Moyu feel familiar. The Secret Realm of the Soul of God of Righteousness Lin Moyu has seen exactly the same secret realm, which was constructed by Jiang Yi with his soul. No, it cannot be said to be exactly the same, there is still a difference. The secret realm of God of Righteousness is only similar in shape, not in spirit. There is no gazebo, no strange fragrance, no warm sun. From this point of view, God of Righteousness should have entered, original secret realm, and the memory in it has not been completely erased so he recorded some pictures in the secret realm. But why did he say that this is what his hometown looked like when he was a child? Lin Moyu couldn't figure it out for a while. I don't know what the assessment is like. After walking along the path for a while, we arrived at the gazebo. If the guess is correct, this gazebo will be the first assessment point. The assessment that Lin Moyu was waiting for did not appear until he walked out of the gazebo. The simple and vast atmosphere rushed towards Lin Moyu's heart just by looking at it. The small pavilion seems to become infinitely large, standing in the starry sky of the universe, like a giant holding a star. Even the extremely powerful gods can't hurt him in the slightest. But there are mottled marks on the gazebo, as if it has experienced a brutal battle. This is the trace left in the war. Lin Moyu was shocked for a long time, stepped into. The pavilion has the characteristics of Xinxia, or it should be said that Xinxia has the characteristics of the pavilion, just like the inheritance of culture. It does not belong to this era, nor does it belong to the previous era. Original secret realm, it is long and untraceable. Let Lin Moyu talk about it. There are also many characteristics in ancient China that can be seen in the gazebo. After stepping into the gazebo, I looked for the four wooden pillars of the gazebo but found nothing. There are no seats or tables in the gazebo, which is a bit special. Finally, on the center ground of the gazebo, Lin Moyu saw a palm print. It should be this. Lin Moyu pressed his palm up, and a suction force came, and the power of the soul got into the palm print uncontrollably. The gazebo suddenly lit up. A law silently entered Lin Moyu's body and entered the soul world. This law is extremely subtle almost to the point where it cannot be checked. If you change to another professional, you will definitely not be able to find it. Lin Moyu felt it clearly, and then saw it through his own soul. This law is flying towards one's own soul, and one cannot tell good from bad, good from evil. Lin Moyu's soul is extremely pure, so naturally, he will not allow external forces to enter. The nine-colored dragon soul crystal entrenched on the body let out a dragon chant and flew up, swallowing this law in one gulp. It seemed that after chewing a few mouthfuls, it spit out this law again and sprayed it on Lin Moyu's soul. The law after it has been chewed has become pure power of the soul. Lin Moyu feels that his soul level seems to have improved. Because I am already at the god level soul level, the improvement is not great. If you switch to a professional of another level, at least half a level to one level of soul level can be raised. It seems that this law should be the key to the memory being erased. The law is responsible for erasing the memory in the secret realm, and the soul power contained in the law is a reward for those who enter the secret realm. This is really fair, no matter what the results of the assessment in the secret realm are, you can get good rewards. If you pass the test, the memory in the secret realm will not be erased, and you will be able to bring it out of the secret realm. However, 
Those few people who passed the assessment refused to tell what happened in the secret realm. It's really strange. It is very difficult to increase the soul, and it is really good to have such a reward. Most people can't keep the original rune, and it is worthwhile to exchange it for an improvement in the soul level. Naturally, Lin Moyu would not be satisfied with this, he also wanted to keep the original runes, at least one of them. Feeling the nine-colored dragon soul crystal entrenched outside the soul, once again, deeply aware of its extraordinary. That is, it can defend against soul attacks, and it can also resist laws. With it, the safety of the soul is greatly improved. Perhaps the role of the nine-colored dragon soul crystal is not limited to this, and there are many other functions that I have not discovered. After all, it is the treasure of the dragon clan, far stronger than I imagined. Lin Moyu already knew that if nothing happened, all his memories in the secret realm would not be affected. This is true even if the rift challenge fails. 